Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to Hobby Maker. I'm Sherilyn Lavery. Absolutely lovely to have you company today. We've got a cracking, cracking show lined up for you all the way until eight o'clock. You can already see these beautiful images, can't you, that are here. Um, I know how much you've loved this collection. Not been in stock since June and it's going to be back in stock. We're going to be kicking off the show with that. But just before that, I want to give you a quick rundown of everything that's coming up today. Um, so we are here with Hayley from Dreamies for our first hour. Also back at three o'clock with me as well. We've got two completely different hours full of goodies for you um, lots of new bits as well two o'clock we have got a brand new launch from hunky dory we've got the new pocket pads that are coming up collection number five uh, lots of extras in that hour as well four o'clock they are back and we have got the brand new hunky dory tape runners now i'm just gonna just just really quickly in terms of that we're actually going to pop them straight onto pre-order for you because they are completely brand new today i know you've been waiting a long long time for these now this is your permanent tape runner Okay, there are going to be a few different options of how to get this. Um, it is absolutely fabulous. We'll have Anne-Marie on the show, who will, of course, be demonstrating this, showing you the strength of this, um, and, of course, how fantastic it's going to be for your card making um, and, and, of course, so many other bits as well. Um, easy to refill. We have got the refills as well. Um, you have got uh, 22 metres in length, so there is a great, great length with this. You can buy one, but the best way is going to be to buy a bundle where you're getting one of these and a couple of refills as well. I will let you know the price is, um, in fact, do you know, should, should we just give a quick heads up on the price? Shall we do it? Yeah? Okay, this is gonna be guaranteed for an individual one under a fiver, and I'm not talking £4.99, less than that, okay? And then if you want the bundle, you know you get deals on the bundle. So uh, how about a bundle for under a tenner with some change in your pocket? And that would be for one of these and two refills as well. They're there, they're ready for you to pre-order. Um, so yeah, I would get involved with those right now. Right, five o'clock, we are gonna be back with Creative Expressions. We've got some fabulous brand new dies that are coming up. James is here as well at five o'clock. Uh, six o'clock, we'll be coming back to Anne-Marie and Hunky Dory for another look at the brand new bit that we've had and then seven o'clock um Hayley will be back as well for the final day of crafting and again it's different stuff I, I love that that you have three hours that are all just jam-packed of totally different bits yeah I, I try wonderful. and think about it <laughs> <laughs> yeah. it's, it's just lovely because you get such a mix you know we've got from new collections to new stamps to MDF yeah new paper pads everything really that's it like the first hour is pretty much all card making kits so yeah. a lot of it you may have seen before some on really good deals some that are back in stock yeah. um second hour is all MDF uh -huh. and then third hour is brand new stamps yes and actually you can if you want a little sneak peek on Haley's desk in a moment you can see a couple of the MDFs that we're going to be bringing to you we've got the Easter basket there we've got the birdhouse that's there as well the prices are amazing again we're going to pop them straight onto the web if you want to pre-order on these you can do I honestly think that birdhouse is the best price I've probably ever seen an MDF project at so. yeah it is it's quite a small one but they're Love really it. nice for little hanging decorations yeah, yeah. obviously a little bird's not going to fit in there <laughs> but, <laughs> but for actually making it into a little decoration yes, for your so. home then yeah mm -hmm. it's it's a really easy kit to put yeah. together as well if it's your first one ever yeah and again pre-order you're going to be able to get that for under a fiver as well just to let you know um so amazing deals now we have to start with this now this is your precious puppies collection the ultimate collection is back in stock today now this hasn't been in stock since June last year so we're looking at gosh a long long time it has been one of the most popular collections we've ever seen here at Hobby Maker and you can see what it actually comes with is it comes with two of your image pads that you've got there so you get your your image pad one your image pad two I will show you the boards of these as well just so you can really see the most incredible images because this is set one that you can see just here um, and you are going to get 40 sheets within this so there's eight designs five of each of those they're just stunning aren't they they are so I would, realistic I would well. love to take credit for the artwork but we worked with an artist for the dogs uh, uh -huh. because they were so cute I was just like mm. I, I can't do better than that yeah, yeah. but we do have a full license with it so you can make and sell as much oh, as you like okay um, we, we obviously work with artists that are quite happy for that because that's yeah, really yeah. important to us uh -huh. um, but they're four by four in size and you've got a bit of a border so you can chop them down cut them out in right. circles things like that if you want but yeah eight dogs in each pad as well so completely so different so this one is the Alaskan um, Marmalute, is Malam that how you pronounce Malamute. That? Thank you very much. <laughs> you can tell that I'm like, oh, what's this one? Uh, we've got the Samiad, we've got the Corgi, we've got your Blue Tick Coon 
Greyhound. We've got your Anatolian Shepherd, your Spaniel, your Husky, and your Havanese in this one as well. Then let's come across to set two because you're not even just getting one. So again, you're getting another eight designs that we can see here, five of each of these also. Um, you've got your Bedlington Terrier, your Giant Schnauzer, your Finnish Lappand, your Basset Hound, German Shepherd, your Golden Doodle, Irish Setter, and your Dalmatian. By you writing them on the back, you've made me look like I'm dog expert. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not an expert like that either. I was just like, oh, I'll, I'll name these. It just makes it easy. Plus also, if you've got a dog at home and you go, that's like my dog. Exactly. But even if it's not like your dog, but it looks like it, it might not be the same yes, breed. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't matter, does it? Yeah. But when you think about making these to maybe to sell for rescues, mm -hmm. for charities and 100%. stuff, you're welcome to do that. But also, if you can make money for yourself, you're welcome to yes, do that yeah. as well. Yeah, um, but it's just a really nice collection. It, it works for a, it works for male cards as well, yeah, especially the colour palette. It's not too girly. No, no, <laughs> it can no, work across the board. Yeah. And for all different um, sort of occasions as well. Which yeah, is really yeah, absolutely. It. But you're not even just getting that, OK, because you are also getting two of these incredible paper pads as well. So you can see them laid out just there to kind of show you the designs of these. So you are getting um, that, that lovely vintage teal full collection that we've got there and your nostalgia. They're eight by eight. It's always very popular on their own as well. Um, 48 papers within each of these. And you can see an amazing array and, and sort of mix of, of, um, of these as well that we can see. I mean, the, the samples are fabulous, aren't they? There's just so many beautiful looks. I can give you a quick flick through, of course, some of these pads as well, because um, all of it double-sided also. Yeah, so you're getting 48 sheets in each of those paper pads and they're 120 GSM, yeah. so they're a nice weight for them mm -hmm. doing your back, back, back in papers, doing your flowers. Yeah. They'll hold your creases really well. But again, you've got that sort of brown, grey mm -hmm. sort of undertone there, but then them pops of colour with the lilac yes. and the pink. So if you do want to use them for mail cards, you've got plenty of patterns in there that are just generic, but then you've got your florals if you want them. It's fabulous, isn't it? It's absolutely, it was almost like, which side am I going to use? Yeah. <laughs> so that's the first one. Then we've also got vintage teal that you can see, of course, just here as well. Um, and I love that you've almost got the polka dots, you've got the stripes, we've got, like we said, the florals that are kind of coming through. Lovely muted tones on some, but then some feel very spring-like. Yeah, absolutely. And they work really well, like you say, for spring cards, mm. but also if you're toning them down, maybe making them a bit more autumnal, yes. it'll work across the board all year round. Definitely. Um, so this is the full collection. So this is two paper pads and, of course, two of the image pads coming to you. And not for that price. Yes, that's what you were paying if you were getting this individually. But we're going to take it even lower and just have a look at the kind of things that you could actually create. I mean, I'm, I'm just, just picturing this on a craft stand. It's going to be the one I think everyone's eyes going to be drawn to. Yeah, absolutely. And then if you've maybe got something... <laughs> I was just going to say that, Laura. <laughs> <laughs> If you've got um, lettering or something on your stand, you could mm -hmm. do them personalised. Of course you And could. especially with the dogs, if you know someone that's got maybe an Alaskan Malamute, yes. which Andy has, the Andy uh -huh. Love. Yes, yeah, yeah. Um, you can make it um, tailored to them, can't you? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Today, under £30. That is for the full collection, OK? So that means you are getting everything. You are getting 80 of the images. You are then getting, of course, two of the paper pads, 48 pages in each of those as well. And I can imagine so many of you who, you know, might have bought it in June, I think, and I want it again. People who missed out then, um, this is your opportunity and your chance to be able to get this as well. Um, and like you said, because there's multiples of each image, I love that you could, you know, decoupage these. You could layer yeah. them up. You can slip into them. You can do anything you want, really. Yeah, that's it. And they're really quite easy to cut out as well. They've kind of got a little white glow or a brown glow, yes, depending yeah. on um, the type of dog. And uh, so you can just fussy mm -hmm. cut around it, yeah. layer it up, or completely cut it out and then layer it onto a completely different background Definitely. if that doesn't work for you. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So um, fabulous opportunity for that full collection at that price. There is also the opportunity, if you want to, to just get the image pads. So if you're thinking, well, I just want the dogs, rather than having the paper pads as well, we can do that. It's always nice to give you uh, the other opportunities as well. So this will mean that you will be getting um, your Precious Puppies Set 1, as well as your Precious Puppies Set 2 as well. So 80 images. I love their 4 by 4s as well, because I feel like small cards are very niche at the moment. Like everyone loves this sort of size. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. So if you are just literally putting that onto maybe mm. a 5x5 five five card, that's a bit good. of background, yeah, 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 that's all you need to do. But then equally, if you're doing an 8x8 eight eight card, that's still going to be a substantial yes. size in the middle there. Yeah, absolutely. Um, so such a mix across both of these pads that you are getting. We'll get the price straight in on this. Lots of you already on the phone lines for it. Um, wow, 15 99 for both of those as well. Yeah. Gosh, both deals are just brilliant, aren't they? So <laughs> it's totally up to you. Which way do you want to go? Just the pads or do you want all of this as well? Should, should we have a look at a demo? Yeah, of course. Yeah. 
Right, so we're going to make this oh, card then that. first. Mm -hmm. So we're using the teal sort of colour palette from yep. the collection there and obviously using that little Alaskan melon. Mm -hmm. I think he's got to be my favourite. Him and the Siberian Husky, but only because we've got a half Husky. Okay. So <laughs> yeah. that, it's the nearest I've got. <laughs> a Husky, yeah. not um, a half Husky. <laughs> um, yeah, so we'll get started then. So I'm just going to start by layering up the image, I think, and we'll, we'll start with the card because card kits are super easy to use. You've not really got to think about them. They're yes. all coordinated. You can just dive straight in and get all your papers together. So we've got an 8x8 eight eight card here and then I'm just going to add some of my pattern paper onto it. Mm -hmm. So just using a little bit of glue there and we're just going straight in with those florals. It's beautiful isn't it? So I'm just centralising that. Mm -hmm. So then we've got just a plain piece of craft card just to pop on the side because I think it really lends itself to a bit of additional card stock as well. Yes, you know the yeah, browns yeah. really work with it. So again, a little bit of glue just on there. So that's just popping towards the right hand side of the card. It's almost a shame to cover up the patterns, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> that's the thing. So obviously where I had um, this pattern on the back, that is what's on the reverse. It's sort okay. of like a, a muted tone. Mm -hmm. So we're just gonna curl up these corners a little bit and just give them a little bit of dog earring. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so that is then gonna pop on this side of the card then. So just popping that to the side there. So then we've got our dog image then as well. So what I've done is I've just cut out a square of the mm -hmm. sort of teal colour there in one of the patterns and we're just going to layer him up on that. Yep. So it's again a shame to pop this dog down, isn't I know, it? No, that's the thing. Isn't it? <laughs> so just layering him onto there or her. And then we've got a, just a white piece as well, just to frame it. Because obviously if I put that on there, it's not as, it doesn't stand out quite the same as them with the little pop of white behind. Yeah. It's so just those little extras, isn't it? That kind it of is, yeah. Just add, I think, to the card. That's it, because sometimes you put it on and you're just like, oh, that doesn't pop how I expected it to or wanted it to. Yeah. So we've got our main image there then, and I'm just going to add, before we stick them down, some of the natural size. So this is in your ultimate bundle or your essentials. Brilliant. So just eking that out a little bit and then we're just going to attach that just to the back using a bit of hot glue. Mm -hmm. So little dabs of that all over. And then I'm just making sure that I push it out to the side so that we definitely see that as it's stuck down. Yeah. Making sure that that is secured in place and not on my fingers. <laughs> so then we can just make sure that pulls out a little bit further and we can definitely see that when we attach it down. Mm -hmm. So just because we've got that additional... Um, sort of texture on there. Yeah. I'm just using hot glue just to set that so that it doesn't move about. You can use your foam pads if you prefer or you can use normal glue just obviously you'll have to hold it a little bit mm -hmm. more in place. Yeah. So then we've got some flowers that we're going to make so we're going to use the sensational flowers for this. Okay. So I've die cut some of these out just from our vintage teal again. So mm -hmm. I've got some that are spotty and then some in that damask as well. So I've got three of um, a larger size and then one smaller one that's just going to pop in the middle there. So I'm just going to give these a scrunch up. So I'm just going to line them up and then I'm just going to literally scrunch up these petals. Just giving that a good crunch mm -hmm. and just it's going to add plenty of then dimension to them as we offset those petals. Yeah. So just going straight in and crunching those up and then we're going to do the same with all of these ones as well. So just giving those again a good scrunch up and now obviously because we're doing them all at the same time they're creased in the same way Yes. Yeah. so I'm going to then rotate them as we put them together so we get a different crease all the oh, way nice, around. Okay. So then just finally with this little one mm -hmm. and then I'm just going to grab my foam mat and then one of my ball tools as well. Okay. So just layering up the three larger ones initially. And with that die set, it just makes it so easy to actually form them flowers, doesn't it? It does, definitely. So obviously you get stamps as well in the set. Just use the dies here, but they work really well whether you do your stamping first or whether you wanted to just use your dies as yeah. well. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's a lot easier with the dies just because it's quick. Yes, um, sure. But if you are stamping and die cutting, then obviously it just takes a little bit longer, yeah. but it is, it's a really nice effect yeah. once you've got that on, especially if you maybe do it in heat embossing or something Ooh, like that. Yes, lovely. So we've got kind of like a scrunched up little... Mm -hmm. Almost, I would say carnation, but probably not really a carnation <laughs> at all. <laughs> I do know what you, yeah, you mean. It's just, it. yeah, scrunchy. <laughs> <laughs> so then just doing the same with the spotty ones as well. 
So then just press in as we go, just with that ball tool in there. Mm -hmm. So then we're just offsetting, making sure that we fill out that flower as much as we can. And then just pop in the smaller one in the centre, just because it gives it a little bit more of a close at the end. You know, like yes, it's yeah. not just completely open in the centre, that sort of fills it out a little bit. So we've just got those flowers there and then I just pre-made a little one just as well for the um, card lovely. as well, a little yeah. bit earlier. So we're just going to pop the damask one down here on its own, I think. And then we're just going to go for two then in the opposite corner. Now, a lot of the time it is, um, if I say preferred, I think it's just more recommended mm -hmm. um, yeah. to do it in threes or odd numbers with flowers. But sometimes okay. I do just stop after two. Yeah. Sometimes it's just like, oh, that looks fine to me. <laughs> yeah, I don't mind. <laughs> I think it's just a gardening um, technique, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So in the um, Sensational Flowers as well, you do get a leaf die. So you get a matching stamp, obviously, mm -hmm. that cuts out. But then I'm just going to chop up all of my leaves. So I'm just going to chop those off, and then we're just going to give them a bit more shape so that they are full leaves. Yeah. And just make sure then that they look smooth on their edges, but then we can pop these into our arrangement as well. Mm -hmm. So just chopping those off at the stems, see how many we need. And then I'm just going to use my ball tool again, just mm -hmm. on the reverse of them, just to give them a bit more dimension, a bit yeah. of shaping, so they don't look as pristine, especially because we've got scrunched up flowers. Yes. Yeah. don't want them to look like they've not been through the mill like the flowers have. <laughs> so then obviously just using this on the reverse, just because that's the way that then we want to um, mm -hmm. have the little bevel almost. And then I've done some in craft card as well, just so that we've bring in that um, layer back through that we had originally mm -hmm. and obviously when you're layering craft card on craft card it doesn't always work so when I'm going to layer around here I'm going to use my white ones yes yeah yeah and just have that variety so I'm just using my smallest one just so that I can get in all the little nooks and crannies of my leaves mm -hmm. but if you did want to you have got um, four in the ball tool collection so you can use your larger one if you okay. prefer so we will start to add in our leaves then. So I'm just going to go for a couple of white ones in first, I think, just under this side here. Mm -hmm. Go for a couple of larger ones and just pop that into there as well. And then we'll go for a couple of craft card ones as well, just to add that extra in It's just there. so beautiful, but it, it's that central image which is so striking, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, absolutely. The embellishing is just like the add-on really, it. isn't yeah. it? Yeah, <laughs> it's just the fun bit. Mm -hmm. So again, just a little bit of the white leaf in there. And I think we'll go for a craft card on the top of craft card. It'll still show up. Yeah. Pop that one in there as well. So then I go for another few in with this flower. Mm -hmm. And then another white one I think as well maybe a little one just in there and then we've got two more little brown ones they'll be fine just to then pop in the top there and then we can start to add in some of our brown moss as well yes mm -hmm. so just bringing in all those embellishments yeah now with the moss you do get um you've got the option of all the colors or just sets of three or four mm -hmm. so the one i'm using is the essentials or you do get all of those in your mixed mosses as well mm -hmm. so we'll just add in little bits of moss then just into anywhere that you still think looks a little bit empty yep. mm -hmm. but the danger of this is you never stop i, know. <laughs> I like that i'll have a bit more I'll have yeah a bit more. well i'll put a bit more in there <laughs> I suppose it's healthier than maybe some other things that we were talking yeah, about food earlier. <laughs> healthier to keep going with your moss. More moss than more. <laughs> <laughs> so then just a final little bit, I think, down there. And what I always love about your cards is that there's so much that you do and add to them, and yet they're so quick. Yeah, the they're so time. quick. And you also find then sometimes you miss it. So you look at it again and you go, oh, I didn't see that the first time <laughs> round, because there's so many layers yeah. and little bits and bobs on there. So I'm just adding mm -hmm. three of my Ultimate Pearls. So I'm using the browns. Super. And I've just got my pickup tool as well. Favourite tool in the world. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. It makes it easy. Uh -huh. I don't know how I coped without... No. Okay, I used to, I used to literally just like my finger and pick them up and hope it dropped right. off like that, <laughs> it <would just> fall off <laughs> and it never would. <laughs> yeah, it's such a great tool. 
So then I'm just going to pop another three up here and then we mm -hmm. can just finish off with our sentiment. Okay. So just pop in these. Oh, I can't turn it over. There we go. Perfect. And last one on there. And then I'm just using the happy birthday from our everyday sentiments. Mm -hmm. So I'll give that a quick stamp just onto a little bit of white paper. So I'm just going to stamp it in grey. I have got one stamp, but just so you can see how nice the little font yeah. is there. So then all I've done with this is just then mm -hmm. cut it out. Really nice. And then I've just laid it onto a bit more craft card, obviously just tying that in again from where we were with this um, base over here. And then I'm just going to attach that. I'm going to go for a little bit of hot glue just to try and raise that up in line mm -hmm. with our original panel and then pop that onto there that is so great and then oh, there we go it. yeah it's phenomenal i just think there's so much detail to that so much dimension and all of all of those bits you've used just work so well together don't yeah you? that's it especially like the color palette as well really makes yes. it easy because mm -hmm. i've not had to think at all everything just matches yeah yep. all i've bought in is the craft card there yes. <laughs> so a fabulous discount of course on the whole collection of the precious puppies do remember that it does mean that you get both of the image pads so you are going to get this one which includes all of these incredible puppies they're four by fours you're getting 40 sheets within this as well eight designs and five of each of those designs also you get your set two so it might be that you have a favorite dog or a favorite puppy or you might be thinking of your friends and wanting to personalize great for animal charities as well but then this also comes with two of your pads as well so you are getting your vintage teal um, which just has such an amazing array you can see that lovely uh, floral one that Haley just used just there but you've got the scripting you've got the almost the polka dots that we can see coming through this as well um, um, really stunning images, lovely colours of the teals um, on all of this. We then also have coming in this, the Nostalgia collection, um, where you've got, it, it feels very vintage still to me, it really does. It's It's got the most lovely colours from those kind of purples to those pinks, those peaches, you know, very damask, very, um, it just, just kind of entices you, doesn't it? Very sort of magical almost in many respects, with the polka dots that we're seeing there as well, so lots of different images in that. So all of that comes to you remember the other option to get this collection is to buy um, just the images so if you're thinking well actually I just want the images we've got those down at a discounted price of £15.99 today um, which means you can get both of the pads so you are going to get 80 sheets all together you've got oh such an amazing array I mean that, that corgi that we're seeing just there it's just, just calling out to me the spaniel as well the husky um, the basset hound the German shepherd uh, the golden doodle the Irish setter the Dalmatian as well at the bottom just there so wonderful images that we can see now I'm just going to look at a few other bits that Haley used of course in that demo so if you wanted to create the same card you can do now those flowers which just came together so quickly um, was just using this wasn't it so you it just was, used yeah. the dies but as Haley mentioned it also comes with the accompanying stamps which I love to get it where they just match perfectly together so you've got the leaf as well as all of those flowers yeah they're, they're really big sizes aren't they they are yeah so if you're thinking maybe for your home decor that's a really mm. nice idea you can also run it through from fabric yep, so if yep. you are doing applique or anything like that yeah I mean the leaves as well with the lines on there for shading yes, and stuff like that is really nice if you do like to colour and yeah. also the one with the stripes on there if you layer up a few maybe on really dark red mm -hmm. paper it'll look like a poppy oh yeah so when it comes around to November again that'll be really yeah, handy yeah. but also I mean I like poppies anyway I do yeah. I just love them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, so you are going to get both of these so you are getting the stamp and die set not for £32.99 today it, 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 this is basically an outrageous deal, £10 each instead. So we're talking £20, OK, for the dies and the stamps that you've got there. And we know flowers are some of the most used imagery that you ever have across everything, really, every season, every occasion. So I think you will use these and use these and use these. And they are there at £19.99 for both of those. Well, well done. Um, lots and lots of you coming through and, and getting those. So massive well done to you. Now, the everyday sentiments that were always used... I feel like we've just covered the most essential sentiments that you'd use the most really within this. Yeah, that's it. And they're not a massive size either. So no, if you're doing nice your size. six by sixes to your eight by eight mm -hmm. cards, they're still going to be a nice size then. It's not overpowering, but it's just like, oh, yeah. here's your sentiment. Like, just pop uh -huh. it on the side. 
But yeah, yeah it works across the board, obviously. They have and every day. You get a little butterfly as well. So yeah. not only you're with love, happy birthday to a special friend, have a lovely day just because, just for you and thank you, but a butterfly coming to accompany it as well. Um, and not, not $12.99, going to be an under a tenner deal yeah. today. Um, absolutely brilliant. And I just think it's got such lovely kind of fonts there as well, you know, the differences of all those fonts that we're seeing. Um, and just because we talk about this on the show a lot now that we feel like you should do more cards that are a just because. Yeah, it's not for a reason. No. It's just because I was thinking of yeah. you. Just because yeah. I wanted to craft. Exactly. Yeah. It just picks you up, doesn't it? If you get something nice like that. Um, so under a tenner for you to be able to get all of those stamps that we can see just there with, of course, the butterfly as well. So all of those coming to you for a fabulous price point. Um, well, well done if you've got them. Um, we've got to mention, of course, the pickup tool. Oh, <laughs> we yeah. can't not. Can we? <laughs> um, so this pickup tool, as I say, I, I can always remember the first time we did a show together and I was like, this is brilliant. <laughs> and, and it basically just transforms um, everything that you do because it makes it so easy. It's still 5 99 Yeah. <laughs> I felt like I'd been off for quite a long time, so I was thinking, price must have gone up. <laughs> no, no, no. Um, and with this, you saw, obviously, Hayley, where you just pop it onto your gemstones and it just picks them up perfectly. It does as well ensure that you get them in the exact place that you want. Um, it, it, and is it something you'd say, once you've got this, it just lasts? Yeah, yeah, it'll well, last for a, a long time. Yeah, you can just um, wipe over the nib. If it starts getting yeah. a little bit gummed up, you know, you've got a bit of embossing powder on it mm -hmm. or glitter. Um, just wipe over it with a bit of warm, soapy water. Yeah and it'll um, come back. It's, it is just wax, so it's not really yeah. a stickiness that, to it. No, it's yeah. just a natural pick up with it. Um, but it will work as well for sequins, like you're saying, yes, seed yeah, beads, yeah. obviously gems that we've not really done much mm -hmm. gems, but um, pearls definitely. Yeah. And mm -hmm. on your other end as well, you have got a repositioning tool. So if you um, want to just knock it back in place, you can do that as oh, well. Brilliant, okay, perfect. So uh, that two in one, and then it just looks so great as well. That's the other yeah. thing I love. It <laughs> looks very kind of classy, doesn't it? It's very sleek, it's very um, cheap to be able to get this. And five pounds and 99 for you to be able to get that today, which I think every time you come to your pearls you are going to be using this uh, it, it, it's brilliant you're going to be using it like you said with your sequins it, it's great to reposition it's great to make sure that you're not dropping them in the wrong places and it's such a steel deal whether you want it for yourself or to gift this at that five pounds 99 price point um, so well done with that we've also got the moss that you used now we do have a big bundle which is where you're going to get a real array of colors if you want to get to them so you'll get all of those colors it, it's when i feel like you actually get this out and you feel it as well and you you realize how far it actually goes yeah that's it so you're getting 10 grams mm. of each color yeah but that's it when you look at it it doesn't necessarily look loads but mm. you open it up and it just really yeah. keeps expanding uh -huh. and you saw I've used very minimal mm -hmm. in my arrangements and obviously you don't have to use it on every card but if, no. if it matches your project it's a really nice addition it there. is yeah definitely you can get all 10 of these colors if you want to so 10 grams in each of these bags 10 colors that are coming to you you can see this lovely mix of colors and um, that really will work depending on what papers you're using depending on what dyes or paints or anything like that as well um, and of course a great price tag today not going to do 29.90 we'll get that right right down for you lovely greens lovely beiges you can see the pinks that we've got as well um, it, it's nice generally as we, when, when we come to our sort of mdf and things like that it works really well with with mixed media doesn't it yeah well absolutely i mean if i just show you this little bird hat yes yeah yeah just along the top just because there's a join in the um, mdf obviously mm -hmm. where your two mdf panels meet i've just covered it in moss and because it's yep. kind of a natural sort of project, it's something that'll be outdoors, mm -hmm. just kind of works and it doesn't yeah. look out of place or anything like that. And then obviously you see going in at flower arrangements and stuff like that, it, it kind of makes your cards mix media without being too scary. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's true in an easy way. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> something everybody can do. So all um, 10 of those colours at £19.99. So you're looking at £2 a bag today to be able to get them. Now, we have got another card making kit, which is completely brand new today. Um, so if you absolutely loved your puppies, would you like some cats as well? I would, yeah. Um, it, it, it's just fabulous. I feel like whenever we kind of bring anything that is sort of puppies, dogs, cats, everyone just loves them because I think yeah. the imagery that you get yeah. and the fact that it makes you smile, doesn't it, when you see something like this, I think. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, cats and dogs, obviously, they're the most popular pets in the yes. UK. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but everybody does, oh, I say everybody, most people love mm -hmm. animals. So uh, to have something with a cat on, even if you're not a massive cat lover, it's still cute. Yes. It's still, you yeah, go, yeah. oh, that's nice. Mm -hmm. So it does work, again, across the board for a lot of different occasions. Definitely. Look at those images again. I mean, they, they look like they're actually 3D, like they're jumping out because yeah. of how well they've been sort of drawn and designed. Yeah, absolutely. So it's the same artist 
policy that we worked with for this. So you've got the yeah. same um, up the um, angel policy, so you can yeah. make and sell as much as you like with them. Um, and yeah, just really striking, really cute as well. Mm. And a good range of different, I can't tell you I know the breeds of cats. <laughs> no, <not laughs> I love cats, but I'm not like an over the top yeah. cat person that yeah. knows everything and mm -hmm. I wish I did yeah. but they're just cute to me I just like they cats are, aren't they? they're, they're lovely and their eyes almost look like they're actually looking at you as well with the the imagery that we've actually got just there now is it 40 sheets once again that comes it is, in this yeah. pack so it's the same so we're getting 40 sheets of them and um, getting all of those different images so eight different images um, with five of each of those oh I love him yeah <gasps> oh my gosh he just looks so cute so small yeah he? <laughs> he's um, got really chunky legs hasn't he yeah. <laughs> so I see one of these cats and that's my favourite. Yeah. Like, oh, this is my favourite. Now also alongside this, which will match perfectly, you're going to get this, which is your velvet whisper pad. Um, and you can just see that, oh wow, the images that you are actually going to get um, on this that will work with those cats. You can see from the colour that we've got, uh, the lovely florals. Once again, they're all double-sided. And I love it's more muted to more patterned as well. Yeah, again, so you've got that same sort of idea there with you have got your browns and grey sort of mm. tones coming through, but then those pops of purple and almost like a burgundy I would say yes, as well yeah, yeah, yeah. but because there's two sort of tones of purple you can really throw in a lot of different purple so even Absolutely. if you've not got card stock that perfectly matches mm -hmm. you'll see like the card that I'm going to make it doesn't match perfectly but because there's that many purples it just doesn't just matter yeah. Yes. yeah 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 absolutely um, and you know what we're going to be taking it lower it's completely brand new today at 20 pounds that is fabulous when you think that you are getting a whole paper pad okay and then on top of that you are getting the image pads as well but it's not even taking one or two pounds off is it no no <laughs> launch price always love a launch price so 12 pounds 99 for you to be able to get this today um it is it is going to be exceptional same size as these four by fours as well that are coming to you um all 40 of those with those fabulous matching papers that will work so so well with it should we have a look at uh, a demo just to let you know already over 10 percent of this has gone um so do be quick of course if you want to get it oh i love that yeah so what i was saying just yes. then about the purple so this is in our wow. assorted cardstock collection, mm. but it's not quite the right purple, okay. but it, <laughs> yeah. it works still. You know, it's because there's the three tones of purple, Definitely. it just doesn't really matter. It looks Ooh. so expensive, you know, because purple yeah. is often, you think of regal, you think of yeah. expensive. fancy yeah. chocolate. Yeah, yeah, very true. <laughs> um, but then we've also got the brand new postcard stamp in there as well. Yes. So just as a nice little embellishment, mm -hmm. doesn't necessarily match, but it's just something that you yeah. can pop on there and it works really mm -hmm. nicely. So first off then, we'll do um, the layering up, kind of like we did with mm -hmm. the card um, before. Brilliant. Just because it's so simple with a card kit, because like I say, I don't have to think about it at all. Yeah. So first off then, I've got, it's a 17 centimetres. That's helpful, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Probably about a seven inch card base there. It might be slightly smaller. And then just using a bit of this purple card stock as well. Just a quick heads up as well in terms of the amount of you that are coming through for this. 40% um, of the stock has been allocated now. We've wow. actually got more of you looking at this collection than we have availability. Okay, so there's more of you sitting with this in your basket. So it's all going to be about the first people to check out on the web, on the phone lines. Um, we knew it'd be so popular. As soon as you see them images, you just want yeah, it. Yeah, so absolutely. Well done if you're quick on this. So just to change it up a little bit, I'm just <laughs> roughing up the edges of my paper, just using my scissors. Okay. Now you can get an actual tool that does this that isn't quite as precarious as doing it with scissors <laughs> um, which I'm sure you'll find on the website I think it'll be um, creative expressions product okay um, a distress tool mm -hmm. um, yeah so that'll do the exact same thing and it's not at the risk of you slicing your hands <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> safer. so then I've got my spotty paper as well so I've mm -hmm. done the same thing and roughed up those edges a little bit and just popping that glue on there and then sticking this down the side Amazing. So then I've got a strip of the purple as well that's going to go across the centre. But then just to hide any workings for my ribbon, I'm going to attach this and then um, stick it down on the reverse. In fact, let's go for glue in the middle and then our image will cover that. So just add a little dab of glue. So that doesn't matter that you can see it because the image will be over the top. Mm -hmm. And again, a little dab of hot glue and then we'll just fold that over as well. Super. And then the same on this side. So just popping that over there and then just so that we're not sticking a load of excess ribbon down, we'll just trim this off. So then this is going to then just pop across the centre there. So I'm just going to go with a bit of hot glue just again because we've got that ribbon on there. 
I would use my um, normal glue at home, but yeah, just for speed. So then again, we've got our cat image that's just gonna pop on the top of there. So we've done the same sort of thing, roughed up these edges on the cat, so you can just do as much or as little as you like. You can do inking if you prefer. Yeah. Anything you've got in your stash, you can throw at this because it's all uncoated as well. So if you want to heat and boss on the papers, you can do, it all takes really easily. Oh, this looks and so And then nice. just again, just onto a piece mm -hmm. of white again, just to make those colors pop a little bit yeah. more. So then that can pop into the center then of our card. So I think we'll go hot glue again, just to raise it up. So we'll pop that to the side there. Mm -hmm. And then for our arrangement then, so we'll stamp out that little postcard. So in yeah. the set, you do get two. So I've just got it to one side for me here. Brilliant. Oh, so you get two in the set. So they're yeah. kind of like a little um, textured sort of um, postcard. It's got like little scratch marks, a couple of butterflies on there. Yeah. So just really easy to use there. So I've just got my smallest one in the um, in the kit. Oh, there you go. You can have this one. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so then just going to stamp this one out. Mm -hmm. There we go. So just ink that up, just using a grey. So you can see I've stamped that onto yeah. the pattern paper. So mm -hmm. you might not be able to see it too well, but when you actually see it up close, you've got all the little script on there. It's yeah. a really nice little stamp to use. So then I've got one just to cut out. So I'm just gonna leave a narrow border mm -hmm. just so that then we can rough up these edges again and just really make that into a little embellishment in its own right. Mm -hmm. So then I'm just gonna Rough that up then, mm -hmm. just easily there. I mean, you can use a little bit of ink on there if you want to, change it up a little bit. Mm -hmm. So then that is going to pop at the top of our arrangement there. So just mess up those edges a bit. I think we'll, we'll add all our flowers first and then I can make okay. sure that it's yeah. in the right place. <laughs> so I'm using the sensational flowers again. Mm -hmm. And I've just got my two um, different sizes. And we're just going to do the tweezer twist again. Okay. So I'm just going to twist that around. And I'm going a little bit further than normal because the petals are really wide. So they mm -hmm. can take a little more of a twist than some of the others we've done. And then that's just going to add again that little bit of dimension. Just give it some shape. Yeah. Now, if you don't want to do lots of different techniques like this with your flowers, you can just use a ball tool or completely use them flat if you want mm -hmm. to. If you're posting, they're still nice shapes, especially if you're doing stamping as well, yeah. um, just to have flat flowers on your card as well. So just keep twisting those round. So I've got two in each size. And it's just adding that little frill into them. Mm -hmm. And now we can bring our foam mat in again. Really nice. Just setting these to one side. And then just offsetting these two together. So there we go. And just when you press in the middle as well, it just gives it that extra lift mm -hmm. to it. Mm -hmm. So then again into the middle of this one and then picking yeah. that up again. And then just to add a couple of extra flowers. So this is the smallest one in the Sensational Flowers, which is it's a great size. It's not small. But it's it? not small. No, exactly. So if you want to then fill out your arrangement yeah. a little bit, I like to do these um, coiled roses. Okay. So this is all cut by hand. So I'll just show you how I do that. So I literally just take a square of paper like this and just mm -hmm. go in with my scissors and just try and cut a rough scallop. Okay. And just keep going in a circular motion until you've got a round like that. I don't know how you've done that. <laughs> <laughs> and then just go in and again and just uh -huh. make yourself another scallop. So you can do it with a straight edge. Okay. So that might be an, a good place to start if you've never done them before. Uh -huh. So if you were just doing it straight, just literally, you can use a proper circle die if you want, if you're somebody that prefers it to be a, a proper circle. Yeah. But then the easy way is just literally just going then, coiling into the center. And then you just twist it up and that makes a rose. So you can do it straight or scalloped mm -hmm. like this. So I've got a couple of those to do. So I'm just going to then take my tweezers and just coil those into the center all the way and then just add a dab of hot glue. So let it out a little bit so it makes into a rose and then just add in a dab of hot glue in there just to then secure it on its little saucer. Mm -hmm. So then that is going to create one rose there. If we hold it another sec. <laughs> I'm too eager to let go. 
It's like, is it done? Is it ready? <laughs> <laughs> I just presume, you know, if I get hot glue on my fingers, it yep. sets so quick, but it just doesn't on paper, does it? <laughs> no, stick your fingers together. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing how much you get used to it, you know, <laughs> the hot glue. You get it on there and you stop going, oh, that hurts anymore. It's just like, oh, again. <laughs> Your fingers have just been made into like... I, I imagine it's like um, chefs and bakers yeah, as yeah. well. They you touch the tray and it's just, just oh, not, they yeah. just do it. <laughs> so then just to add a little bit more shape, I'm just taking my tweezers and just bending out the little mm -hmm. scallops just to give those a little bit of extra shape. Now, I think you can get dies for these as well if you prefer. I'm not sure what company makes them, but... Um, you can just do them by hand if you want. It's really easy. How it is easy, yeah. As to do it as well. And especially with these scraps as well. You know, if all you've yeah. got is little squares of paper, it's mm -hmm. a great way to just make flowers. And maybe if you can't afford actual dyes, Very it's good. a nice way to put yeah. flowers on your card that isn't a massive cost initially. Yeah. So then just add in our flowers just onto the card. So I'm going for these two mm -hmm. initially. And then we can add our postcard I think then just because we know roughly where it's going to go yeah so we can pop that just in there and then our little flower is just going to overlap on the top so a little dab of hot glue and just pop in that little purple rose just in there and then another one in the bottom then so again I've, I've ended up with four flowers on here but because yeah. I'm filling out with moss I don't think it looks as bad if no, I say I like it I really like it but yeah. sometimes like, it just it doesn't look right to some people's eye does it you know if you prefer a um, yeah, yeah a multiple of an even number mm -hmm. I think it just feels like it's framing where the cat is as well yeah yeah that's it so again a little bit of the green moss so these mm -hmm. again are in your essentials or in your festive as well you do get a green in there or the full collection yeah. so just little bits of moss going in and then we've also got some of the pollened stamens so these are a nice little filler as well in fact i forgot to put them in my flower look <laughs> i'll show you how it should have looked afterwards <laughs> do that every time i'm so eager to get the flowers on and then go oh forgot my pollened so again a little dab of green moss just into there mm, looks brilliant yeah they were only last time the pollen heads yeah very so nice. we've got four bundles in this collection okay. and there's approximately 1600 in each bundle wow, okay um so they're all just double-ended stamens like this and then mm -hmm. all i tend to do is just fold it in half twist it up a little bit and then you can pop those two just mm -hmm. into your arrangement somewhere now you obviously trim them apart if you prefer do whatever works for you they're amazing and the colors are lovely as well yeah yeah that's it and sort of work with everything so you've got your yellow which is like the center mm -hmm. of most flowers isn't it you've got a lilac a black and a pink as well yeah so just popping these in just all around just to fill that out a little bit more and again a, a real low cost embellishment as well so if you are yes. thinking about making and mm -hmm. selling you can make your cards look quite effortlessly nice yeah, with it looks so expensive yeah with a, a low cost as well mm -hmm. so I'll just we'll call it quits on that one there and we're not going too mad uh, so finally then well we've got a sentiment to add but because I've missed out my pollen heads I'll pop pearls <laughs> in there <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just going to use the purples mm -hmm. from the ultimate collection yep and then how's available my pick up tool just popping those in the middle of there so I'm going for three in the larger one okay oh picked it back up with me glue <laughs> just use my tweezers to turn that over oh we've got glue everywhere oh there we go. that's a good shout it probably would oh don't let's not get glue on it <laughs> I'll be regretting it later <laughs> I know. yeah we can reposition that in a sec That'll be fine. Yeah, we'll leave it. it <laughs> we'll leave it. It's fine. Uh, so I'm going for three more pearls up here. It's a good job I'm not going to send this to someone, isn't it? <laughs> I, I would not even notice. I just think it was amazing. Yeah. But you, <laughs> it, I think it's because like you do this all the time. That yeah. You notice every little thing. We're all perfectionists yeah. as well with our own stuff, aren't we? We're just like, oh, that's uh -huh. not good enough yeah. or something like that. I'd be like, fabulous. <laughs> <laughs> so finally then, I've just got another one of those everyday mm -hmm. sentiments. And I'm just going to chop that into a flag not far off equal we'll go a bit further and then I'm just going to rough up these edges again just to tie that in and then we can pop that onto the right hand side of the card super and then that'll just be on there and finished there we go
Fab. That's so good. Wow. And there we go. That's just incredible. We, we have almost sold out of that brand new collection that we're bringing to you with the Curious Cats mini card making kit. So remember, it does come with the Velvet Whisper and it also comes with the paper pad as well, the pictures. Um, we've had so many messages in saying, postcard <laughs> stamp, can you, can you tell us about it? <laughs> yes, we can, of course. So you are getting um, two stamps, obviously, within this. You can see them just there. I, I think it is just how perfect. I mean, you can see the creation just there, but it works so well, whether it's pattern paper, whether you want it on plastic, Plain paper, yeah. It's up to you. Is it five ninety nine? Yeah. Oh my goodness, that is a great <laughs> deal, isn't it? Well, there we are. I mean, <laughs> straight on the phone lines. I did not expect it to be that price. Um, so £5.99 for you to be able to get both of these. And it is going to be a fabulous um, kind of addition, I think, to any cards. But you can have it on envelopes. You could do it as background. You yeah. could do it as, um, you know, little tags or anything like that as well. Yeah, absolutely. And it could equally just be a little topper. You know, if you yes. just do a couple of them, just offset there. them, you could easily make that into a Bon Voyage yep. card or something like that. Yeah. Somebody's leaving. So are you leaving or whatever mm -hmm. and yeah a nice sort of design and it's already full so you've not really it got is, to worry it? about doing your script on mm -hmm. there you've not got to worry about the no. stamp it's all sorted for you it's just stamp it and go yeah <laughs> over a quarter of the stock has now been allocated on these so £5.99 today for both of those um, absolutely ready to go you can see one has almost got the postage marks on one's almost got the butterflies kind of edge in this you know they look very um, sort of vintage depending on how you want to actually work with these and two different sizes which I also think is a nice little touch to be able to get these um, and that means you're looking at three pound a stamp for you to get them so well done to Chloe, Marie, Claire, Sue, Paula, Christina, Heather, Jane, Alison, Marilyn's there, Julie and Deborah, uh, a new buyer in Hampshire, we've got Janet, Norfolk, um, what an incredible deal at five pounds and ninety nine. Also I want to bring the pollen heads because I know a lot of you are going to want these, um, very very new okay so they've only been on once before I think, um, we've got them today, we've got the beautiful purples, the pinks, the yellows, the black, you can see they come in huge bunches how many is there roughly um 1600 in each bundle oh so they're gonna last 6400 that's a lot but of a lot also of it is a lot of flowers but they're also in probably about 10 bundles in each bundle yes. so you know if you're thinking about oh that's far too much for me yeah you can share them with your friends oh, chop them up give three to so and so three yes, to someone yeah, else yeah, and yeah. then Great yeah idea. and if you're a craft group i mean just exactly as many people as you want exactly oh my I mean, seven ninety nine for all of that. Yeah. So for you to get all four of these bundles, thousands and thousands of these pollen heads, and you're getting them for seven pounds and ninety nine. And you could see on that last card just how much they they add, of course, to to those cards, to those flowers as well, just to give you those finishing touches, which I always think are just so so important. So brilliant deal, new crafters Janet. A bit of a wait on the phone lines. I think from missing the postcard stamp, you will be answered shortly. It's a free number. Um, they're always doing their best to obviously keep up with us as well. Um, um, and, and yeah, it just looks lovely, doesn't it, on, on your sample that you've got there. To yeah, to this them. was what we were aiming for, with the pollen <laughs> heads in the middle of the flowers. So all you would do uh -huh. is just poke your hole through the centre yep. of your flowers and then you can thread them through and then they're secure as well. Brilliant. They just look gorgeous. Um, also want to bring you the pearls because we have got the ultimate collection. Always conscious of time. We always have so much to fit in and I don't want you to miss out on any of these deals. Now, I just adore your pearls. I, I've always said this. Yeah. Um, <sighs> Yeah, I mean, £60 for 7, 000, or over £7,000, £7,200 is brilliant. Not going to be your price at all. And you get such a mix from your pinks to your turquoises, your yellows, your oranges, your greens, you know, those browns, those those lovely sort of greys. It's just every tone, really. Yeah, that that's it. So obviously, we've called it ultimate because most mm. of the time, it's going to be all the different colours you're going to yes, need. So yeah, you're going to yeah. have something to match most projects. Oh, absolutely. And then obviously, we've got our essentials that have got your whites in and stuff like that. But this for, if you're making cards with maybe our cards, Hard kits. Yep. You've got something that's going to match everything. I mean, you saw the last two. I used mm -hmm. the brown and the purple with yeah. the two kits. Yeah. Like, and they work easily. But also, if you did want to change any of the colours on there, you mm -hmm. can actually put your alcohol pens on them. Oh, so if you wanted to maybe make a slightly darker shade of pink, because it yes, doesn't quite yeah, yeah. match, you can do yeah. that. So I would probably just add a little dab of glue to maybe some acetate or something, mm -hmm. stick your pearls on, 
colour them with your alcohol marker yeah. and then just pop them off again. Such a great idea. <laughs> yeah. And down to £32.99 for you to be able to get those as well. Um, and of course, you've got the storage as well. So afterwards, you've always got these to be able to use as well. Very easy to kind of take them on the go with you if you want to do them travelling as well. So well done with that. Now, there is just something I'm going to squeeze in before we just come um, to the next card making collection because you've got a brand new deal on cardstock. Yeah. So you're getting 50 sheets mm -hmm. and it is assorted, but you will get a good range of colours and you'll probably get yeah. about five sheets of each at least. Mm -hmm. Um, but it's just a staple collection of cards. Yes, You've got yeah. some pink, I mean, there might not be pink. Oh yeah, there is pink yeah, in yeah. that one. <laughs> uh -huh. But you'll probably get pinks, lilacs, you'll get oranges, yellows. You get a good range of different colors. Mm -hmm. And in there, we've also got that sage green as well, which is a really so nice one for your Christmas that. cards, mm -hmm. but also just for if you're cutting leaves out. Yes, exactly. If you were using um, the stamps um, that we yeah. were talking about earlier in the die set, it'd be great with that, wouldn't it? I like a pick and mix. I like not yeah. knowing exactly what I'm gonna get when I yeah. get home, because it feels like a treat, doesn't it? It, when it, it does. In, you're like, oh, what have I got? Um, so a great way, of course, to be able to top up your stash as well. What what GSM was this? Uh, 300. 300, brilliant. Yeah. So great, great quality. Yeah, as well, absolutely. It? Yeah, so for scoring and things yeah. like that, you can easily make card mm -hmm. bases with it. It's the price. It was when I saw this earlier, I said straight away um, to Laura, I was like, is that right? 50 sheets, 7.99. <laughs> it's a super, super price for, for an amazing array, a gorgeous mix of colours. Um, of course, it will be random in terms of what you get, but you're looking at 15 a sheet for 300 GSM to be able to get this today. Um, and I mean, that, that chocolate box purple that we were seeing being used earlier, yeah. to the greens, the yellows, absolutely stunning. So a fabulous, fabulous deal price on that one. Um, so well done if you have managed to get that. Um, we... We have got a lot of people asking if we can just quickly have one more look at the puppies as well. We are, I think, getting quite limited on stock now. The ultimate collection is here. Now, this is where you get everything. You get two of the paper pads. You get two as well of the um, of the lovely um, picture pads also. Now, you can see on the boards here the actual pictures that you are going to get. And they, they are just fabulous. Four by four, 40 sheets that come with this, 170 GSM, eight designs. And you're going to get five of each of these as well. Uh, so that's set two and then you will also get set one coming to you and alongside that we are looking at you being able to get two of the paper pads as well from the vintage one that you can see has a lovely array of, of designs from polka dot to stripes to um, almost scripture to flowers that we're seeing with that as well and then on top of that you are going to get the nostalgia as well that you can see there so you can see all of those lovely purples pinks that are coming through uh, peaches as well so all of that coming to you today for 30 pounds uh, again waits on the phone lines for this one um, this is this is something that hasn't been in stock since june it's just come back in and already we are limited in terms of our stock that is available um, and it is just such a great deal price of course if you just want um, to get the, pay, the, the pads of the images, you can do that as well. So it is either available, and they work so well, to be honest, to get the papers, I think, to go with it. Um, but I can understand people might want to go for that and then get extras of these as well. Yeah, that's it, because obviously you can use those images then across yeah. the board with any of your paper yeah, pads. Exactly. So other companies, some of our mm -hmm. other ones, because they're sort of a tone of just brown, yeah. they'll work a lot with Fabulous, pinks, with purples, with anything. Um, and £15.99, of course, if you want to get both of those for that fabulous price point. So well, well done with that. Now, we are going to have a look at the, the bunnies that we've got here. And this is another absolutely lovely collection <laughs> that we can see with this. It's Bunnies in Bloom. And you are going to get a lot with the Bunnies in Bloom collection. So you're going to, um, within the whole sort of bundle, you can get the paper pad. So pretty, this paper it pad. It is, yeah. So this one, you've kind of got three core colours in there. Mm -hmm. So you've got your pinks, your blues and your greens. Yeah. And that all make more sense when you see the images mm -hmm. because you've got something then that works with all of the different images. So you've got stripes, florals, and you've kind of got, obviously there's only mm -hmm. eight designs. So you've got three pinks, I think, three blues, yeah. and then two greens. Um, but obviously yeah. you can then use your pink and green together, your blue yeah, and pink definitely. together. Like it's not mm -hmm. just about using all the same papers with the same color. Yes, yeah, yeah, absolutely. So you've got that. Um, when we were talking about the images, I love that we're getting them in different sizes as well. That yeah. We're getting to see with this. Um, so you've got six designs here. 250 GSM there's 30 sheets in this um, and they're all double-sided as well so they are I mean you can see all of the images just there if you want to have a little look at them but they are absolutely fabulous aren't they the artwork is just beautiful yeah so that's the six by six image pad as well yeah. so again a little bit bigger and if you are doing larger eight by eight cards mm -hmm. again it's going to fill that card for you you've not absolutely. got to really think too much 
Yeah. Um, but as you can see, you've got your greens, your blues, mm. and your pinks coming That's through in the background the there. Yeah. So you've got something to work with all of them. But then you, this is the only image um, collection we've done as well where your six by six is different okay. to your four by four. Ah, I see. So you've got and even then, more images. Mm -hmm. And I think these, out of the two pads, are yes. my favourite just because they've got the florals on there. And they're just, they're, lovely, they're a bit dinkier. Like, I'm definitely a yeah. small card person. <laughs> yeah, they're so, so sweet, aren't they? Um, you can see those, so the four by fours, as well as said, different images across all all of these that you are getting to see and then on top of this you will also get um, these you're also going to get your sentiments that actually come yeah. with this as well which is just brilliant to have this in the same colors that match across as well but it's a great extra addition isn't it to be able to get these yeah absolutely so if you're thinking as well maybe oh I'm not going to need that many sentiments mm -hmm. for how many images I've got that's fine they're in colors that you're probably going to oh, yeah. use, you use anyway. across your crafting so absolutely. I'm just using it in a later on demo whether we've yes. got stock or not um, but <laughs> Even though it doesn't match the papers I'm using, the colours work perfectly. Yes, definitely. Um, lovely, lovely sentiments there. Um, we are limited. I will let you know on this collection. We've not got much of these that are available at all. Um, so we are super, super limited. $32.99, not going to be your price. You've got a paper pad. You've got six by sixes. You've got four by fours in terms of your images. You've then got that whole pack of sentiments that's coming to you. That's a brilliant price, but it is not going to be your deal price today, okay? So instead, we're going to take a big, big chunk off of that. And it just feels, it's spring, it's Easter, it's everything yeah. that we're kind of talking about at the moment. And probably people are card making for at the minute as well. Yeah, and there are some bunny nuts out there. Like, yeah, I'm one yeah. of them. I love them. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I would pick bunnies over every animal, uh -huh. every day of the week. I yes. love rabbits. But it's a collection that I made mostly for me, selfishly. <laughs> Why wouldn't you? Right, exactly, you can. Um, we're at £19.99 um, for that. We've only got two to three minutes left. Do you want to do it? It's a very quick demo? one, so Would we'll like get to? there, yeah. I think. There's no flowers on it. <laughs> okay. It's literally, I just thought... Um, a great way for you to then um, just make something really simple. Yeah. It's just a little A6 card, literally image on there, a couple of papers, mm -hmm. and you're sorted. Lovely. So we've just got our some of the cardstock. So this is the sweet pink that you will get, or you may get in your assorted. Lovely. You probably will get pink, to be honest. Mm -hmm. um, so we're just layering that on there. I've got a couple of floral papers. So I cut two sheets the exact same size. I've got one to layer on in full, and then I've just chopped one down. Mm -hmm. so that we can just attach that to the bottom. So just popping that across the bottom there as well. Mm -hmm. Almost then, half the stock's gone already. Wow. So then just add in, and again, another strip of that pink just Beautiful. to hide that join. Mm -hmm. Then we've just got our bunny to layer up on again a piece of white. This really is speedy, isn't it? It is, yeah. <laughs> this minute. is not like me either, these sort of <laughs> cards. I thought, you know what? I never get three in, and I'm going to make uh -huh. it simple for myself. Yeah. So then just add in a strip of green just down the middle. We won't cut it into a flag just because we've not got time. But what's great as well is it actually shows then how simply you can use these designs or how you can dress them up like your earlier demos as well. It doesn't yeah. matter what level of crafter you are. These no, things work. that's it. So then just add in our little bunny onto there. We've got our Peter. sentiment that mm -hmm. just says send in smiles. So just popping that on there and then literally it will just go for three pearls on here. I've got them in the corners as well, but just for speed, yeah. we'll just go for those three. <laughs> Have I really? I've got yeah, over a minute. You've, you've done that in... I can do the four corners then. At the moment, you're, you're, you're great. <laughs> <laughs> so then I'll go for the four corners then if we've you got like a minute. If you've got I'll just go minutes. casual now. <laughs> oh, yeah. I've got all day. <laughs> There you go. No way, still one minute and five. Done great. <laughs> so then we'll just pop our last couple on there. But then, yeah, you can see. Yeah, super. Super simple. Great for using up your Lovely. scraps yeah. as well. Mm -hmm. And, and we, we are, we're very, very limited on that. So do remember, you're getting all of those images on the six by six sizes, all of the four by fours that are coming to you, uh, loads of sentiments in all of the colours that match as well. And then, of course, on top of that, you're getting all of the papers that we can see as well with this. So it's absolutely fabulous. Um, do remember, of course, the brand new cat collection. I think there's less than 10 chances available on that now. Um, that's almost gone. Um, the puppies are becoming limited as well if you want to get those. Um, so do, of course, take advantage 
yeah, seven chances left, I think, on the cat collection. So uh, well, well done if you do manage to get that. Have a look on the web. And remember, we have MD oh, one left on the bunnies. We've got the MDF coming up in the next show. If you want to pre-order to get it ahead of that, then you can. Plus, a new paper pad is coming up as well. It's all on the website. Take a look. Now, um, I'll be back in a moment with Anne-Marie. We've got loads of brand new bits. I'll see you in a moment with that. Hobbymaker are proud to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry. Keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobbymaker. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects, and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1 p.m. to 8 p.m., and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. It couldn't be easier to watch Hobby Maker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, on our website or on YouTube. So you can watch at home or on the go. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Hello, hello, welcome back. Uh, Anne-Marie, oh. hello. Um, I was just saying, yesterday, I had a very similar <laughs> dress on to Anne-Marie in terms of the colour, the we length. We are aiming for like, this twinning, aren't we? We do aim for it. And I was like, if we'd have turned up in that, I've got my glasses on today, yeah. not my contacts. Yeah. I was like, my hair's grown Yeah, a bit. we're it's... almost the same length, aren't we? <laughs> we would just be perfect. <laughs> just don't let me do the demos, because that would be horrific. <laughs> and you'd be like, what Oh, no, it wouldn't. I can guarantee you, you could make this car. <laughs> well, there we go. Guaranteed. Just not as well as you, and not as quick. <laughs> um, just to be full, we get into all of the new bits that we have in this show I just want to remind you that in the next hour that we're yes. together obviously at four o'clock we have put these on to pre-order they are completely brand new today and we have got the permanent tape pens I'm so excited I am very mm -hmm. excited so we did the dots at the weekend yes and I was super excited for the dots uh -huh. and I yeah. was like oh yeah and then uh -huh. when we decided to split them up 
up, I was mm -hmm. like, yes. I know, yeah, definitely. <laughs> and, and I think it's the fact that, you know, you need both, but the permanent, because of the strength of that, yes. how much you use this. Yeah. Lots is great with dyes and everything like yeah, that. They have perfect. their own, you know, their own purpose. But I love that, I have told people, I hope you don't mind, but I've guaranteed them under a fiver with change in their pocket. Absolutely. And you do know that the best way to get it is to get two refills and this, and yeah. it's going to be under a tenner with changing your yeah. pocket once again. And, and the prices are brilliant. so versatile. Mm -hmm. I used one of these yesterday. It's my yeah. birthday banners up in the office. Perfect. Okay. How cool is that? that? It's so, so good. For so many yeah. things. I, 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 I love, I, I want to use this on all my wrapping paper. Yes. It just looks neater as yes. well. Um, because you don't really want that, you know. Wow. Yeah. Quick up. Honestly, Quicker. fantastic. So one hour away, but I can see already that so many of you have pre-ordered. <laughs> so um, I would get onto the web and get them while yeah. we can. But don't worry, we have brand new stuff in this hour as well. Um, I'm really excited oh, about these pocket so pads. excited. I wasn't meant to be here today. Was she not? I was meant to be here next Tuesday. Oh, I wasn't meant to I come today. <laughs> and we had a little schedule change. <laughs> and I was like, oh my goodness, look what's on this day. I'm so excited. Like, yes, this is a good change. So we've got the brand new pocket pads. Yes. We are going to be doing a stunning launch price and deal on them as well. These might be my favourites we've seen. You know, the imagery was we've Do just you know been what? going through them. Yeah, they're absolutely gorgeous. I loved the first launch that yeah. we did. Um, and I just thought, you know, that first launch was incredible. How uh -huh. are we going to better it? 100%, yeah. <laughs> just how? I and then I have. saw these and I was like, oh yes, my word. Yeah. So we've got boards here, so we'll give you a look through the boards. Um, what I honestly think across these five pads is the fact that you have, I mean, I love you've got your steampunk, you know, yep. within this. I love that you've got perfect things for females, for males, for Mother's yep. Day, for birthdays, for, for, when, for absolutely every occasion, really, within yes. this. And every age group, it's just ticking every single box yep. for me. And it is so affordable it's yes, ridiculous that's the thing. <laughs> I, I think know. that is like the yeah. thing isn't it mm -hmm. yeah. i mean we've brought uh, 24.95 up that's not going to be your price a fiver each per pad not your price should we, should we just go <gasps> straight right away oh, shall we oh. let's not mess around with it shall we let's just go straight down each of these books have 16 designs in and you get four of each of those designs mm -hmm. as well so you're getting loads in each book and um, they should be five pounds each would you like it if we took them down to three pounds each instead <laughs> yes, you two books for free so basically you're now going to be paying for three of your books and you're getting two of them oh, completely for goodness. free which is just brilliant yeah let's have a look at what people okay. are going to get okay uh, so we have got all of them on the mm -hmm. boards here so this is our first one here yeah. and i love the color palette we've got I running do. through this one obviously we've got that kind of sewing theme we've got the mm -hmm. buttons we've got the scissors we've got the sewing machine itself wow. fabrics pin cushions mm -hmm. it is just gorgeous yeah, isn't, isn't it? it and mm -hmm. all the different colors it's just so soft and delicate it gives me those Kath Kiston vibes yes totally you know it's just uh -huh. so so sweet isn't it yeah. lots and lots of fussy cu cutting opportunities as yes, well if you yeah. want to cut into some of these designs you can mm -hmm. do that as well you can decoupage because you're getting the multiples yep, absolutely but we can just use these as individual toppers mm -hmm. and just be making super quick yep. cards so easily so effectively but mm -hmm. so affordably as well. Um, so that one is our haberdashery. Mm -hmm. Look at this one for the guys, the men's leisure time. And this is brilliant because there are so many mm -hmm. different kind of sports, hobbies, themes exactly. in here. Uh -huh. It isn't just football. No, no. Or golf, yeah. you know, the kind of usual sports mm -hmm. that you mm -hmm. see. You have got chess in here. You've got oh, cooking. No. You've got um, kind of photography. Yes. You've got boxing. Yeah. You've just got chilling on the sofa reading I, a book. So nice. The fishing as well. Yeah. And, and it's just cap oh, it just captures almost like a moment in time. Like that one just there with the little, the gentleman with the dog. Yeah. You feel like you've seen somebody doing that. The guys that are playing chess just there. That could be where I live in Stratford. You know, it could be a retirement card. Then yeah. you've got the boxing. Some people, you know, the Father's Day cards that could be, it just, it's so different. It's sort of like thinking out of the box, isn't yeah, it, really? Which definitely, I love. Definitely, definitely. But also using multiples of these on one card. Yes. If you've got someone in the family that loves, you know, three, four of these sports, yeah. these are still a good size for you to be able to put multiples on one card could. if you want to as well. Yes, so yeah. um, they are just fantastic, mm -hmm. aren't they? So that is our men's leisure time. Okay, yeah. It's fabulous. Uh huh. Wow, we've got a massive, <laughs> massive stock. I will let you know, we've got hundreds and hundreds of these available. 10% of the stock has already gone. Um, not surprised. No, I'm not surprised. Not surprised and you've only seen all. two of the boards, so you're going to yeah. get so much more. Honestly, this is the gardening days. This so is pretty. gorgeous, isn't it? Again, I think suitable for male and female mm, because, you know, not everything's really floral and kind nope. of girly. You know, you've got some really lovely ones. Like the wellies. I love the wellies. Yeah. 
It's so the cool. The gloves with the flowers coming yeah, out. Yeah, they're just amazing. This one down here is like a real wildflower garden, isn't, isn't it? it? Yes, so yeah, beautiful. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, but again, think about how you can kind of tie all these images and make longer images or bigger images Definitely. if you want to. Mm -hmm. Again, obviously, of course, like cutting those wellies out, decoupaging them, yep. making more, doing more of those. Maybe mm -hmm. for kind of like family members, yes. you can get really yeah, nice yeah. personalised things with those on, can't mm -hmm. you? Yeah. Um, that shed with all the pots. Where's it gone? Sorry, we're just looking at it. This one here. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. As soon as I look at that, I think right decoupage. I can see all those layers. Oh, yeah, I definitely. can instantly see them and uh -huh. be ready to cut those yeah, out yeah. and get that dimension in there if we want oh, to. Yes. So again great for mm -hmm. birthdays, uh, retirements, you know, thinking yeah, of yeah. you, just general yeah. kind of cards, isn't it? It's a wonderful one. Mm -hmm. uh, next for you. Now I this, think... we were just admiring, wasn't we, before the show? Oh my goodness, we have not seen anything uh -uh. like this. No, no. This is incredible. If you like quilling, exactly. paper cutting, paper mm -hmm. folding, yep. All of those kind of techniques, but mm -hmm. they're not something that you want, A, want to tackle, B, you have the time for, no, exactly. or C, have the skill for, then this has done it for you. It's fabulous. Isn't, isn't it? it gorgeous? And I, 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 I literally felt like when we first saw these, I was like, wanted Touching to stroke them. them because I was thinking, they can't be flat. <laughs> like, this isn't flat. And it is, but it's managed it's to. Incredible, look incredible, like isn't it? Yeah. yeah, they look so dimensional. Look at the hot air balloon. Wow. Look at the sails on that boat. No, They're I know. so dimensional. Mm. It is just incredible. Really, really beautiful, really fun, mm. really kind of quirky. And so different, in all honesty, to anything else I've yeah. seen as well, which is what I really like Definitely. about it. Definitely. And that is the beauty of these uh, yeah. little pocket pads is you've got so much variety within them, haven't yes. you? Um, it is stunning, isn't it? Mm -hmm. That is not something I would even Look attempt to make. No, exactly. <laughs> um, and I love it as well. You know, if you have got children and you're, you're always going to children's parties, you know, you kind of end up yes. there every weekend's another party. And you're thinking, what can I do that's a little bit different than just like a dinosaur stuck on a card? They are brilliant yeah. because they are, you know, they could, they're very child friendly if you wanted them to be, but they're just so outstanding. The parent yeah. will be like, wow, yeah. wow, you know. Yeah. <laughs> really nice. And these are great for notelets as well. Oh, you know, if you just want to pop a little perfect. note on the back and kind of give that to somebody. Yeah, we're yeah. well, making little notelet sets. Yes. Make yourself yeah. a box. Uh -huh. Pop that, you know, pop a six or seven, something yeah. like that in with some little Such envelopes that look fabulous. Little Prezi there, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, definitely. And steampunk. Oh, this one is just so classic, isn't mm -hmm. it? It's got that real grungy yeah. kind of feel, real moody, lots of deep, dark colours mm -hmm. throughout here as well. Um, it's going to work perfectly with that, that kind of gold pop of your Miri mats. Exactly. Um, it's just going to bring all of this to life. Yeah. Uh, I love the owl there. I think he's just fantastic. I know, I know. And the dress and the hat. So maybe you know people that go to these mm. kind of steampunk fairs yeah, where yeah, they dress yeah. up. You know, this is mm -hmm. perfect. I'd like to do that, you know. Yeah, I think they do it. In, they definitely do one in Scarborough. Be quite cool, wouldn't it? Yeah. There you go. Let's twin there. Yeah, we'll go. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll go twin in a different in our outfit. yeah. outfits. <laughs> We're off to Scarborough for the night of Steam yeah. Pink event. Yeah, and we'll if we make it. some of these cards take with us, we'll sell some. Though. We will. Yeah, there we, we go. Don't have to pay for any food or anything. No, we're sort of. We're on. Okay. <laughs> Do you know what I really, really love about this full, full collection? <laughs> yeah, there you go. Um, Laura's just imagine us setting up our stall at the side of the road, ready for our fish and chip shop, yeah, money. We're that's ready. What we're doing. Um, do you know what I think's brilliant about these five is that each one's so different. Yes. So you know, sometimes you can get like a mix of, say, paper pads, but they all follow a certain theme, mm -hmm. which is lovely. But with this, you're going, okay, I can absolutely personalise yeah. with with everything. Over twenty percent of the stock has now gone. As I say, we've got hundreds and hundreds of these available. Luckily, because it's brand new, and um, else we'd be going. They're already sold. <laughs> um, but so so many of you are coming through and remember this is on it's brand new today it's on a three for two deal so you are buying just three of these say if you're thinking well I'm getting gardening days I'm getting the heartfelt haberdashery and I'm getting the steampunk mm -hmm. but then coming home to you of course as well is your paper art and your men's leisure time yeah. for free which yeah. I love a freebie yeah, me too. You know, always. Yeah. Especially, you know, like one free. Yes, two yeah, free. Two free, even Oh better. my goodness. Uh -huh. Yeah. Absolutely. A lot of people are multi-buying these as well, which I can understand. I mean, when we think that there's 16 designs in each of them, which is um, four of each as well. So we're actually looking at, what's that, 64, I think. Um, <laughs> Wow, that's a lot. So 300 and <laughs> I managed 64, not the rest of it. So 320 across all of these. So if you just wanted to stick one of these onto yep. each card, that's 320 cards for 15 pounds. Yeah, that's pennies, isn't it? Crazy, isn't it? Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. yeah. 
Oh, my goodness. We have got waits on the phone lines. Of course, we have. Apologies about that. Our call centre is doing their best. You can get straight involved on the app, on the um, on, on the web, of course, as well. Quarter of the stock has gone and has been allocated. Um, massive well done for getting in so quickly. That's what I always want to do on a launch. Um, and I just, oh, I mean, you've even said as well, you can, and we're going to be doing this soon, and after we've introduced you a couple of other things as well, you can do the quickest card with the this. The quickest. It's most simple, mm -hmm. but the most stunning yeah. card that you will ever make. Yeah, and yeah. I, I just, I just love that. Like, you know, the fact that you can, but then also, like you said, you can decoupage. You yeah. can make these really complicated. Yeah. You can do get your so dyes much with in, them. all your other mm. stash that you've got at home, all of your duo design paper yes. cards that are going to work oh, perfectly on this. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Um, loads of you still coming through. I'll leave them with you. We will come back to this and obviously give you more looks. But what we can't fail to mention <laughs> is that. For the first time ever, we have your mirror mats to match. They're already cut, they're ready to go, but they're the coloured ones and yeah, it's all yes. the colours that we've got. Yeah. And we saw the 80 sheets you're going to get as well, which is phenomenal. Um, but we saw that mix of colours across all of these. So yeah. the fact you've got something to match everything. Yeah. Should we go straight to price? Yes. I think they're going to sell straight out. Yes. No mess. How are they £5.99 for it's 80 crazy, sheets? Isn't it? yeah. Absolutely. Oh crazy my. price. Yeah. And, and these are fantastic. Like you say, we've seen so many different mm -hmm. colours running throughout all yep. of those five pocket pads. To have this selection of Miri available, cut to the right size. We've got multiples as well. I think we've uh -huh. got, is it three of each? 20 of each. We've got four, uh, four, four, is of, it each. four of each, I think. Is that right? Yeah, yeah four, four of four. each. 20 colours. So you're four getting those multiples of four as well. So you know mm -hmm. you're going to use a lot of the black you've still got. Yes, you've got yeah, four yeah. of them. You know, you've got so many fabulous colours in here. Mm. Um, I can't tell you. I said to. Um, Third of the socks gone already. <laughs> I yeah. said to Natalie on, mm -hmm. what day was it? Friday, I was like, oh my goodness, Laura is not going to be able to contain herself when she sees we've got these. <laughs> and she was literally so excited. Before you even got into this, she's like, oh my gosh, guess what else we've got? It's not just the paper pads, it's the Mary Matt's in colour. <laughs> I was like, yeah, yeah, this is amazing. <laughs> so we do get excited at things like this, as you guys yeah. all are at home as well. Oh, look, I mean, oh, half the right. stock is almost gone. I've not even showed you the colours yet of actually everything that we're All going to get. All of those really bright, bold yeah. colours are going to look fabulous with our paper cuts. Oh, yes. Aren't yeah. they going to look amazing? I love the you've gold got classics. Well, yeah. yeah, you've Still got, got the gold classics. and silver in here as well. Mm -hmm. um, but you've got those really uh, deep, dark colours like that hunter green. Yes, oh, well, hunt, yeah. Holly green, it's called. Mm -hmm. um, you've got the kind of uh, grey, blue kind of shade. Mm -hmm. You've got so many incredible colours. And these are going to match the A4 sheets as well. So yes, you've got our A4 yeah. sheets of Mary and you want to do matte and layering on your cards mm -hmm. as well, then you can certainly match these up it's nice amazing, and easily. Isn't it? Um, I did not expect 5 99 That was the thing. I actually crazy, I hadn't checked the price of these. Um, we've got um, loads of you waiting to be answered. Phyllis and Lancashire will be next. Then it'll be Karen, then Lorraine, then uh, Shirley, then New Crafters, Sharon, Bertha, Kathleen, Pat. The, the, there is more of you there. <laughs> then... Then we have availability. We'll see what we can do with these, but you've got so, so much of this. But we have to introduce something else that is new, okay? Um, because we've got the stepper cards, haven't we? I would, you know what, you know, you know the one good thing, right? For the people that are waiting on the phone lines to be answered, it now this? means you'll be able to add everything <laughs> on in one go. Just have a look at, at this. So this is a stepper card where you don't need to measure it. Nope. You don't need to do any of the work, any nope. of the cutting, any of the scoring. It is all done for yeah. you. You don't have to do any of those mats and layers. No. On those awkward little steps. Mm -mm. No, because uh, that, it, it, the design's there as well. Sure. And let's just flip it around. It's done. Can you see both sides as well? So that's what I love as well. Yeah. It's been really thought of for the back, for the front. Absolutely. Everything is just fabulous. So if you want to chop into these and mm. use all of those little panels as mats and layers, things yeah. like that, you don't want to make stepper cards. You want to uh -huh. do something different with them. You can do that you as can, well. Can, yeah. Um, but you've got so much variety in here because you've mm -hmm. got all sorts of different uh, foil yeah, patterns yeah. as well as different adorable scorable colours. Uh -huh. uh, they're just wonderful. And these are sized oh. perfectly to fit your uh, pocket pads. Oh, it's like it's been thought out, isn't it? So this, if I just pop that and hold that Look in place, that. is just gonna <gasps> sit perfectly oh, in wow. the center uh -huh. of your stepper card. Yep, yep, let's have a little look at that. Look at that. Perfect. And and that is all you need to do. Yeah. And that looks so expensive. Doesn't Imagine it? what you would sell that on for. Exactly. Foiling, yep. the image, the mirror that's yep. there, adorable, scorable, yep. ticking every single box, isn't it? Oh my, and, 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 and also on top of this, it's coming, okay, third of the stock's already gone. Um, on, on top of this, you're getting the envelopes to, to fit it as well, yeah. aren't you? So yeah, you get your envelopes as oh, well. Oh yeah, you've got the envelopes, yeah. so it's literally ready to go. Um, all of these different colours, all of these different designs. How many are we getting all together with this? I want to say 16. 16. 
Oh, wow. Yeah. OK, yeah. 16. So one of each colour, um, 16. And I love we've got the, the almost polka dots. That yeah, you've got polka dots in there. Mm. We've got that kind of damask in yeah, there. Yeah, you yeah. have got um, nice, like a, a beautiful flourish. Yeah. You have also got like a real so geometric good. print in there as well. Um, they are just wonderful. Mm -hmm. And just look at that geometric. That if you've just there. maybe looked at stepper cards mm. and we'd, we'd show you how to make them all the mm -hmm. time and they can be really simple if you've got the measurements. I've got the yep. measurements in my head. I know them inside out. <laughs> but if you don't, or you don't have the confidence, you mm -hmm. don't, you know, you just don't want to waste your cardstock or anything like that, then it would be absolutely perfect. Just get these home, mm -hmm. you're done. Mm -hmm. Just mm -hmm. easy. Yeah, and you know, some people, they don't have um, scoreboards and stuff no, yet. No, exactly. You know, you're starting yeah, yeah. out, so you might not even have what um, is available to actually make yeah, them. So you don't need to worry yeah. about it. Um, I will say, um, right, I, I will just let you know, that because I can see there's about a four to five minute wait on the phone lines. The best way to buy, if you want to buy immediately, is on the app or the web, when obviously we're doing launches like this, where it's incredibly busy. The Miramats have just sold out. Don't worry. Do not Don't panic. Don't worry. <laughs> we, we did presume that would probably happen with the initial stock that was given to us. You got in touch back mm -hmm. at the office, didn't you, before the show to ask if we could have some more uh, because we basically just knew it was not going to be enough. Yeah. Even though it, was, it, was, <laughs> it was a lot, but we just knew $5.99 it's going to do that. Luckily, they did say um, we, could, we could double that quantity, okay? So, um, so we are going to double the quantity and, and let the mirror mats back in. I can also see the foiled pattern. Stepper cards are going to sell out. There's the last few chances available to hold the line still we will add more quantity into these as well so it's just to let you know you haven't missed out once they're sold out we'll just need to get in touch with upstairs and get them to just add a few more quantities in and i'll let you know when they're available okay. should we do a demo in the meantime i love that we're doing this demo so that laura can sort the stock out sure, about one minute uh, you literally <laughs> have got about a minute laura no joke no joke okay so your card blank is going to come to you like this okay. completely flat amazing okay so i'll show you how to fold it up first of all mm -hmm. Personally, I prefer to start by folding it in half. Okay. Okay, mm -hmm. just completely in half. Give all those scores a really good burnish. Yeah. And then go to your side and you're gonna kind of zigzag mm -hmm. that side yep. up like that. Perfect. So you're gonna go to this side, mm -hmm. you're gonna do the exact same, zigzag those yep. folds up. So you get your steps like this. Mm -hmm. Again, really good burnish on all of those scores. Nice and simple inside scores as well, because mm -hmm. that will make a difference on how well that card is going to stand up. Yeah. So inside scores as well. We're going to go to our pocket pad. Mm -hmm. We're just going to use our uh, cheeky new tape runner, she says, <laughs> uh, just because, you know. Well, we can. And, and you know what? While I was on the phone lines, I'd be adding them in as Me well. Too. Because if we've caused a four to five minute wait on this, imagine the waits we're going to yeah. have in the next hour as well. Yeah. So going to be crazy, mm -hmm. isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah. Um, so I've just put a couple of foam pads on the back of there just yeah. so that we get some lift from that background. Mm -hmm. We can get that onto there. And then I'm going to go to my little book of essential sentiments. Mm -hmm. Just so many happy returns. Lovely. Matches that cardstock does, perfectly yeah, yeah. as well. Uh -huh. uh, and that's us done. And um, was the sentiment from the 2024? Yeah. Oh, you can yeah. get that as well. Well, you know, we can always get that for you. Um, because like we said, they just match perfectly yeah. to actually get those sentiments. But how well. quick? Okay, yeah, that took you... Less how, than simple, how effective it's amazing it's literally stunning isn't it um yeah and you did say it'll be the quickest yep. the quickest the quickest card the quickest. it is and you could now go sell that easily you know three four pounds you yeah. know upwards if you wanted absolutely. to absolutely and you've took less than a minute of your time to yeah. do that and we've i mean we'll have to work out exactly how much it is per sheet i think that's a, a little task for you laura so <laughs> one sheet of our go on. uh, pocket pads yeah. Just one sheet out. So 15 pounds divided by how much was it? 320. Yeah. Go on. And then one of our Miri mats. <laughs> this is a lot of mats. Oh, she's just do, on the phone. She's just on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so uh, one of the Miri mats. One Miri mat. So that was 5.99 divided by 80. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> and then one of our card blanks. Yeah. So what were they? 11.99 divided by 16. 11.99 divided by 16. Mm-hmm. <laughs> the, the 86 oh pence my. plus your, your envelopes That's included it. in envelopes that 86 included, pence as well yeah. 
So for less than a pound, you have made something that looks as expensive as that. That is absolutely amazing. Um, we will we will re go over the boards for this. I can see it's you know loads of you coming through the collection, but I just really quickly want to mention we have got more stock of the Miri mats. Yeah. Um, so let us just bring that back in for you because I know they had completely sold out. We've we've managed to, to double um, the the allocation. I, I'm going to be really honest. I think they are going to sell out again, and that is then oh, we believe what we've got. No, I think, so, we have another, think another, can we try and get some more amounts? Yeah. We we'll have, have to keep working amounts, on it because yes. already 20% um, of this new stock has gone. Um, just look at the colours that you're going to get. 80 sheets you are getting within this, which is phenomenal. Four of each of 20 different colours that you're actually getting to see as well. Um, it, it really is. It's absolutely phenomenal, isn't it? £5.99. I'm still just like, <laughs> no, what? you don't even get a pizza now for £5.99, let alone the no. chance to be able to make yourself, I you know, I this many. genuinely didn't even get a Starbucks for that this morning. No. No. Thing. You wouldn't. It's ridiculous. No, not now. No, 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 no. Um, but don't don't worry because you can make eighty cards for five ninety. And then we're going to go to Scarborough and we're going to gonna sell them in our stump outfits. You know what? Outfits. We're, we're going to be rich. We're going to have a lot of fish and chips. A lot of fish and chips. I might even have a battered sausage. We'll on be the rolling side. home, won't we? <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're going to have a great time. <laughs> um, again, we have caused weights on the phone lines with this. A third of the restock has now gone. Um, Anne-Marie will, will try and get in touch and ask if we can have... I think it's going to sell out again, Anne-Marie. I think we're, we're just going to have to know that's going to happen, to be honest. Um, so we have got, as you can see, the most incredible, incredible colours that are coming through with all these. It's the first time that for the pocket pads that we've had the colours. And that's what I think is just so wonderful, particularly with this collection, because they just work so well from the blues to the pinks to the golds that we're seeing as well uh, the reds that we've got uh, Julie Nova Norma Maureen June Phyllis Eunice New Crafters Celia I know you were waiting to, to get answered there um, you will be answered so don't worry Norma's got three sets Karen's got two Deborah's just got two well done to you two thirds of the stock has now been allocated of the restock keep on keep on checking out um, the steppers the steppers, we have got, uh, I think, a very, very limited amount now that is um, available. Um, again, when you have a look at the... <laughs> <laughs> we don't know what's happened with the duck on this because basically we've... Uh, yeah. Well, maybe, maybe, maybe they added more in. Yeah. Maybe that's what happened. No? Oh. Oh, good. Oh. Okay. Okay, so there we are. What basically has happened is, yeah, we, we put in a certain amount. We then realised that even more have got, and it's because you've noticed it, this. Gone. Yeah, half, <laughs> half of the restock has already gone. Um, well done to you all. That's what I have to say, because that's what I'd be doing. I'd be sitting yeah. there in the web, like Anything. waiting, refresh, refresh. Yeah. Is there more stock? Quick, yeah. get in and get that. Um, you, you, you can see the array of colours. I think that's what's so amazing, the array of patterns. Yeah. But also, 11 99 remember that all of these come with your envelopes as well to fit perfectly. You wouldn't expect, you know, if this had just have been, I'm saying just, it would have been amazing, but stepper cards in your adorable scorable yep. for this price, I'd have thought, wow. Yeah. Foiling as well. I know. And that was one of the big things for me because I know that matting and layering onto these yeah. steps can be tricky. Yes. The side ones aren't as bad, but this front mm -hmm. panel, if I just bring the blank yeah, one yeah, back yeah. in, yeah. so you can see, that front panel is such an awkward shape it is size, yeah, yeah, you yeah. know it's getting those mats and layers mm. getting them perfect mm -hmm. uh, and you know it is tricky and that's where you end up mm. wasting your card and you know yeah. you know and that's where it knocks your confidence and then you yeah. might not ever want to make it's a step true, card again it? in your life yeah so having them done for mm -hmm. you and having all those panels it's brilliant, absolutely it? perfect yeah i think is a game changer oh, it really is and to not have to do anything you yeah. know for the fact that it's Just already it cut <laughs> yeah it's already you you literally said we joked at the beginning of the show like oh just make sure i don't do the demos you were like you can do it and now i actually could, could like do that genuinely. because it was just like stick 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 yeah brilliant look at me i'm yeah. ready now to be a crafter like you you're gonna need to um, we've got a lot of cards to make <laughs> i'm fine i can do this if you give me something like this i can batch make i'm on it um, a few of you have noticed as well on the website that we do have the pick and mix available on the uh, the pocket pads i'll get that available for you we've included the new ones in the pick yes. and mix as well haven't yeah. we so it does mean that you've got an amazing array. Now, it does mean that you're getting a three for two deal. Of course, these should be five pounds each. Um, you can actually get three today for 
99 so you're getting one of those for free um you've got so many for there's like loads. yeah there's, there's so many you yeah. know age perfection occasions just for last fantastic florals inspiration with the wisdom but if you are just thinking well i only want three of the new ones you can do that if you want to remember the new ones are the steampunk the gardening days the paper art the men's leisure time and the heartfelt haberdashery which are all included but it includes the same with style ones as it well does. doesn't it yep so if you want the text ones mm. uh, you can do that as well or if you just want three of the same one yeah why you know, not if there's a particular one that you're yeah. loving out of the new collection mm -hmm. all the old ones maybe yes. use them all up exactly uh, and then it's the perfect opportunity to mm -hmm. just add to your stash isn't and just it pick what you want yeah there's some of the same styles just if in case you haven't seen anything like that before uh, it's just nice to see the difference those designs mm -hmm. but yeah like you say i think like you know some people could be coming in and thinking We're well i need three of that <laughs> we we need we need maybe six i'll get three you get three <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you want to get, you know, get three of the, the steampunk, why not? Why not do it, um, you know, do it this way if that's yeah. what you're, you're thinking. Um, there's so many great, great deals. Of course, as I say, these are the new ones. So you can either with the new ones, get them included within this three for nine ninety nine, Or of course, the new set is coming five for £15 today as well, which are just, they're just beautiful. They really are gardening days. Um, so yeah, we just wanted to sort of introduce that to you so that if you are thinking, well, there's, there's one I really want, but I want one of the new ones you can kind of mm -hmm. yeah it's up to you isn't it which yeah. I always think is um is is a great great way to be able to do it um and I know that the pocket pads collection the last ones yes. they're available as well so it, it might be that you're thinking you want those they're on the web if you want to get them as well which is a great way um shall we shall we have a look at another demo yes with these? definitely yeah. definitely so we're going to go with the garden one for this one mm -hmm. lovely um and as soon as I saw this image I was like I think we can make that into a longer mm. card you know yeah. like a DL kind of style definitely. card Okay. Um, and what I've done is I've just taken a little edge off there so mm -hmm. that we can make it uh, eight inches for our mass and layer. Okay. But when we put those two together, it's almost seamless. Isn't you know, it? you're not really going to see that not join, um, especially when we stuck it together. It's just going to be mm. absolutely perfect. Just like that fence is just ongoing, doesn't, doesn't it? it? Yeah, yeah, it is really, really wonderful. Um, so with any of your um, pocket pads, if you look at them and think, well, what else mm -hmm. can I do with them? Um, can we make them go further and make larger cards? I just need to make sure I've got definitely got an edge around mm -hmm. the sides as well, because sometimes I go ahead and think I'm just sticking to the yes, edge yeah, and I'm yeah. not. I'm sticking yeah. a full matte layer all the way around with our mm -hmm. uh, gold on there. Mm -hmm. So when we put this on, we're going to put this right up, Perfect. kind of like as close as we can. Mm -hmm. Oh, what's going up to the edge? <laughs> it's like, oh no. What's happened? It's okay, oh, we can fix that because yeah. what we'll do is we'll go in with our trimmer. Yes. And very, very lightly, mm -hmm. oh, we'll I just see. go Trim the top layer. across the top, hopefully, uh -huh. just the top layer okay. like that. So just really gentle. We're not pressing that down at yep. all. I'm literally kind of just, uh -huh. almost just like scraping it across the yep. top so that we can just get that little bit. Mm -hmm. and then just go make sure that that is all Perfect. done and there hopefully we Fixed. can just fix it mm -hmm. there's always a hack mm -hmm. always a way and if you can't do it like that you can always cut it off and remat and layer mm -hmm. it yep. it's not a disaster then i'm going to go to our little welly bobs mm -hmm. here i'm going to do a bit of fussy cutting okay because i actually really liked this sitting in the middle, but obviously I want to just li lift it up a little bit with some foam pads, so it's just a little bit more mm -hmm. dimensional. Yep. Um, and at first I was like, oh, this is going to be a nightmare to cut out because of all these flowers at the top, but yes, it's really yeah. not as tricky as it looks because the blooms just kind of all sit nicely at mm -hmm. the top and I'm not cutting out anything that's really fussy. So like th that one there, it's got a really fine stem mm -hmm. that I wouldn't cut that one there as well. So just kind of sticking to what what you can. Yes, yeah, yeah. So if there's anything that you look at and think, oh my goodness, I'm never going to be able to cut that out. <laughs> don't worry about it. Have a look at it properly and see mm -hmm. what you can cut out and if it's still going to be, it's still going to look lovely once yeah, it's done. Absolutely. And because quite a lot of these florals are like rounded, they're almost like little gerberas, aren't they? Mm -hmm. There's actually, it's quite easy to actually cut out. Yeah, which you wouldn't necessarily think, would you? No. So we can just go in and around mm -hmm. all of our florals there. Brilliant. And around the rest of our welly bobs. Mm -hmm. I just think the colours are oh, so cool, aren't they? I absolutely love them. And it makes me want to do that in my garden. I know. I feel like I need to get some really fun wellies. Yeah. And just I'm to just put plants I'm in them. I can get all of like Bowie's old ones down. Oh, that lot. Do you know? And then just have them. 
<laughs> that would be so <laughs> cute. Of colours. I was going to keep the vanilla. Oh, well, Nola. <laughs> yeah, no. Nola can have nice new ones. <laughs> yeah, no, but not, not boys' <laughs> bellies. Yes. She probably won't want anyway. <laughs> yeah, I love it. And then just go in and take out in between these wellies as well, because we mm -hmm. want to mat and layer this up onto that background that's there that okay. we just created. So this is just going to help it look like it, mm -hmm. it's a separate kind of layer. Yeah. So just going in and grabbing any of that kind of background that you mm -hmm. can just see in between the wellies there. Yeah. And again, really nice and simple. It's not too fussy. Mm. Uh, it's quite quick to achieve, especially with your craft knife. It is a it's a craft knife job, this, unfortunately, because yeah, we're cutting in. Yeah. The outside, if you wanted to, you could do with your scissors. Mm -hmm. um, but this one is definitely yeah. a craft knife job. And then just going in and just getting the little buckles at the sides there, just making sure you turn in your work as well so it's not mm -hmm. awkward because you don't want to be cutting it really awkward angle because that's when it gets dangerous yeah, yeah. and then just get this last one here mm -hmm. as well and then we can go in and layer these on the top and just make our image complete there we go Amazing. and then you can see that as soon mm -hmm. as we kind of pop those onto there any join that we did have yeah is yeah. just completely gone, gone. Mm -hmm. um so let's add uh, a little bit of dimension to this i'm just going to go mm -hmm. with my embossing tool and i'm just going to add a little bit of a little bit of shape <laughs> to the wellies mm -hmm. just nice and easily and on the flowers as well at the top there so nothing too kind of fancy yes, but just yeah. that little bit of shaping yeah. makes a massive Brilliant. difference mm -hmm. and then we're going to go in with our foam pads so we're going to use our strips but what we mm -hmm. want is some of our skinny strips okay and we've got these coming up on the next show as well we've got yeah. loads of pieces, haven't we we do we've stocked everything up yep <laughs> <laughs> no mess in today um and then we'll just go in and add mm -hmm foam pads onto all these wellies. Brilliant. Now, if I was doing this out of um, our adorable scoreable, our mm -hmm. cardstock, I probably wouldn't need to put foam pads on all of the wellies, but because okay. it's paper, we do want to make sure that it's not going to kind of dip anywhere. You know, it's going yes, to keep yeah. that, that yeah. nice shape. Mm -hmm. So just going in with those foam pads, and then I'm just going to grab the backs off there with mm -hmm. my die brush. Okay. Oops, you're being troublesome. <laughs> <laughs> And we'll just get that last one there. <coughs> and then we can mm -hmm. add that into oh, the middle that. there. So yeah. it just covers up that little uh, other watering can that was there mm -hmm. as well. Um, and then let's go and pop this onto our card. So this is yeah. one of our Joy Design paper pads. This okay. one is, um, if we can find it, Laura, is mm -hmm. our Radiant Roses okay. and something dots yeah can't remember what the <laughs> and yeah just go with that yeah. <laughs> that's fine that's plenty yeah um they're, honestly they're going to be so perfect your duo designs mm. um i love this one and this yeah, pink yeah. just really picked out mm -hmm. all of the the colors in the in the image and then wow, that's yeah. oh i didn't need the edges anyway look oh it doesn't matter <laughs> i didn't need it anyway mm -hmm. Radiant Roses Delightful Dots? Uh, that's the one, yeah. Yeah. No, is it Pick and Mix? Oh. Do you have the Pick and Mix, though, available? Because you'll be able to just, they'll be all on mm -hmm. there then, wouldn't they? <laughs> I'll have a look. <laughs> have a look. <laughs> oh. There you go, you've got an individual or maybe a Pick and Mix as well. Yeah. Bit of both. Okay, so yeah. I'm going to put this on and then I'm going to trim the edges off okay. that we don't need because I don't know why. I don't know what I was thinking. Mm -hmm. But again, there's a, always a way around it. <laughs> so let's just trim off what we don't need mm -hmm. there. Yeah. The same on this side. And then again, I'm just going back to my essential book of sentiments. And I've yep. just pulled out the uh, To a Lovely Mum on Mother's Day. That, that goes so well, doesn't, doesn't it? The colour as well. Yeah. 
We've managed to get the pick and mix there. Oh, so amazing. if you do want the duo design paper pads, then it is three for £19.98 for you to be able to get that. Um, and it does have the uh, this one, which is yes. the dots and the roses that is included. So Honestly, you I can use... You can just get one if you want to yeah. for 9 99 if you just want that. Or if you're thinking, well, I want three of them, get three and it will go down to 19 98 Yeah, you'll use them so much, Great, aren't these. they? Yeah, mm -hmm. they're just perfect. Yeah, but absolutely fabulous. Wow. And that, that's so different to what you did with the Steffi yeah. card as well, isn't it? Yeah. Same, same collection, yeah, totally different. Absolutely. Look. So if you, you know, maybe you have a bit more time, a bit yes, more experience, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know, then this, you know, you can mm -hmm. do these kind of things. Yeah. Uh, but if you want super speedy cards, yeah, then yeah, your stepper card is perfect. Yeah. The stepper cards have sold out for the second time. So we doubled our stock. Um, it had sold out um, again. Luckily, um, <laughs> obviously, Anne Marie's on air now. So we can't kind of be like, Anne Marie, what can we do? So Na <laughs> Natalie is, is there. She's available. Um, so she has said, uh, you said she'd sort out some more, yeah. didn't you? So she has uh, managed to sort out another um, amount of stock for us. Um, we knew it was going to be popular. <laughs> <laughs> we maybe didn't quite anticipate. No. Um, you know, we knew we were going to need to double the stock. We've now tripled the stock. No, so, no. But there we are. They, this is why it's brilliant with Hunky Dory, because there's always someone back at the office, someone here, yeah. who can kind of work together. Um, should we do a quick recap of everything that we've got within the stack yes. as well? Because yes. um, let me just show you through them. Now, you get all of the envelopes to go with these. Was, was it 16 that we said? That, we was it so. 16? That's what we've gone with, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 16, yes. Uh, yes. Laura knows, it's fine. Um, but you can see that you're getting such an amazing mix of colours that we've got there. So you've got um, from the blue to the black, but it's the, it's the foiling, isn't yeah. it? It's the different design uh, the of the foiling that we're seeing. It's gorgeous, isn't mm -hmm. it? It's yeah. so beautiful. And what I love about this is you're not going to get any two the same. There's no, no duplicates. No, that's amazing. So if you do have one in here that you think, I'm going to mm -hmm. use that a lot, you need to get more than one pack. 100%. That's, and a lot of people are the doing advice. That. Yeah. yeah. But you've got gold foils, you've mm -hmm. got silver foil. Yeah. Um, look at the black. Look at that. Oh, it's so Chanel, beautiful. Chanel, isn't it? That's kind of yeah. what I think of when I see that. Yeah. It just looks so expensive. Um, right, a quarter of a stock of the third um, <laughs> the third restock has now gone. Um, this, is, this is brilliant. I love it. I, I'm not surprised. I didn't realise these prices were going to happen. I, I saw the stock before the show and I thought, this is, I've even lost my grammar there. I, you know, it doesn't make sense. Um, but I, I hadn't seen the prices. So I, did, I didn't know this was 11 99 and no, I didn't know the mirror match was 5 99 So yeah. I think that will have shocked everybody at home. The polka dots as well, I just love them. It, yeah. It's so different to the, the other foiling, isn't it? Which looks quite antique yes. and sort of yeah. timeless classic. And they're going to change depending on what you pair them up with exactly. as well. So if you exactly. go with one of the really fun paper cuts yes. it's going to look really uh -huh. quirky if yeah. you go with one of the steampunk ones it's mm -hmm. going to look more vintage no, so yeah they're just going to change up and that geometric again so different to it's anything gorgeous, else that you're seeing within it? this yeah well done norma just getting two sets paul's got two sets as well so a lot of people coming in and multi-buying doesn't matter surprised. how much you buy david's got two it is that one-off postage and packaging fee between midnight and midnight and that's what i love because you just want to stock up on yeah, things like definitely. that especially when there's so much newness exactly yeah. but for everybody that, that missed out and um, because a few people have said oh we've missed out at the beginning of the show should we just refold one Do you want me to fold? Kind of... i'll grab one of mine for you yeah is that um, all right and then we're not doing a dave oh, it doesn't matter taking because all of those. we've vended a few of these i'm not gonna well dave loves a little dave. go with I'm everything get one of my own <laughs> He does. And they all fall away. Very funny. Bothered, yeah. is he? So funny. He has a lovely time. He does. So that's yeah. the most important thing. It's like almost crafting, isn't it? <laughs> he almost crafting. <laughs> Just ripping sheets out. <laughs> I'm a crafter now, Anne Marie. Uh, okay, so they're going to come like this, completely yeah. flat. Uh -huh. Okay, and they've got one big score that goes right across the middle. Yeah. That's the one that I always like to start with and give that a really good burnish mm -hmm. along that. Uh, score okay. and then you're going to go to the sides and you're just going to concertina those up so you're going mm -hmm. opposite so that one obviously is um a mountain then you're going to go valley okay. you're going to go back to a mountain down to a valley and back to a mountain mm -hmm. to create that step then you're going to do the exact same on the other side it is so simple mm -hmm. and you know that you're creating that stepped effect so you yeah. can't go wrong yeah. like you can't fold it up wrong mm -hmm. Um, it's just so easy and again really good burnish on all of those scores make sure you get the inside ones yeah. as well because they will help it stand up mm -hmm. perfectly. That is and there you go. Isn't it? Done. And and you're actually looking. So you see that. Took you seconds to do. Yeah. 
take all the credit. So I'd be like, sure. But that is going to be 75p roughly, and that is for your card and your envelope. Yeah. Someone's just sent in a message asking if they can stamp on them. Are you able or you not? You can, but you'd need to use something permanent because right. you're going to be not only stamping on adorable scoreable, you're going onto the foil yeah, yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah, so what yeah. I would suggest is heat embossing. Okay. Is yes. doing stamping and then heat embossing. Okay. Shall we add uh, something onto here? Yeah, go on. Because while we're here. We're, we're going to try and see if we can restock this for a fourth time. We are trying to get back <laughs> in touch because we are now over allocated. It's still worth staying on the phone lines. If you're on the web on the app, you can check out immediately. Um, but we have got more of you now looking at the third. So we've tripled the amount that we were, we were initially going to bring you. But we'll, we'll see what Natalie says. Okay. I'm sure she'll sort something out, hopefully. So I'm going to go with the unicorn because that blue. Yes. Let me pop it down. Oh, that I blue like just works that. really nicely, doesn't yes. it? But then I think we can pull out the pink mm -hmm. with our Miri mat. So let's just grab a couple of different pinks yep. so we can see what's going to look best. Brilliant. Because I think... I think it might be that one, which was my initial oh, instinct. I like that. Yeah, I think that's a good yeah, idea. And yeah, and that's going to look really and cool And I think that's there. quite a strong um, sort of almost cerise colour. It's quite nice against the Really the pops, doesn't blue, it? Yeah. yeah, definitely. So just popping that on there. It's mm -hmm. going to leave you the most perfect yep. border all the way around. If you want to be super frugal, use your dies and cut some yeah. sentiments out the middle. Why not? You know, um, if you're going to cover it up anyway. Maybe you'd know, would they? No, absolutely not. And then I like to go in with my foam pads mm -hmm. just to give that a little bit of lift yep. from that background there mm -hmm. um, because it can it's quite easy for paper craft to look flat yes so yeah. it's important to get your foam pads in and things mm -hmm. like that as well um, but look how instantly wow. gorgeous <laughs> I looks. just love that it's seconds it's like yep done so quick isn't it yep, finished we're ready to go yeah <laughs> so quick um, which is super. Um, the Miri mats, yes, you've spotted that we've got the gold, silver and the rainbow as well. Of course, we can bring that to you. Uh, the steppers are about to sell out. We're going to try and get you some more in. So just, just bear with us a couple of minutes and hopefully Laura and Nat will have sorted that out. Um, yes, so we've got the opportunity for you to get the gold, the silver and the rainbow. These are just always so popular, aren't yeah, they? Nine they six are. in each yeah. set as well. You Again, the value mm. is it's amazing. bonkers. Yeah. It is absolutely insane. Mm -hmm. And these are absolutely perfect to use with all of your pocket pads. Yeah. Um, obviously, your gold ones are going to be great with your steampunk. Mm -hmm. They're just, you yes, know, and yeah, the, yeah. the men's one as well. There's lots of kind of warmer colours in there. Um, your silver one mm -hmm. is, I found, was really nice with the haberdashery. Yes. Um, because yeah, because that I would think be, it, wouldn't it? That kind of cooler tone mm -hmm. just looks really nice with those yep. pinks and those blues. Um, but also really lovely with your paper cuts. Uh huh. Yeah. Um, your rainbow is going to work with Super. everything. I always love the rainbow. <laughs> everything at all. Um, if uh -huh. you come across an image and you're like, I don't actually know what colour is going to work best yep. with this, uh, this is where your rainbow just. Mm -hmm comes into its own because it is going to work with every single colour you put it with because yes. it has that complete rainbow in yeah, there. I mean, look at that. It's amazing, isn't it? Just I mean, how that, that works. How does that yeah, butterfly just... pop even more? No, you'd almost <laughs> think it couldn't. But yeah, 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 don't worry, it can. Um, so you're getting 288 of these mats, the gold, the silver and the rainbow for under £15. Um, when you think you're getting 320 of your images in the new collection, yeah. you've, you've almost got one an image yeah. but for £15 yeah. for you to be able to get those as well, um, which is absolutely incredible. Um, we have sold out out of the coloured Miri mats. <laughs> oh, don't worry, they've sorted it. Well, well done, well done, well done, Natalie. Well done, Laura. Um, <laughs> Laura's going to have some kind of heart failure at this rate. Yeah, they're back, they're back. So we've got a good availability on these, OK? So with the gold, the silver and the rainbow, we've got a good availability. We've got loads of you coming through with those. Um, the coloured assortment, you are getting 80 sheets, four of each of 20 different colourways. Um, we're just going to just check to get those. Oh, we're dropping things now. We're so excited about this. <laughs> it's just, there you go. It is, it is available now. Um, so we've got that, that third restock of these as yeah. well. Um, it, is, it is unreal. I mean, you are getting um, a, a, an unbelievable amount at £5.99. And as we've been seeing this, it's absolutely perfect. Should, should we have a little look through the boards, do you think, as well? Because I just oh, think yeah. maybe we should have a little look at what's in each of the yeah. books as well for people that missed the beginning of the, the show. Um, because um, we, we, we will, obviously, um, just everything's just flying <laughs> out, isn't it? So uh, £5.99 for these, 80 sheets, four each. It is, of course, the first time that we've had your Miri's cut in colour to suit the 
these pocket pads. Now, the brand new collection, of course, is your haberdashery. It is your garden days. You are also getting um, your steampunk. You are getting your, your men's leisure and you are getting your paper art as well. Now, we're doing a deal today, which means you're only paying for three of them and yet you're getting five. So you're getting two for free, which is just fantastic. It's like brand new. The best. Isn't it? Three, Isn't it? Yeah. Five for three. Yeah. Offer, five offer. for three. I know. I love it. Um, so it should be five or each, but instead you can get all five of them for fifteen pounds. And I just think these the images for me are just extraordinary. Yeah. Yeah. They're just gorgeous, aren't mm. they? Again, so much variety within here. Yeah. I, I absolutely adore this one. I think I know. it's so beautiful. Anyone that's into kind of sewing uh -huh. soft crafts. Yeah. It is perfect for them, isn't it? Yeah. Um, again, maybe thinking about kind of scrapbooking as mm -hmm. well, things like that. If you've got some really lovely kind of vintage images, Definitely. maybe. Um, they would be perfect alongside mm -hmm. this. Um, I just love all the bits I and do. bobs. I do, and the delicate pinks that are coming <laughs> yeah. through, like the baby blues. It's gorgeous. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, next for you, we have got the men's mm -hmm. leisure time. Yeah. Um, and I love the variety yeah. of different it's sports phenomenal. we have in here. Mm -hmm. I really do. I mean, I was looking through this when I was doing my prep and I was like, oh my goodness, I've never seen that before. No. I've never seen that before. Uh -huh. This is so cool. Mm -hmm. yeah, <laughs> you absolutely. are going to love it because yeah. there is so much for so many different yeah. people featured in here. Like the men's chest that's there, the man with the dog, the the, the cooking, the sitting on the sofa, they're just not yeah. images that you'd expect. No. And no. I just love them. They're but beautiful. they're all things that people do. Yeah. You know, these are the kind of cards that you need to be making Absolutely. for people. Absolutely, uh -huh. so personal. Um, yeah, they're wonderful, aren't they? Yeah. Really, really mm -hmm. cool. I love the kind of photography one, yeah. the boxing. There's like, um, I don't know what this, is it judo, uh, karate? Mm, yeah. Karate? Maybe. Arts it's one of them anyway. Of I don't, I'm not sure. I don't want to but, yeah. offend anybody. No, I don't, I don't know. know what Could it be is. wrong. <laughs> I'm not sure. But it's, they're doing very good job. Yeah. Aren't they? Yeah. You know, definitely. you know, down in the boxing one, right? You know, the boxing one at the bottom. This is a bit funny, right? But he reminds me of, you know, Fred from First Dates. It looks like Fred from First Dates. Oh, let me look at him closer. Have a little look at him. Oh, look. Yeah. <laughs> it looks like it's Fred from First Dates. It's Fred's Fred serious. From first He's having a little go in the boxing ring. It's him. <laughs> there he is. He says picture. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Fred. I um, love that one. I did think the golfer was um, somebody. Where's the golfer? Um, oh, up here. Oh, yeah. I, th I thought it was uh, King Charles at first. Yes, I was going to say King Charles when I just looked at that. So we've got King Charles and, then and I Fred. I changed my mind to, um, is it, oh, what's he called? Is it Bobby Charlton? Yeah, I changed my mind to him. I can see what you mean with both. <laughs> They don't even know that they're appearing yeah. on all these cards. Famous. Like famous. And they don't even, even know it. <laughs> uh, maybe they're watching, who knows? Um, well, not, you know. <laughs> and there we are. And so, yes, that's the second one. And then we've got this one. Oh, yes, gardening love days. This mm -hmm. one. The gardening one is just beautiful, isn't it? Isn't it? And uh, like we were saying earlier, mm. so much variety within yeah, one pad. Exactly. Uh, you know, the garden shed down here would be great for kind of more mm. masculine cards. Yeah, yeah. So you've got the wellies a little bit more feminine. So you've yeah. got some, again, lots Fabulous, and lots of variety within mm -hmm. one pad. Um, but so many different florals in there. The sunflowers are just gorgeous, aren't they? Yeah. Uh, and the, high, um, the carnations, maybe? Yes. Up there. Yeah, yeah, really, yeah. really beautiful. Uh -huh. um, and obviously florals, mm -hmm. absolutely every occasion going. They're yeah. just so versatile. Mm -hmm. Oh, so different with we this one. We love isn't it? the paper art one. Yeah. It is just so different, mm -hmm. so unusual. Yeah. You have got that kind of quilling, mm -hmm. paper cuts, yeah. that paper folding, all of those techniques featured in here yes. that are things that I just I don't have the patience for. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> but I totally appreciate it. It looks stunning, but yeah. I just. No, it's I, done for you, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's done for so. you. And like you say, you really have to kind of mm -hmm. touch them to make yes. sure that they're flat. Yeah, they, they don't look like they are at all, do they? They look like you've yeah. got a 3D dimension with they're them. They're amazing. Yeah. And then our final one uh -huh. is our steampunk. steampunk yeah, wow. um, which what a mix. It's just so mm -hmm. fabulous, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Just yes. wonderful, I love it. Uh -huh. It's fabulous, 320 different images that you are going to get. You could make 320 cards out of that. We're at £14.95, they're brand new today and you're getting two for free, so you're only paying for three. Um, we're gonna squeeze in, I think, another demo as well. Just wanted to really show you those images so you get the full idea of what's in each of those as well, because um, I can see how popular they are. We've had hundreds and hundreds of these available. Everybody's been taking advantage. They go so well, of course, with the mirror maps, with the stepper 
cards as well. Um, everything that is brand new today. Kathy's got two sets. Crafter in Surrey's got two. Crafter in County Durham getting three of those. I'd do the same because they're, they're going to be great for you and great to give to friends as well if you want to gift them. Definitely. Oh, this is different. Okay. Yes. Yeah, we're going to go in with yeah. our haberdashery. Mm -hmm. We're going to use that beautiful dress. Again, love the colours. I just think it's so gorgeous. Um, we have got mm -hmm. a seven by five tent fold. So you should yeah. be able to get those on the website. Yes, and brought then, them the other day, didn't we? Yes, yeah. yeah. And then I've just got a strip of um, Ink Me cardstock. So it's okay. just an A4 piece, which I've cut to five because mm -hmm. I want to create like some steps at the front nice. of this card. Yeah. So I'm going to score at uh, one mm -hmm. and then I'm going to score at three. Yeah. I'm going to score at five and then six. Mm -hmm and then I'll cut it at seven, but I'll do a score so I know that that's my last line. So I've created a one inch step, mm -hmm. a two inch step, and then a tab to attach to the main okay. card. Yeah, good. And so let's just trim this off mm -hmm. here. And then we can concertina these up to create our mm -hmm. steps for okay. the front. So if you ever want to kind of create your own step card in this format, yeah, yeah. If you haven't got a card that's big enough, this is just a, a nice, easy mm -hmm. way of creating that dimension Lovely. and those steps. Mm -hmm. um, and then we can attach this together. So again, we're just going to go in with our uh, yes. cheeky little. Well, if you're on runner. the web, or of course you are on the, um, you know, you 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 are sort of there getting everything. Remember that tape runner as well as the refills are going to be available in the next hour at four o'clock. They're there on pre-order. You can get one tape pen, two refills for an incredible price of under a tenner as well, which is going to be phenomenal. Okay, so we've created that kind of stepped That's lovely, front yeah. now. So let's go in with our papers. So we have got, again, we've got that, um, was it Delightful Dots? Yes. And the Radiant Roses. Mm -hmm. um, and then this one is the Gingham, mm -hmm. Gingham Blanket okay. or... Tablecloths, table cloths, that's yeah, it. Table yeah, tablecloths. Yeah. And they're that's all available the on Pick and Mix if yeah. you want to get them. So we're going to add this one onto here first mm -hmm. of all, our dots. And I've just gone with this kind of blue because it just fits so nicely mm, lovely, isn't it? with the blue that we have running through our haberdashery. Yeah. So pop that onto there. And then I'm going to go to this piece here and I want this mm -hmm. to kind of sit in the middle, but okay. we're going to do like a little torn edge. Uh -huh. So we're just going to go to our trimmer and get ourselves a little torn edge on here. Amazing. So that gives us a, a neat mm -hmm. torn edge. Yes. Um, and then I'm gonna go about, go about there, mm -hmm. I think. So it gives us that look of a torn edge, but it's not too yeah, yeah. kind of wibbly. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Good word. Is the word. Uh -huh. um, so I've got that on there, and then I'm gonna just let me have a look how this is gonna sit on here, because I mm -hmm. kind of want that to go on there. And again, I could not decide. I brought all three no, of these in the there, thing, because I was it? like, actually, I mm -hmm. don't know, I think it might be that one. Yeah, I think like the other one was one. a touch too dark. Yeah, that um, let's get this on mm -hmm. again with our tape runner. Mm -hmm. So this is gonna sit in the center. So let me just pop that on to there. Yep. And then we'll get this in place. Mm -hmm. <coughs> and then we'll get on to our steps as well. We'll get those decorated too. Okay. So just lining that up, leaving ourselves that lovely little border again all the way around. Mm -hmm. And we'll just put our foam pads onto the back. So I'm not going to stick that on just yet. I'm going to come over to here now and okay. get these steps decorated. Mm -hmm. So I've taken again um, some of that paper. This was literally the off cuts oh, when I was lovely. cutting that panel down. Yeah. So I'm going to alternate those two. Mm -hmm. So we'll get this one in. Let me put the, oops, sticking everything up. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get this on first of all. Mm -hmm. So we can just line that up there and then just fold that step down mm -hmm. while Amazing. we line this one up. Mm -hmm. And then what I've already gone ahead and done is I've done a little bit of fussy cutting. Okay. So I've cut out some of these button jars yeah. and I've cut out that little sewing box Amazing. as well so yeah. that we can kind of just Mm -hmm. I think that's better over that side now. Yeah, so I just wanted amazing. to, that's why I didn't want to stick it down straight away. I just wanted to have a little uh -huh. look yeah. <laughs> where this was going to sit. Mm -hmm. Oops, you're not sitting there. So we'll pop that on mm -hmm. that side. Fabulous. And then again, we'll pop these on with foam pads. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to pop a little one at the bottom. Okay. In fact, we can probably put a couple on there actually because the step's quite deep. Mm -hmm. So we'll get that one 
in place first. Mm -hmm. So again, just giving it a little bit of a little bit of shape. That's lovely. Let's put that one on. It's so nice and easy to cut out yeah, as well. Definitely, just beautiful images though. Yeah, the and lovely, the colours. Aren't they? I just love those pastel yeah. tones that are working across it. Also. Me too. They're just gorgeous. Mm. Catherine, you've just sent a message in saying you're upset you've missed out on the stepper cards. We've got a fourth <laughs> restock, so we, let's just get them in for you um, because I just want to make sure that you can get them, Catherine, and everybody else. Um, we've, yeah, we've, we've, we've managed to put some more in that is available for you. So, uh, yeah, I'll talk through them in a moment after the demo, but there you go. It's available for you. QC HD37, so you can still get them. Um, we're lucky it's a launch day, so we have been able to keep yep. restocking because it hasn't <coughs> been anywhere else yet. Yeah, so. absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> Um, it's been crazy, hasn't yeah. it? Absolutely crazy. I mean, we were ready to double our quantity. Yeah. We thought we'd need to double, didn't yeah. we? Um, we didn't think we'd need to actually quadruple, which we've had to do yeah. <laughs> with, with yeah. these and the Miri mat. Not what we were expecting. No, so which is great for everybody. Little. Oh, so this is box beautiful. on there. And then did I bring a sentiment with me? Or do we need to choose one? Um, I'm not sure. I can't see one. I can't see one. So let's have a quick mm -hmm. look in our book. Yep. Uh, I don't want this pink. Oh no, we're all stuck together. <laughs> um, let's go. That that one. Yeah, yeah it's, it's nice. cute, isn't it? I yeah. like that one. Mhm. Mm yeah. We'll mm -hmm. Pop that up there. Yeah. Let's just get another another little foam pad to get that in place. Mm -hmm. And okay. then. Should I put it down there? Should I put it down there? What do you think? Up there? We good with that? Yeah, I think it looks good there. Go there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, it's a bit squiffy. Hold up. <laughs> Just give that there a little go. Switch. Just mm -hmm. twist that round ever so slightly. Go. And there we go. Oh, wow. It's just beautiful, isn't it? Um, so I'll just give you a quick recap of the three, of course, new things that we have. We have restocked them um, there that's available. The steppers are back and available for the fourth time. Now, look how many people have already got them on the new <laughs> stock, though. I'm like, how long is it going to last for? So you're getting 16 of your folded stepper cards. Obviously, all of the... Uh, so that, that, was the, that was the demo. Um, and then you can see the stepper card, of course, just here. You can see it's got the foiling, of course, on that. They're done for you. They're cut. They're scored. Um, so, so easy, of course, for you to be able to then create the card. You saw I'm a remake mm -hmm. kind of less than a minute at the beginning of the show. Uh, it comes in 16 different colours. You've got all the different foiling from silver to gold, from dots to, to geometric shapes to kind of these vintage tones. It's amazing. And all your envelopes come with it as well. Don't forget, brand new as well are the Miri mats. We've restocked them for the fourth time. Um, you've got 20 different colours you get an 80 mat so four of each they're five pounds and 99 they're there and available on the web and then of course we have got all five of the brand new pocket pads okay um right half the start of the steppers are gone we'll have another chat because we can always probably bring them back at four can't we we'll have it we'll have a chat with uh, Anne marie in the break to see if at four, four o'clock we can recap all of this for you and see what else we can get not a problem um it might be gone who knows we'll try um but you've got a three for two on these these might be sold out in the next hour as well i mean we started with hundreds and hundreds of oh these and we've already four oh my gosh we've got it, it just keeps getting better and better um i would whilst you're confirming on all of these i would also be getting because this is coming up it's the brand new permanent tape pen don't forget you can get your refills mm -hmm. as well with this yeah. you can buy this if you want on its own one of them for under a fiver with change in your pocket best way to get it though is to buy that which will come in a bundle with two of the refills and that's going to be less than 10 pounds with change i'm not talking yeah. nine pound 99 so tune back in at four for even more of this we'll see if we've got any of this available um and then um we we will we will chat uh, thank you so much it's been a lovely show as always um and we will be back in a moment with dreamies i'm looking over at the MDF it is incredible I know loads of you have already been pre-ordering on that as well it's just just worth pre-ordering everything today it's incredibly busy yeah. good luck and we'll be back in an hour's time see you soon Hobby Maker are proud to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobby Maker
Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects, and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm, and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. It couldn't be easier to watch Hobby Maker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, on our website or on YouTube. So you can watch at home or on the go. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. to watch Hobby Maker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, on our website or on YouTube. So you can watch at home or on the go. Okay, well, what a day, honestly. And it keeps on going and going and getting better and better. Now, we have got the most incredible MDF opportunities for you in this show. Um, it, it's really lovely, actually, isn't it, Hayley, how you and Jimmy kind of work together in such a partnership and, you know, that he can create all of this as well, which is just so amazing. But what I love is it's so easy to actually put together the MDF you create. Yeah, that's not thanks to me. No. That's <laughs> thanks to Jimmy, yeah. guys. <laughs> and there's been plenty of kits that I've designed and then I go, this doesn't quite fit. Can you fix it? And he's like, sure. <laughs> yeah. yeah, he's like, can you not just tell me the idea and I'll start it and then I've not got to fix it. <laughs> no. <laughs> but he thinks about all these things of like how easy it is to put together. The slot and tabs really fit well. He'll have things that are symmetrical so you can't get it the wrong way. He thinks yeah. about all the things that we enjoy as crafters mm -hmm. to make it simple. Yeah. And yeah, he designs all of our MDF really, most of it. I, he does most of it now. Mm -hmm. um, but he makes it so easy and it's a really nice thickness as well. It's a good yes. quality wood. It's yeah. um, Medi MDF, so it's a really high quality and four mil thick. So you're getting a good substantial product Definitely. as well. No, it's, it's fabulous. Now we, I, I just say to you, didn't I, in the earlier hour, I think I'm going to bring you the best priced MDF project that you've probably ever seen. I've never seen such a good deal like this. Now have a look at this little birdhouse. You can see the finished piece here. You can see what you'll be getting in terms of the MDF, which will so easily kind of come together. And um, Haley will be showing us that in a moment as well as a demo. 
If you want one, now there is a deal where you can get four, but if you want one and you're thinking, well, I've, I've never used MDF before, maybe you've never sort of branched out to that, it might be your first project, £2.99. I mean, it is an absolutely extraordinary starter price. I, I sit there, normally when it's like £10 now, and I'm saying, what do you get for a tenner? £2.99? I mean, in life, you can't get a coffee now for that. You don't get no. a cake for that, do you? No, exactly. <laughs> it's absolutely unbelievable. So this could be the real start of a new passion for you, a new project. You might know you love MDF. It, it's, not, it's not far, of course, until Mother's Day, is it? So what yeah. a really lovely way to do this. You could personalise it. You could put, you know, initials on there. You could, it might be from a grandchild. Yeah. Like you said, a hanging decoration. Lovely, lovely gift. Yeah, that's it. You could make it into all sorts. And maybe if you have got a few little bird dyes or something yeah, like that, you yeah. could embellish with those. Mm -hmm. But you can really do so much with it. And just because we've done it in the blues, you could do it in whatever colour Which palette you want. You can do it yeah. in a mirror board. You could just heat emboss it. Mm -hmm. It's completely up to you. Yeah. 30% um, of the stock has oh, already wow. gone. Um, this, is, this is what today is like. It's <laughs> busy, 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 which of course it is because we've just got so many incredible deals across all shows. Um, so £2.99, if you want to do that, waits on the phone lines. There is another fabulous deal though. So would you like four? So then you can create not one, but four. It could be four different gifts. It could be four for yourself. Um, now this should be £11.99, which again, amazing, isn't it? Um, to get that, but would you like it? A little bit lower because Haley's thought you just want to give Jimmy loads of work. Don't you? <laughs> That's <laughs> it. <laughs> Come on, Jimmy, keep doing some more MDF. <laughs> and so we've taken it down instead to ten pounds. That means it is two pounds a project for you to get this. Now, when you look at that, the finished piece. There is no way that looks two pounds. No, no that's way. it. And then if you want to make and sell, that's absolutely fine as well. Amazing. So if you want to make them obviously for charities, you can yes, do with yeah. that as well. But if you do want to make it and then put it on your store, maybe personalize it, then yeah. you can do that easily. And it's a quick project, easy to make, mm. and it's not going to cost you a fortune then in, in decorating either. Fabulous. Oh my. Um, so yeah, 30% of that stock has gone as well. Um, there's a big wait on the phone lines. Apologies about that. We're very, very busy. Um, you will be answered shortly Christine then it'll be you Crafter in Lancashire then Jane then Linda everybody else will be answered shortly um, about a minute left um, for you to be able to sort of get answered on that but it is such a deal so one at 2 99 or you can get four projects for nine pounds 99 do you know what I love right is with something like this is so often you know when you look now at like kind of craft kind of sometimes things to go to or wreath making or anything like that you're paying like 70 quid right for, yeah. a, for a workshop it's a lot of money it is you can't afford it probably a lot of people right now what you could do instead is you could buy four or eight of these get your friends around your house yeah. have a cup of tea you know have some cake yourself and you're paying two quid each yeah. to be able to actually create something and create yeah. your own little craft group, which That's I think it. is just such a good way of doing this. Yeah, and it does come with full instructions. You'll see how easily yeah. it goes together. But if you do get stuck, mm. then it is me or Jimmy you speak to yes, if you yeah, get in yeah. touch. So we can sort you out most yeah. of the time. People might be <laughs> getting stuck because they want to talk to you. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> um, you're going to put it together as well for I you. am, yes. Should we have a look how easy it is? Yeah. So first off then, I've covered all of my pieces. Brilliant. Now I would suggest you probably do this first off just so that you're not having to cover it all afterwards. Okay. You can paint it, I just prefer to put my papers onto yeah, it and, yeah, yeah. and get the patterns there. So I've got my two end pieces, so you can see identical except for the hole, which is your front, and then I've got my two sides and then my base as well. Now, I always forget whether... <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, it's the thin side. Yeah, so it's oblong in shape. So okay. obviously um, this is your end for your houses, both opposites and then your sides there. Yep. So we'll start by doing that really easily. In fact, I'll go hot glue. I would recommend you go um, wet glue at home just because then it's um, you've got a bit of wiggle room as well. Okay. But yeah. this will just mean it's set straight away. So when I pick it up, it's not going to fall apart. Yeah. <laughs> About 70% of the stock has now oh, gone, wow. been allocated on this. So um, if you're there, waiting for that. <laughs> Laura will go and speak to Jimmy, see if Jimmy says we can have some more cut. <laughs> <laughs> so we've put our base in then, so that's where I usually start. And you can see you've got a tab in the middle there that's got a little bit of a, a extra bit on the bottom. So that's just meaning that that's gonna slot in mm -hmm. and it's gonna push fit really easily. Perfect. So then I'm just gonna add a dab of glue just in there. Now obviously use your wet glue, it's a lot easier when you've got that wiggle room as well, but just for speed, I'm just using my hot glue. Mm -hmm. So I'd add a dab in the top there as well. And then we're just gonna do the same with the other side. So just gonna push that in and then wiggle that until we can get our bottom bit in as well. Mm -hmm. 
and again obviously a little dab of glue just to hold that together now you can do this and then um, just squeeze your wet glue in between that'll work as well mm -hmm. and then just literally um, popping this one on the top then as well so a little bit of hot glue just on a couple of sides just to secure that and then just pressing that all together and you can see just a little bit of wiggling and you'll get that straight away just in place super easy and also by covering over this you don't see any of your tab holes no that's what so if really you want nice. to completely make it seamless you mm -hmm. can do yeah so then we've just got our um, roof panels so i'm just going to add a little dab of glue just to some of these mm -hmm. and then i'm just going to pop that really is roof easy, panel it? on it just literally slots in yeah <laughs> and then just because we're going to hang it i'm just going to yeah. attach a little bit of ribbon just okay. to the underside of this one so mm. pop that in there and then I'm just going to trim it off a little bit as well just to add mm. our second piece and then that's just going to make a little loop. Okay, yeah. So obviously if you want to put string in there you can do whatever you fancy mm -hmm. and then just finally a little bit of glue. So quick. <laughs> it is so, so yeah. simple and easy to put together. Yes. Yeah. And then just lining up our little holes uh -huh. and then there we go. That's fabulous. Oh wow, that is that is incredible. Um, and you know, two pounds that is, yeah. <laughs> which is just does That's not it. make sense to me at all. Um, it, they're just absolutely beautiful. Keep on checking out. Um, we are down to single figures now oh, wow. available with that one. Um, so good, good luck to be able to get that. Now I want to bring you the Easter basket next because I'm sure that this is going to sell out as well. Have a look at this. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, it's so, so well put together. And you know, we're saying Easter a basket but this could be anything this could be a little anniversary you know what this could because you have the little panels at the top which you can actually open up can you see this just here that you can actually open up here as well a little engagement ring could go in this of course it could like what yeah what would that be yeah um, exactly and there's so so much that you could actually actually do with this so yeah perfect for an easter basket put your little uh, mini eggs in but i think all year round for different occasions yeah just a that's day. it it is just nice for your little trinkets as well maybe mm. like you say you do keep a bit of jewelry to the bedside yes. and you just want to keep it safe you could yeah. put a little bit of foam in there that's not going to um, cause any damage Very to your jewelry true. then uh-huh oh it's 4.99 yeah. No. <laughs> okay, I th th this is my thing today. I just didn't realise how good the price is. For everything. <laughs> Goodness me. Okay, 20% is gone already. People had already spotted this on the website. Um, well done to you. And it is, it's absolutely fabulous. I love that you've got them openings as well, where they just kind of pop up so easily. Don't yeah, you? that's it. So you'll see when we make that up, the little mechanism, it's just literally holes in there with a the little tab that's on your lids that just spots, um, pops in and it just makes it movable then. The little handle. And I, I think a bit like you mentioned at the beginning, the MDF that, that you use, obviously Jimmy, Jimmy works with, it's the quality of it. It's so thick, it's so sturdy. Yeah, and you'll notice as well, um, sometimes with MDF, mm -hmm. the paint soaks straight in and you get the grain showing uh -huh. through. Yep. Whereas you don't tend to get that with this sort of wood. Okay. Like yeah. we've had bad wood. We have, right. we've tried it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we've tried it and it's just, it's not nice to work with. Yes, so once yeah. we found the one that actually works and it's yeah. a nice quality, we get a lot of um, compliments as well saying like, oh, it's really easy to work with. I yeah. like the color when I put my paint on it, Stays, it stays the colour okay, I want yeah, yeah. and it doesn't show the grain through, it doesn't just get all saturated. Mm -hmm. It's a really yeah. nice wood to work with and four mil thick as well, so it is yeah. substantial. Mm -hmm. Most people are multi buying on this. So Lorraine's got three, Crafter and Fife's got two, Juliet's got three, Sue's got three. I would do the same. It's that one off postage and packaging fee between midnight and midnight to be able to get this. And, and once again, like you said, you'll be showing how to put this together in a little bit. And it's, it's easy. You've seen with the birdhouse how easy these are to put together, and yet they are just such incredible low prices now before we look at that i just want to introduce the other kit that we have as well um because these are your outdoor artboards artboards <laughs> I haven't got the graphics up, it's in my ear and I can't tell what she's saying to me. I was like, I thought she said, um, I thought she said articles and I was thinking, I'm sure it wasn't called that. I was like, Ar -ar articles? Artboards. <laughs> right, that's where we are. So you're getting four different designs um, with these. So you're going to get all four of those. Um, I love the little fence, the wellies as well. Um, you know, the, the, oh, it's just amazing, isn't it? To have that teapot and the, yeah, the flowers we were talking about earlier as well. Yeah. I'm thinking the flowers we had in the earlier hour, you know, that you made. Yeah. Them coming 
that. Yeah, if you put easy. maybe some sisal up the top, a yeah. few um, sticks of cardstock, you could easily make an arrangement with them. Yeah, yeah. And this is beautiful. We've got um, uh, uh, one here that obviously Hayley's put together earlier with the wellies that you can see just there. It's fabulous again, isn't it? Yeah, they're really nice sized um, mm. artboards as well. So they're about 150 mil tall, okay. so 15 centimetres. Perfect. Uh, is, yeah, that is 15 centimetres. I had to check that. <laughs> <laughs> um, your picket fence is slightly bigger, but mm -hmm. then you have obviously got that plant part. You've got yes. the wellies as well. Um, if we get time, I can always just um, grab one of them and show you another demo with yeah, them. Yeah, this yeah, is the only course. sample I've got with me at the moment. Yeah, but, no, that's um, yeah, we can do some more bits with it. But you could trail all your flowers up the picket yes, fence yeah. and everything. You could fill your watering can, mm -hmm. like you said. Even if you just want to paint and do maybe some textures on there, like crackle paint or yeah, something like that, nice, you could do it really it? simple. Uh -huh. Yeah, and I love that you're getting four projects right there. And to be honest, four projects for £9.99. So you're looking at £2.50 per MDF project. It means at that price as well, you, you can kind of have a go if you've never worked with MDF. You could have your children having a go. You know, you could have your, your grandchildren. It is the most incredible, incredible price. So we've got all of those available now um, at the lowest possible prices that we can. What would you like to do next? Oh, we'll just finish decorating our little yeah. birdhouse. So obviously we've got the little, we've covered it in um, Blossoming Blues paper pads. So this is brand new today as well. Perfect. Um, so I've already, like I said, just covered over with my patterned papers and you'll notice you've got a scalloped edge. Yes. I just leave that because I can't be bothered going in and out of that with my <laughs> craft knife. So I just use some blue paint just to do the little edge there, stopped a little bit shy and then I'm just going to add a little strip of um, paper just mm -hmm. to cover that join. Fair. So the paper, well the card that I'm using is from our assorted card bundle. Mm -hmm. So we're just going to add those little strips just along that border there. Now the paint's not far off the cardstock colour, so you could probably get away without doing this, but I think it's just a nice little touch. Mm -hmm. So then just another strip of glue on there. So then just attaching that there. And then we'll just trim that off as well. Now, um, I would recommend you let your papers dry as, mm -hmm. as quick as I'm cutting that off. If it moves, then you've got no chance. <laughs> so <laughs> give it a bit of drying time. Um, so then, with the um, moss, I'm just going to place that all along this join here, just because we've got a bit of wood showing, really. That's the mm -hmm. only reason, and I just wanted to fill that in. But you don't have to. If you're happy with that, that's no problem at all. Okay. But it just it adds a little bit of extra de it? detail to mm -hmm. it, yeah. So just that colour up. matches perfectly with yeah. the Yeah. So it's in your mixed mosses or in your pastel collection, this mm -hmm. one. So just adding that little bit of blue moss just on there. Yeah. I think we could add a bit just trailing down there as well I mean again I just end up doing it forever <laughs> it's when do you stop <laughs> exactly so we've also then got one of our little butterflies so this is from the filigree adornments mm -hmm. so I'm just using a bit of cardstock here and just to make sure it cuts because it's not that detailed but my plates are ready for a change mm -hmm. so I usually then just fold my cardstock in half okay just runs yeah. it through make sure that I've got a shim in there and that's going to cut through first time. So just roll that through and then just popping this out and then we've got our little butterfly if I can get it out of the die. Of course I can't, I've not put my pokey tool out so I've got no chance. Oh, it's all right, I've got one that's cut, it. it's yeah. fine. <laughs> oh, yeah. I was just showing you how it cuts like for the sake of it really but mm -hmm. I can't even get it out of my die. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just going to lift his little wings up and then we're just going to pop him just on the top of the birdhouse there. And then we've just got a little bit of natural sisal. Mm -hmm. So I'm just splitting this just into two, like I've literally got hardly any. So you do get 20 grams in each of them bags, so you're not using even a gram of it, are you? It's no. nothing. <laughs> and we're just going to add a couple of little patches just to the birdhouse down here and then on the roof as well. Mm -hmm. And then just on the top, just up here. And then that's where we're going to add a couple of little flowers. Brilliant. So just give it a bit of a haircut if you're <laughs> thinking it needs a bit of tidying up. And then we've just got our fantastic frills mm -hmm. stamp and die set here. I would say I've not used my stamps again. I'm just using the um, dies. Mm -hmm. But then just using my ball tool just on the reverse of these. So this is the smallest one in the collection. Okay. And then just lifting those petals up just with that ball tool, giving them a bit of shape. Mm-hmm. 
So we've got four of these and we're just going to make the two pairs and then I've cut one out in the sage green as well that's yeah. going to be some leaves. So instead of using any extra leaves that are in the kit, I'm just going to break these up into two pairs. And then we've got a spare one for something else. And then we can push our ball tool in the middle of here and then we're just going to layer those up in twos. So we can pop that one just offset there and then just pop in that in the middle as well. And then same with this one. in there mm -hmm. and then we'll just add that to our little bird house so we've just got a little bit of hot glue on there and just popping that over where we've got our sisal yeah and then just using our little green leaves as well just a dab of glue on there mm -hmm. and just going to pop those in the side as little leaves and then we're going to do the same on the little area on the front as well so just that one on there and again with our little green leaves, mm -hmm. beautiful. just popping them into the side. Oh, one bit I did forget to mention is you also get the little um, stick that sticks out of the side. Oh, okay. So yeah, that's it, a perch, not a yeah. stick. <laughs> 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 it's a good job you do know what I mean, isn't it? <laughs> and then just a couple of dabs of glue and we're just going to pop our ultimate pearls in there again. Fab. And our pearl pickup tool. So we've just gone for the lightest blue. Again, it just matches so easily. You have got so many colours in that collection. Yeah, it's gorgeous. And pop that on there and then we're complete. Oh, I just absolutely love it. Um, and the fact that you are getting four of these little houses, these, these beautiful bird houses for £10 today. So that does mean that you are, you are getting them for £2.50 per one to be able to make. You can sell them. It's totally up to you. Now, you've just seen the Blossoming Blues, a brand new today paper pad that has been used. I adore this. Um, blue's my favourite colour. I know it is most people's in the world. <laughs> <laughs> but it's it's absolutely gorgeous like the the amount of imagery that we've actually got in this I love that you've got those florals you've then got those dots you've got the the striped images that we can see as well um, eight by eight 48 designer papers that we're seeing here double-sided of course as well um, and if you have a look at that you can see we've got the really really stunning images and then spin that over you just think what do you choose? Very snippable, isn't it, this pad as well? Yeah, absolutely. You've got a lot of nice florals in there, but then some um, paler spots in the middle, obviously, the last one you saw, but then the full-on floral papers yeah. as well, and those generic spots, stripes. Yeah. Just something for all occasions, really. Absolutely. It's just great, isn't it, to have that, that full mix. I just love the colours. I love the, the sort of muted, sort of delicate blues that we're actually seeing yeah. this as well. Look at those ones that we see just there as well. And you've almost got the spots that are running through that with the florals that we're, that we're seeing. You've got, of course, the stripes that will be coming to you. So such a beautiful kind of array and, and mix, actually, in terms of the whole of this paper pad that we're seeing. Um, but today, £8.98, 48 designer papers. So they are all double-sided. Um, my main issue would be, what do you choose? Um, that as well looks very much almost like sky kind of esque and inspired. Yeah, that's thing. it. Yeah. And also then if you maybe want to add your script stamps, your brickworks, mm -hmm. things like that on the top, mm -hmm. it's a nice base then if you just Definitely. want to add on. Yeah, absolutely. Works so, so well. So £8.99 as well for that. It's completely, completely brand new today for you to be able to get this. 20% of that stock has already gone. Um, and of course, 8 by 8 is great size to be able to work with, whether you want to cut that down, whether you want in that um, to mat and layer with as bases. Um, looks great on the MDF as we've seen as well. And just such a, a lovely, lovely brand new pad that we're seeing just there. Um, I've had a few of you who are asking about the black and gold paper pad. Uh, not sure whether I've got this with me at the moment. Oh, uh, have. You've got it. Oh, yep. you have. Oh, there you go. Can I grab it off you? Yes, of course we can. Um, yeah, we can always bring things to you. Um, <coughs> sorry, that's me. <laughs> oh, would you? <laughs> <laughs> now, this has been one of the most popular paper pads I think you've brought, isn't it, um, with Dreamies? It's just, just yeah. amazing with the black and gold. The imagery is just fabulous. Yeah, that's it. It's so bold compared to what we normally bring. You know, it's, it is out of our character yeah. <laughs> almost. Uh -huh. But it has been so popular. I think we'll have to do things that are more bold like this. Yeah, it looks really expensive, I think, as well. Because I always think black and gold to me, I just think Chanel immediately. Yeah. <laughs> and I think designer. And I think the fact that you've kind of managed to get that in a 
paper pad is just incredible. Yeah, that's it. And you've got your same 48 sheets mm -hmm. in there, so you're getting plenty of each of the colours. Yeah. Stunning, isn't it? And again, you can see all of those different designs that we've actually got in that eight by eight. Uh, and it is eight pounds ninety nine. Once again, I love that with the, the images that we've got there with the scripture as well. That's kind yeah, of yeah, that. that's it. It's nice that you've got a bit of a muted paper as well. Mm -hmm. So if you are just using that maybe on its own, just pop yourself an image yes. in the center or a sentiment and you can be finished. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Yeah, it's, it's just easy to do that, isn't it? So wonderful, wonderful looks that run throughout all of this that we can see, of course. So beautiful lines and then to have that scripture again if you wanted that one with the postcard stamp for example I think that'd work really well with that um, and then you've got those really sort of bright uh, flowers that are just popping out of this as well so uh, a fabulous fabulous look that we're seeing with that all of it eight by eight that you're seeing there 48 of your designer papers double-sided eight pounds 99 to date for you to be able to get it and of course if you want that and you want the new paper pad the blossoming um, blooms that we're seeing there both of them for less than 20 pounds you get both. I mean, how brilliant um, is that to be able to actually take advantage of them? And yeah, if you see anything on the website, you think, oh, I really want to see that, always send in messages. We're live, we're interactive, we love to hear from you. Um, and we can always try and bring things to you if we can as well. Um, so well, well done, of course, for managing to get that one. Um, we are... That's the one. Yeah. No, no the other one in your left hand oh i had to check again then i don't know my right hand. <laughs> i'm so glad we're the same I'm like so that glad. yeah when i did my driving test I oh was, i was petrified that i'd take the wrong turn so it doesn't matter no so i went the wrong way um so they told me right or left and i went the opposite and i got as lost it was pre sat navs and um I, I didn't come to any roundabouts it was fantastic got back into the <laughs> thing i thought well that was an easy drive and i said oh and she said you've passed and i said thank you and um i was like why was there no roundabouts and like and then she was like because you got us lost i told you <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, aren't you going to fail me? She's like, I can't because it could just be misunderstanding my yeah. instruction. But she said she'd spent the whole 30 minutes trying their head to think, how do we get back to the centre? So, yeah, we're the same. <laughs> so, there we are. Um, so you've got this here. This is your stamp and die set that obviously perfectly matched. So you've got those gorgeous flowers that we can see. You've got the lease that obviously match this as well. Um, and they're big sizes, aren't they? Again, yeah, absolutely. And you've got that nice little frill on the edge mm. there and the fact that you've got some solid and some open so if you're heat embossing the solid ones are going to be Very solid nice. gold or silver yes, yeah, and again yeah. with the outline one you've got a lot of space then if you want to add color so you can do your shading do mm -hmm. it darker in the center and yeah. lighter on the edges but this one is one of my favorites to heat emboss definitely yeah definitely it's incredible um 32 pounds at 99 you're going to get both of those today so you are getting of course and um, both of those opportunities for you to be able to take advantage of as well um and i just think we know don't we with flowers how much we use them as well so you're going to use those and use them we're going lower okay yeah let's do it let's do it um under 20 pounds for both of these third of the stock has gone 10 pounds each 10 pound for a die set 10 pound for a stamp set that you've got there amanda margaret neil avon elaine jane julie a suffolk lots and lots of you coming through for this it is going to be I, I honestly think it's going to be one of your favorite stamp and die sets um, that you will have at home one of the most used as well because whether you're doing mdf whether you're doing um you know scrapbooking whether you're thinking that you you want to do your cards flowers just are used in every medium aren't they yeah that's it and especially like wreaths as you come into christmas yes, you know with yes. these if you just did them in plain red just scrunch mm -hmm. them up you can easily make them look like a Christmas flower yeah, yeah. not necessarily a poinsettia but it's all to your yeah, taste isn't yeah, it yeah, yeah totally um, so yeah it's a wonderful um, opportunity and you can just use them separately like we've seen as well if you just want to use the dies just use them if you just want to use the stamps use that or they work perfectly together as well and I think that's the great option really with these um, that they they are forms that you don't need to be the artist the artwork is there but it's up to you how you want to actually do them waits on the phone lines now for this one lots and lots and lots of you coming through it is a stunning deal at 20 pounds so do keep on coming through with that um, massive well done for you to get this um, so we've got the, the the butterfly dies that we can see just here um, which again you used on that previous demo and butterflies are flowers we always say two most popular things you yeah do card making that's it obviously these ones are called the, what they don't really scream butterflies filigree adornments <laughs> we had a collection that was called filigree okay. something yep, yep. Um, but yeah more for the um large dragonfly and butterfly yeah, it's dragon. very detailed dye mm. um really nice if you're cutting it out of vellum maybe if you're going for um something 
mirror board or something yep. like that. But then you've also got your embellishment ones in there. So I probably use the embellishments more than the focal ones, okay. but just because they go on everything. You know, mm -hmm. like if you've made a mistake, you can put, I, I shouldn't yeah. point it out, but on the little basket, I got a bit of extra paint on. Um, you won't see it because I've covered it over with a butterfly. Brilliant. But <laughs> that's why you need butterflies. Yeah. <laughs> everybody always says that, don't they? Yeah. <laughs> Stick a butterfly yeah. on top. Or a snowflake if it's Christmas. Well, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> uh, we're going to get this to a brilliant, brilliant price for you as well. How about under a tenner for that array of dies. Um, I mean, you are getting seven dies within this. You have got your butterflies, you have also got your dragonflies, and we're talking under a tenner for you to be able to take all of these home today. Um, I just know how much you're going to use them without a doubt. They're just fabulous, yeah. aren't they? Um, so those and your flower dies, 30 quid for all of them, um, which I think across all of your different mediums you are going to be using. So massive, massive well done, of course, if you've managed to get those for £9.99. Um, um, so you're coming across to the Easter basket, are you? Next? I, I was planning the basket, but Brilliant. is that all right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, so we are very, very limited with the Easter basket now. Um, you can see exactly what you can create just here. And the great thing is, Hayley, being here, she can show you how easy it is to actually put it together as well um, when you actually get all of those pieces of MDF as well. $4.99. <laughs> <laughs> Right, so first off then, I've got all my pieces covered and yep. painted. So I painted mostly the inside of the basket just because mm -hmm. you're going to see as we put it together, if you imagine you've got sides here, you're just going to see the edges. Mm -hmm. So I just want to make sure it matches. Um, I've only it, given it a, a bit of a rough coat, to be honest. I'd give it a second coat, but then one that I've covered twice is going to be the back one. So as I put it on, you're going to okay. see a solid black. So again, you've got your side panels and you've got your little lid lifting panels. Now, there is a right and wrong with this one. And the only reason that I know this is because one of my script patterns is now upside down. <laughs> <You're right. laughs> but it's really easy. Again, you get instructions. But if you notice on this side or, or that side, you've got a smaller lip at the top than you have at the bottom. Okay. So you're going to pop it in with the smaller lip at the top and at the bottom, you're having your larger lip. Mm -hmm. And then you've got your base as normal. and even these are simple because the tabs are different sizes, so yeah. you can't put them in the wrong hole. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to add a bit of glue just between um, this mm -hmm. where my base is going to attach. So I'm going wet glue this time because this one I do want a bit more wiggle room with it just yeah. because we've got a handle. Mm -hmm. um, and when I was putting it together, I was like, why does it not fit? And I'd not got my handle in the hole properly. <laughs> <laughs> so if you are struggling with yeah. that, it was probably your handle that's in the way. So we then, are down to the last, I think, one or two chances now with this. But um, I know that Jimmy has said we can have more of this. Yeah. We are going to restock it. So don't worry if that kind of comes up as sold out. We'll, we'll pop that back in for you as well. So I've just added some glue to either side. And then I'm just going to pop my side panels in as well. Fabulous. So make sure we get them the right way up. There we go. You'll notice, though, if I, if I show you it the wrong way round, You'll notice you've got a gap, mm -hmm. so oh, yeah, so you can't know. really get it wrong. Yeah. I didn't check this as I was covering it. I was like, <laughs> oh, it's fine, it'll work, it's fine, it's no problem. But then I realised one of my script is upside down, so no, just bear I that in really mind. Notice the script is nah, fine. it's, it's not fine. fully written, is it? Um, we've restocked it, so for anybody that was waiting to obviously get that, it is now restocked. We've got um, a bigger quantity available. So again, a little bit of glue on there, and that's just going to pop into the slot then for your handle. Okay. And then we've got our little um, lifting lids. Mm -hmm. So I usually find it easiest to put it together and then ease it apart to get my little um, panels in. Mm -hmm. So again, just a little dab of glue. And because I've covered it in paper, um, again, we've covered up all those slots. So you're not going to see any of the workings. No, exactly. So this is what I mean, if you're going to, or if you're struggling to get it to slot together, mm -hmm. it's because this little handle at the top isn't in its right slot. Okay. So we slot that in first and then we can get our sides and base in. But because we've got wet glue again, it's got a little bit of wiggle time. Mm -hmm. and you can see slots perfectly yeah, together. Yeah, perfect. Then you're not putting any glue on these tabs because you want those to move freely. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to pop that into the side that I've got my glue on originally. Yeah ease this apart and then just get it into that little hole as well. So then we can squeeze that back together, mm -hmm. make sure our slots are in. There we go. And then same with this side, just get one side in, ease it apart, and then just pop that hole in as well. Perfect. And then we can make sure, like I say, just re-jig that, make mm -hmm. sure that it's all together. So my handles come out so it's not working right. There we go. 
and then just hold all that together. It's a little bit fiddly, but once you've got it right, that, that makes it easier. Mm -hmm. There we go. And then popping that just together and there you go. Mm -hmm. This takes a little bit of wiggling, that's all. And you have got um, instructions. Brilliant. It's good, I think, that it comes with instructions if you're gifting this. Because, you know, yeah. sometimes, you're, you know, you might be giving it to somebody else. And you can always watch back the shows as well, which is brilliant. Yeah, absolutely. Now, as much as I said, I've covered the black so you don't see any wood. You mm. see wood when I, I didn't paint them bits. <laughs> so make sure you paint all the bits that you were, like, if you want to make it perfect inside. Yeah. And then I'm just going to place some of my black sisal just on the inside, just as a little bit of a filler. And then that's just going to stick out a little bit. So you've got a bit of filling in there. It kind of takes away the bare wood. Mm -hmm. So then we're just going to go to the side and we can start to decorate. Okay. So I want to use one of the butterflies. So this is in the Everyday Sentiments. Mm -hmm. And we're just going to heat emboss this in gold. So I've just got a bit of the black and gold paper pad there, just part of the plain black. And then we're just going to stamp this little butterfly out and then just give that a bit of a heat emboss with our gold. Mm -hmm. So, I didn't plug my heat tool in, I forgot about it. <laughs> there we go. Right. Yeah. So then we can give this a cover in our gold. Mm -hmm. So just covering this over. Risky. You need a bit of a scrap paper usually. There we go. It wasn't too bad. No. <laughs> <laughs> so hopefully you can see that gorgeous yep. little butterfly there. And then I've also heat embossed the sentiment, but just for speed we'll just do the butterfly. Mm -hmm. And then we'll give this a heat and then hopefully you'll start to see that change in soon. Yeah, I do. I love, I love embossing powder. As soon as you put that heat tool on you, you start seeing that. that it's so nice, isn't it? Yeah. So it's just a basic sort of butterfly that you've got in that um, stamp set, the Everyday Sentiments, mm -hmm. but really worth having, just really nice to use. So we're going to add our sentiment first then, I think, yes. so that we can sort that position in. So I've just got a scrap of mirror board that I was chopping up mm -hmm. and I've just got my sentiment as well. So we'll just trim this just to leave a narrow border. Mm -hmm. So again, stamped on the um, black from our black and gold because you do get a, it's a kind of a plainish one, but it's probably more... Um, chalkboard sort of black yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. so then I'm just going to trim this into a flag as well mm -hmm. then we can stick that to our scrap and then just frame it again we can pop that on there so maybe if you got your mirror board in the last hour if mm -hmm. it's still in stock yeah <laughs> <laughs> could do this in all sorts of different colors absolutely yeah so then just trimming that to match the little flag on the end and then that's going to be our main sort of, mm -hmm. if I say focal point for it, it's going to be what you focus on the yeah, most. Definitely. So just add in a little bit of hot glue just for that with love there. Mm -hmm. Make sure that stays straight. And I've also just got a little bow, same ribbon that we used earlier, just for at the top there. So we can pop that on first off. It's really pretty, that ribbon. Yeah, it's just um, sheer in the middle and then just got like mm. a edge or to it, it's quite nice to use. Cream as well works with everything. Yeah, very true. <laughs> so again, I'm just using the Fantastic Frills. Mm -hmm. And I think we'll just go for, mm, we'll just use our embossing tool, I think, on the small ones. And then we can frill the slightly larger one. So just using my smallest ball tool. So in the set, you do get four different um, tools. Okay. But you've got eight different heads on it. Yeah. So the double-ended. Mm -hmm. So just flipping those over. as well to be able to get all four of those double-ended 9.99. Yeah, that's it. And I really like them because they are metal all mm -hmm. the way through as well. Mm -hmm. So sometimes I've had them in the past and don't get me wrong, I bought cheap, I bought twice. Yes. You know, it's, what, it's that same rule, yeah. yeah. Um, you but, same, but you're not. <laughs> no, absolutely not. And then I just ended up snapping it in half and I'm working with a half size <laughs> one. I'm just like, just get yourself some proper ones. Yeah. <laughs> so we've got our two small flowers there and then I've just got three slightly larger and I think we'll just crease these mm. ones just to keep that simple. And then pop those back up and a little press with our ball tool in the middle just to lift those petals. And then we can pop the three together, just offset those as we go. And then, there we go. 
I really like the, the spotty paper in I this. I do, yeah. I don't, I'm such a sucker for spots though. Like it's all the time I'm just using spots and it's, <laughs> it's boring almost, but it's no, like, it's I love not. the spots. <laughs> they just work. They do, definitely. So we're just gonna arrange them on the side of the mm -hmm. basket there. So we'll just go for our largest one and then the two smaller ones. So obviously it's gonna cover the edge of our sentiment there so you can't see where that starts and then this one just down here so then i've done the same sort of thing and i've cut them out of mirror board mm -hmm. so we're just going to use these as our leaves again so just chopping into those yeah. breaking them up and then we can add them into the collection of flowers Brilliant. so i think we'll use our ball tool again on these just to give that a little bit more shape so we've just got a couple of pairs then to go in and then some single ones as well. Might be better with just singles. We'll mm -hmm. see as we go. <laughs> That's the best thing though about die cutting because you've, you've obviously got the base die for it. You can just keep recutting yeah. and recutting. So even if you decide, oh, that's not quite what I wanted for that project, mm -hmm. you don't need to waste it. You can just cut yourself that's another true. one and save that for, for later on. Yeah, it doesn't matter, does it at all? No, not at all. So then a couple of little gold leaves in the side there as well and then at the top then we can add on our little butterfly and some pollen heads as well lovely so i've got the gold butterfly that we did earlier so i've yes. just fussy cut that out mm -hmm. and then just picking that up and i'm just going to pop that on the side there so there we go and then just some of the black pollen heads then and oh in fact we've got a bit of gold moss too so I'm just going to fold a few of these in half. I think I'll trim them off actually. And then we can pop them just into the arrangement in little, little areas. Very new, of course, to get these. And um, £7.99 where you're going to get the colour you're using just there, the black, but you also get the purple, the pink and the yellow. How many did you say you actually get within there? Um, 6,400 approximately. <laughs> approximately. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we haven't counted every single one. but <laughs> <laughs> You've been there all day. <laughs> So just pop in again another couple of little black mm -hmm. ones just in there. Mad. And then same with this one. We don't go too mad with them. You get the idea. Mm -hmm. As you know, I'll be going all day long. So <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I've, got, I've only got a few more minutes. <laughs> so just that one in there. And then we can add a little bit of our green moss just to pick that up again, just from yeah. um, just being the black and gold, really. I just wanted a little bit of extra mm -hmm. colour in there. Pop in a little bit of the green moss in. And also, if you do see, I've got lots of little areas of um, hot glue just sticking around. Mm -hmm. If you just blast that with your heat tool, they'll all just melt into your project and you won't even see them anymore. Because I know sometimes hot glue is, that's what puts people off. They go, oh, I yeah, get all the little yeah. bits of glue left nice. over. So just again, a little dab of hot glue on there. And then just finally, I was going to put gold pearls on, but I feel really naughty because they're not on the show. So I'm just going to go brown. <laughs> okay, yeah. <laughs> so just a little pearl just in each of the flowers. Just finish it off lovely, doesn't it? It does, yeah. So a little one of the brown. So in the ultimate pearls as well, you do get four and five mil in size. So I'm just using the five mils yeah. here. Uh -huh. And they just work really nicely in that sort of size flower. It's just amazing. And there we go. It? Look at that. £4.99 as well. And of course, you can make to sell. There's no way you're going to be selling that on for £4.99. No, um, exactly. It's, it's, it's fabulous. It really is. And you can personalise that to each individual person as well. Um, the pollen head that was on your screen there, if you're getting that, they're your four bundles, over 6,000 that you get in. So it's an amazing array of colour that you've got. Uh, the Easter basket, we've restocked it. It did sell out the initial... Um, amount Jimmy's gonna cut more uh, so it does mean that we can have more four pounds and 99 um, and they really are they're absolutely stunning love that you've actually got that movability as well where you can lift up each of the side panels as well pop anything you want inside of it gift it yeah great for Easter but in my opinion great for all year round as well um, to be able to decorate that and, and to be able to really sort of um, you know fall in love with what we've got just there now the other thing that you used was the stamps where we had the uh, the butterfly of course we did make these available in 
the earlier hours so they are there they are available for you so if you want to get the everyday stamps then we've got them with love thank you just for you just because happy birthday have a lovely day to a special friend and the butterfly that we just saw being used under a tenner of course for you to be able to get this um, it's a brilliant stamp set um, that we've got there and also so easy if you haven't stamped before with them being smaller sizes to kind of get it right you know and kind of and to work with I'd say the stamps as well if you're thinking of starting off your stamping journey it's a lovely yeah one absolutely I think it is easy to be afraid of stamping because mm. you just think oh if it doesn't print right but now with the um, stamping platforms I know Hunky Dory doing Practice Companion no exactly as long as you tape it down you can go straight back in mm. again and there's no waste yeah exactly um, so that's available for you there at an under £10 deal as well so well well done of course if you've managed to get that now um i think the postcard stamp has been so popular i'll just give you another look at this we are very very limited in terms of availability we have got the last few chances you're getting two of these two different sizes um, of those postcard stamps that we're getting um, for an absolutely fantastic fantastic deal today um, because it's something i mean 5.99 is just just brilliant and if i just show you this as well okay then you can see just here that we have got um, this, that we've got the postcard stamp that we've got just there um, that works really, really well. Remember as well, the cat collection, I know there was less than 10 of those available, but you can jump on and get those if there is any still left and available for you. Um, we've had a little message in as well asking for the bunny stamp. So yeah, we'll bring it to you. <laughs> not a problem at all. Hayley's like, I'm gonna have a sample. <laughs> I'm Thank like, you. am I in shot or not? <laughs> <laughs> so. If, if, if you've been sort of following the past few weeks with Hayley's shows, you've done a number of different animals in this design. Yeah, we started with a bunny and this is a different bunny. Have Obviously, you? I'm obsessed with bunnies. Yeah, she's um, yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> Do you get it? Yeah, I just cool. wanted to call it an aeroplane bunny. And we were just like, do people get it? <laughs> I, love, I love that. Yeah. <laughs> but bunnies have, like, we had one with one up, one down. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you do, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> Um, it's fabulous and then if I just show you it finished off of course in a sample as well how fabulous is that to be able to get there it's already 10% of that stock has gone fabulous price at £4.99 and I think when you're doing a sort of selection of, of bunnies owls dogs bears people are going to collect them all and then kind of build scenes with them yeah that's it because they're all a similar style so they've all got the dashed edge there so yes. it's really easy to work with you've mm -hmm. not got to worry if you're watercoloring I think it just works really mm -hmm. well you, you've mm -hmm. got a fluid edge you can then chop around it really yeah easily but if you're just doing it onto just a piece of card and stamping Definitely. it you can keep your edges really fluid and if it's not perfect it just doesn't matter uh -huh. no exactly and it's given that dimension isn't it with that kind of dashed edge yeah it's it looks really fluffy <laughs> <laughs> yeah. you feel like it's actually got the fur that's that's there um, and brilliant brilliant deal large stamp as you can see here at four pounds 99 for you to be able to get this it, it's a super super look that we've got people multi-buying there as well almost a quarter of the stock has now gone has now been allocated brand brand new today um, and I always love that as well when you're one of the first people that are actually getting something home. Yeah. It feels a little bit more special, isn't it? <laughs> That's it. After the shows, I, I get loads of comments on Facebook. They're like, oh, I, like somebody said last yeah, time, yeah. oh, I ordered the wintry bear. I can't wait for him to come. And it's like, I'm sure I'll get the same this time. Yeah. Oh, I got the rabbit. Oh, yeah, I got aeroplane ears. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> funny there. Um, and and br your prices, I have to say, on stamps always are so good because yeah. we often see stamps quite pricey, you know, yeah. from a lot of different brands, which I can completely understand. Whereas at five pounds, anybody can, you know, usually afford to get that. Yeah, that's it. I mean, thankfully now we're at a point where we can have someone else manufacture our yes. stamps, but originally we used to manufacture every yeah. single one, yeah. Um, but now we can meet the minimum, so <laughs> that's amazing that's in itself. Um, but yeah, it's, it is just, I do want people crafting. I think it yeah. does so much for my mental health. Mm. I'd love to share that with other people. Yeah, definitely, it's so enjoyable, isn't it? It is. And also I think it's, it's you know, it's if you have stamps like this, good tools, you automatically look better as well. <laughs> yeah. you know, it, it's like I, I never realised until I started working for Hobby Maker what my aunt used and did. And I just thought she was fantastic at her cards. I was like, wow, she's a genius. And then as I did shows here, I was like, oh, that's how she does it. Yeah. You, like put it all together and it's, you know, it is. Do you know, I was watching the Hunky Dory show in the yeah. green room and I was just like, they do it so well. It's like your stepper cards. You don't have to think about it. Yes, and then the yeah, matte yeah. layers, it's, it's uh -huh. sorted. Like it's done so well. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. 
Um, almost 30% of this stock has now gone. Um, very, very popular, as you'd expect. It's a gorgeous stamp, and you can just see that the finished sample there, how perfect that is. The clarity of it, uh, how cute it is as well. And of course, with that kind of dashed edge, it just finished it off in such an amazing way. So well, well done with that at £4.99. Now, we've got the Outdoors Art Board, where you are going to get four of your MDS, brand new today, for one price point. So you are getting the wellies, you're getting the watering can, you're getting the fence that you can see there and the plant pot so all four of those um, for an extraordinary extraordinary low price and we're going to do a demo on on the welly boots aren't we yeah so because you've got two welly boots like in the same shot yes. yeah, yeah, what yeah. i've done is i've kind of drawn around one so you can make it kind of a little bit 3d ah, great idea. um so we've just used the vintage teal paper pad so this was in with Lovely. the precious yep. puppies earlier or it was individual as well so mm -hmm. up to you which yeah, you bring there so we'll start off at first then I've pre-covered my artboard, so really easy to then just trace around just using mm -hmm. your craft knife. Yep. And then on the um, actual artboard, you've got a line between the two wellies. So if you're just painting it, that'll stay on the um, artboard. You'll be able to see it okay. and you'll be able to distinguish. But because I've covered it, I couldn't distinguish where my second wellie was. So what I did is I got some vellum and then I just traced into the groove that the MDF had. Mm -hmm. And then that is then my template to make my second wellie. Welly. Okay. So then I can then layer this up with some foam pads and um, that will make it a little bit more 3D looking. Mm -hmm. So I've also added a little bit of ink just around the edge just to define it as well. So just add in some foam pads then just to the back of this. So this is just going to then pick that up and make it really easy to distinguish my second boot. Mm -hmm. So just taking all of those little back bits off. Super. So now it's not the perfect size because then I just want to trim that around where I've, because obviously I couldn't get the perfect size and the perfect shape whilst it's not attached. So I just did it roughly. It's not too bad, but then I just want to take off some of the little bits at the bottom, just using my craft knife. Mm -hmm. So you'll be able to see we've got extra um, paper in here. They have got a little bit of a jagged edge, but sometimes I just leave that smooth with my yeah. paper just because it's a little bit easier to cut out then. You've not got to um, go in and out of all the little jagged bits. So then just trimming that round and then we've got our um, wellies then. They're lovely, aren't they? They are, and using that sort of um, faded pad as well it is really easy to just build up and Definitely. make it look pretty yeah so then we've got our base as well so all I've done is just covered that and you can see I've just then chopped him just using my craft knife and then that is going to be the base for these wellies so first off then we're going to add our sisal onto the side so really easy to do like it, your base is pretty much done for you you've not got to worry about what shape you're doing or anything like that it no, is yeah. all just simple and easy so just add in a bit of glue just around there and then we're just going to pop our natural sisal on there. So then we can add a little bit more glue just on there just to hold that down. Mm -hmm. And then we can add all of our flowers on the top. So we've gone for our fantastic frills again. Yeah. So just giving these a bit of a trim off just so it's not as overpowering on there <laughs> um, so I've got some that I've already pre-cut out so we're just going to frill this one mm -hmm. so I've got three layers I think yeah and we're just going to fold it in kind of a concertina fold yeah, yeah so just frilling those petals you get about two or three folds in there and that's just going to give that lots of dimension when we layer them mm -hmm. together so just keeping going round there and then again so, very, very popular die and stamp set this one wasn't yeah. it yeah yeah it is one of my favorites mm. i'm sure i say about everything but <laughs> there's so much good stuff <laughs> so why wouldn't you? it's my favorite until next time <laughs> until there's something new uh -huh. <laughs> but we're all the same aren't we yeah <laughs> so then just pressing in the middle of there and you can see that's added mm. a lot more dimension to that flower yeah. there and then we're just going to use our ball tool again on the next size down. So these are the smallest three in the set that I'm using. So you can see like across the sets of flowers we do, you do get a lot of different sizes, like the sensational flowers we had earlier. Mm -hmm. The smallest one was probably this sort of size, whereas yes. you get a lot smaller in these um, collections. So then just setting these two together again and then just pushing that in the middle again. And then we can add those just to the side of this welly. Mm -hmm. So we'll start with our largest one down there, I think. 
and then we can just arrange those around. So I've already got a couple that I did a little bit earlier, just to save a bit of time. Yeah. And then just potting those just around this edge. A little one then at the top, and then this one here as well. I mean, with the other ones in this collection, the watering can, I've done so many of those, like in lavenders and stuff mm -hmm. like that. It's really nice, just again for a gift, and same as with our paper kits and um, the MDF as well, with the yeah. stamps. If you did just get the bunny, um, you're welcome to make and sell as well with that. Um, it is just all a full angel policy yes, with our products. Uh -huh. Brilliant. So just pop in our just because on there. So that's from the Everyday Sentiments. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to trim that into a flag again. Yeah. So then that can just pop on the side there. We'll use a foam pad, I think, just to lift that up a little bit. And then we've got our moss as well, but we'll just pop our little butterflies on first, I think. And then we can I mean, again, I know you'd already covered, obviously, the wellies, but it all comes together very quickly doesn't it? It does yeah and all it is with the MDF as well is mostly I'll just use um, either cosmic shimmer glue or yeah. collal or something like that mm -hmm. just do a, a quick coat all over it just push make sure you push it to your edges lay your paper on sometimes it's easier to then flip it over and just leave it flat on your yeah. desk so it doesn't ru ruffle up yeah. um, but then that's all you're doing really trim around it with a craft knife or scissors if you prefer yeah. Um, and it is really simple to do. Or if you don't want to do that at all, you can just paint it. Use your yeah. chalk paints. Mm -hmm. Just put your heat embossing tool, um, embossing powder on there. Uh, there is a lot you can do and throw at MDF, and there's not much that it won't take. No. <laughs> yeah. So then, just finally, a few little bits of moss. We won't go too mad with this. I've seen it plenty. <laughs> all of that. But you can see how little we actually use of the 10 gram pack. Yeah. Yeah. So if you do get that collection home, you'll, it'll go a long, long way. Mm -hmm. So just the last couple of bits, and then we'll add our pearls on. Yep, super. In there, and then, yep, just little pearls, just in each of these. So I'm going to go for my brown again. Mm -hmm. And that pick-up tool. <laughs> <laughs> so popping that in there. Mm -hmm. And last one in the two little small ones. Can do with a little bit more glue in there, but it'll be fine. And then just finally, you're just going to pop it into your base, mm -hmm. glue it in place if you want to, but it will hold if not. Yes, yeah, yeah. That's and then brilliant. there you go. Isn't it? So, so gorgeous. And again, um, as Hayley said, you can make and sell these bits, but you're getting four projects for £9.99. So you can see just there that, that we've got, of course, um, all four of those projects, the gate, the watering can, the boots and the plant pot. If, of course, you want to get the Easter basket, it's there on the web. And you've also got the chance, of course, for the little birdhouse as well £2.99 on its own or of course you get four of those for £10 so a fabulous deal and um, so just pop back onto the web and have a check thank you so so much thank it's been you lovely. you're back at seven I am with yeah with Dave with, yes and other new bits and yeah new brand new stamps well, well the, we kind of give you a sneak peek now a little sneak peek of <laughs> we have to do these things don't we sometimes but you have you've got um, so many different demos um, and loads of other bits coming up at seven so do make sure that you tune in for that I'm back with Anne-Marie in a moment we are about to launch the permanent tape pen hunky dory's permanent tape pen if you want strength if you want something that is just going to be absolutely fabulous you're going to be using every single day in your crafting journey then you will want to get this remember if you want one you can get that it's there it's on the web and you can get that for under five pounds with change in your pocket best way to get it though is to get the tape pen with the two refills, we're doing you a bundle and that's going to be less than £10 with money back as well. So do not miss out. I'd get on the web. You saw how busy all of the hours have been today. Um, don't get stuck in the queues. Pre-order whilst you can. We'll be back with that right after this. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobby Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Hobby Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today's button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the Schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop 
and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. So never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobby Maker app. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobbymaker. Every day our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. to watch Hobby Maker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, on our website or on YouTube. So you can watch at home or on the go. What a day, what a day, what a day. Okay, um, we have got another brand new launch for you. Obviously, we've been speaking about this right from the, the top of the show <laughs> at one o'clock. I thought I've, I've just got to like let you know, let you get involved with this because we know how busy it always is with new launches. This tape pen is fantastic, I have to say. We are so excited. Yes. Yeah, so yeah. excited. Mm -hmm. I mean, we have known that these have been coming for a good few months now. <laughs> yeah. And when they arrived last week, I was like, oh my goodness, they're here. They're here finally. <laughs> and then it's like, great, get them straight on the show. <laughs> yeah. Oh, they're fantastic. And I think as well, obviously, we've all been having a little go with them. They're so easy to so use. So easy, aren't they? so quick. If you're not a fan of using wet adhesives, yes, you know, yeah, because. Yeah. They're not for everybody. Mm -hmm. Totally appreciate everyone's got their favourites. Double-sided tape obviously mm -hmm. is brilliant as well. Yep. But if you struggle with the backs, yes. yeah, yeah, things yeah, yeah. like yeah. that, um, this is just mm -hmm. going to be the best. Yeah, absolutely. It really is. Now, we've got uh, an amazing deal. You can go on the web if you want to and you can buy one of these. No problem whatsoever if that's the way you want to do it. But we know that people are going to want refills yes. because that's it's going to be something I think you'll use nearly every day that yeah. you craft without a doubt. But also you can use it for non-crafting things yes. and that's what I love as well. There's so many uses with this. So we want to bring you the best deal that we have. Okay. Now, that is where you can get one of these brand new tape mm -hmm. pens. You can also get two of the refills okay now you can see we've had so many of you already pre-ordering well done to you you're not going to be sitting in queues on the phone line that's why i love to pre-order as well um 
I love that this is refillable, I have yes. to say, because I think we're all conscious of plastic now yeah. and not wanting to waste things. Definitely. So you just need to buy one of these and then always get the refills. Yeah, that's something that we were really quite passionate about. We wanted it to be as environmentally yes. friendly yeah, as yeah, possible. Yeah. Uh -huh. um, and the fact that it's refillable, uh, the packaging is plastic free as well. Mm -hmm. So it's just yeah. all cardboard, so it can all go in the recycling. Yeah, yeah. You know, it's just all those little it things, is, isn't, isn't it? it, that do make a difference. Mm -hmm. And they're so easy to change as well because they just have a little clip at the bottom here. Perfect. Uh, and you're just I have to turn it around this have to mm -hmm. move around you have to just <laughs> press it in and open it up it's that simple oh, wow it's take, really simple take your empty one out uh -huh. and then drop your new refill in you can't put it in the wrong way because <laughs> okay, it, it can only go in one way yeah. uh, and then just close it back down oh perfect it's yeah. that easy so it's, it's so so easy so isn't it? easy um and of course if, if people are sitting here thinking well, well permanent what do you mean by that it's like super strong isn't super it? strong yeah so it's not repositionable basically mm -hmm. because you can get repositionable ones yeah. which they have their place yes yeah, yeah. What we want is good sticking. Yeah, yeah. You want we to want be doing your mats and layers, and it's there, it's done. <laughs> your card's not going to come out away or anything like that. So yeah, good sticking with this. Good sticking. Um, how much is the meter sort of length that we're? You've got getting, 22 then? meters on mm -hmm. what's in there, and 22 meters on each of your refills oh, wow. as well. So we're looking at having 66 Six. meters um, here. You already know it's going under a tenner because I told you this earlier. Yep. Um, so you know, let, let's not even mess around. Let's get that price straight down for you. Ah, oh, look at that. Pound 78. It's not even a 9.99. Mm -mm -mm. No, wow. so you are getting a saving, of course, with this because we always know you love a bundle, you love a saving. Yeah. So it's the best way to do it on a launch show, of course, for us to be able to say, yeah, get the best price that, that we can do. Yeah, really. yeah, it is just fantastic, mm -hmm. isn't it? And knowing that you've already got two refills there, because there's yeah. nothing worse, is there, of like getting something, it's got mm -hmm. the tape already in there. Yeah and then you run out unexpectedly. Yes. You don't know it's going to run out. Yes, yeah, Having yeah, yeah. two it backed up mm -hmm. is yep. just Absolutely. amazing. And, and I think as well, I can imagine, because we know with other adhesives that we've had from Hunky Dory, we've sold out, we've had to wait months to get them back yeah. in. You know, I know you've got a really big quantity of this, but who knows when, you know, when the refills will go yeah. out of stock and then we'll be waiting. So you better always have some, I always Definitely. think, ready there Definitely. to use rather than like only having the one and then you've not kind of got those extras um, as well. Um, so it is it is an amazing, amazing deal. 20% of this has already gone that quickly. Um, that's because like Deborah's buying four sets, yeah. Thelma's got two, crafters are getting two there. I imagine a lot of people are thinking, I'm buying it for me, I'm buying it for my friend, yeah. I'm buying it, kids. you know. Kids, yeah. yes, yeah. I think for kids, they can't make a mess with it. So but they can true. use it, it's easy, it's yeah. quick. <laughs> yeah. They're not gonna, you know, even for the little things that I was saying earlier, I put up some birthday banners in the office yeah. Yeah. yesterday with it, uh -huh. and they were like the, like the foil banners. Mm -hmm. So it was so easy to just run the tape down each side yeah. and just pop it up on the wall. We have like glass walls in the office as well, so I pop one on yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. But it's just going to come off nice and easy as well. It's, thing, you know, it? it's yeah. just fantastic. Uh -huh. And, and that, that, that is what you can do. It's so, um, okay, we're, triple figures have already sold now. <laughs> um, so well done to you. Um, it, it is super. I mean, like I said, I, I think of wrapping paper, you know, yes. make that look neater. I cannot wait to do that. Mm -hmm. And do you know what else I hate is, you know, um, when you kind of use your cellar tape and stuff, it, it, it's trying, you don't go yeah. and find your scissors, you're trying to bite it, yeah. and then your teeth, it's not working. It's just awful, isn't it? Yeah. So with this, it's like, choo, 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 and yeah. it's all done so, so speedy yeah. as all well. All sorts of things. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's yeah. going to be amazing. Oh, it's fabulous, it really is. And I do think that when you actually get this home, what I love about it is that you've actually got them inlets yeah. there to be able to kind of, you know, put your finger in your it's thumb. It's just really comfortable, it's, isn't it? It's ergonomic. It is ergonomic. Yeah. yeah, it's all thought out, and that's what I like. Yeah. And it's a lovely colour. So yeah, that's win-win as well, yeah. isn't it, and we really? Made, we made the, the dotty one pink as uh -huh. well so you can tell the difference uh, so yes, if you're you, wanna... you know this one is your dots yes, and your purple yeah, yeah. one is your tape yeah. Uh -huh. yeah absolutely um so you've got those so you're not gonna mix up you don't want to mix up that's for sure because nope. there's different places for these so um you've got that there at 878 are we able to just show the full screen is that possible because <laughs> i just want to show my names if that's possible um because all four of my um rows are totally it's full now what all you can space. see if we have a look at all four of the rows there if we can just like zoom out and see the whole of the screen then you can see the first three rows of people who have managed to get this the fourth row is people still coming through wanting to confirm look at them all ticking down yeah we can't we can't fit any more names <laughs> on and it's just constantly updating updating you can see some people obviously multi-buying it is that busy as we would expect as well which is absolutely fabulous yep. um, i'm so excited for people to actually get these oh, me too. Well. i mean you saw me using them earlier yeah. in the demos how yeah. quick does it make it mm. How much speedier does it make? If you are batch making, yes, this yes. is just, it is going to make it so much quicker. Uh -huh, yeah. um, and even if 
you're not, and it, it's just something that you struggle with the mm -hmm. double-sided tape, yeah. you struggle with the wet adhesives, just having something that's just so simple yeah, to use, exactly. but it's so effective, it's still mm -hmm. going to do the job that yeah. you need it to. Yeah, and that's what you want, don't you? And you did, I mean, you made a card in less than a minute. <laughs> so it was literally like, um, we had the stepper cards, they'll be available on the website, we've got the, the Miri Maz, and we had the new collection as well of the pocket pads. You use that, you went, tup, yeah. tup, 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 and all Perfect. of it, bang, one minute, and it was Stop. done. It was just yeah. brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> It's, it's fabulous. Yeah, it is. It, it really is. It's, it's just super. And again, I think the fact that for this deal, £8.78, and you are getting the runner, but you are getting two refills as well. 60% of the stock's gone. <laughs> oh, dear. I mean, great. Well done to all of you getting this. But this is basically our shows today, isn't it? Yeah. Where we're just kind of sitting yeah. here saying, we're not going to know. Like, oh. And then we have to get in touch. Natalie's going to be like, oh, my gosh, I want to go home. It's she nearly is. five o'clock. Um <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. She's not always there till five. Oh, there Don't you are. We're, we're fine. We're fine. We've got another, we've got another fifty minutes uh, to be able to see if we can get some more of these. Um, it's because most people are multi buying as well, which yeah. I think is what what yeah. you would do. And you wouldn't expect, would you? Let's be honest. For this price to be getting two refills as well, 66 as well as, yeah. meters yeah. of permanent tape. It's gonna last you ages as well, yeah. isn't it? I mean, obviously it depends on how much you're gonna use it, but you know, yeah. it's gonna last you a good mm -hmm. while. It is just amazing. Yeah. Do you know what else I really, really like with this tape, okay? Is you know, if you've got your glitters, <gasps> don't you love that? I like that. So you can create like backgrounds. If you, yeah, if you Shall want to, that? and you can literally use this, you can then put like glitters on it and it makes this incredible, like either a background or a border strip, whatever you kind of want to really. 80% of the stock has now gone it has now been allocated yes there we let's go you see the little, ease of this let's put yeah. a little a little sprinkle on mm, this is what i like doing that's a nice, oh. a nice color look at that sparkle yeah super yeah. straight edges as well yeah, it's great isn't it oh it's gorgeous yeah. that's the thing there's more than just it being yeah. like a, a, a glue that essence. a tap i mm -hmm. need to help laura out because it's going to drive her insane must pratt's <laughs> All we can hear in our ear is, it's really bugging me that I just don't know what oh, Natalie's made in her ears. <laughs> and Marie's like, I'm just ignoring her. I can't, Marie's like, I'm just going to answer. <laughs> I can't ignore it any longer. <laughs> and Dan's got no clue. He's just sitting there smiling. Like, Natalie's I'm probably sure. just going to be like, what are they doing? <laughs> Um, oh, but also, like, we can pop some of our yes. sequins on here. Yes. If we want to go in and add, like, little rows uh -huh. yeah, really good of idea. our sequins, mm -hmm. we can do that as well. Mm -hmm. Obviously, I've just put them on completely random <laughs> there. But, you know, you can do yeah, you all can. sorts of things yeah. like that. Yeah, definitely. Um, embossing powders. Yeah, it's great for that. As well. It? Mm -hmm. yeah. It's just going to be... Yeah. Oh, it's just wonderful. It is. We and love it. Yeah, and just Absolutely you see it. that ease yeah. of just being able to actually use this as well. And it pops straight off, doesn't it? Like, yep. you know, like you're not sort of pulling at the glue no. or anything like it's that. Wonderful. It's wonderful. Yeah. It is amazing. Yeah. So, so easy to use. Mm. And let me just... I mean, obviously, don't don't be wasting any paper like this. But, you know, just uh -huh. completely folding that flat. And you don't yeah. have any, like, lumps or bumps no, where it is either. That's it's so super true. smooth. Or like it, and you know yeah. what? When <laughs> I never hate that, though. But do you know what I mean? When it just kind of comes out. <laughs> but that happens, doesn't I it? I know exactly And it's really mean. frustrating. None of that happening. No, Dave's walking in thinking, what, what are they doing? What are they um, talking about? <laughs> Um, so over 80% of the stock has now gone. There's loads of you still coming through for this. People are buying up to sixes, as you can see. I, I would do the same. You're getting one of the runners. You're also getting two of the refills with this. Should we just show the ease of the refill again? Yes, and absolutely. It yep. So it's got a little kind of yep. button at uh -huh. the bottom here that you just need to press in. Just yep. press the bottom Fab. section, mm -hmm. open that up, take it out. Pop your new so one in, easy, isn't close it? it back up. Amazing. That easy. Absolutely incredible. And brand, brand new for you to be able to get this today as well in that gorgeous purple colour that we can see with those little kind of inlets as yeah, well. So your thumb and your finger just fit perfectly into those grooves. So you're not going to slip. That's the other no, thing. No, it's got those. a little ridge bit on the top mm. as well. So you, you, it just fits yeah, your hand perfectly, it does. doesn't it? You're going to get it in the right place. Yeah. You're going to get that super strength as well. You've got 22 metres on each of them. Yeah. So you've got a huge amount to be able to use as well. Okay, we 
have, when, when everybody with it in your baskets um, check out, we have 30 left. That is all, okay? Wow. Um, we had hundreds <laughs> of these that were available. I mean, it's 14 minutes past the hour yeah. Um, yeah. and we've got 30 chances left. Right, we'll see whether we can get extras of those. Um, but do you want refills? That's the other question because probably a lot of you will want to stock up with that and then get more refills whilst they're available as well. Um, we do have a deal here. Um, so you are going to get the chance to be able to get three refills, okay? Um, I was just trying to see if there was another box, but... Uh, are there two at the side of it, refills? Yeah. Yeah. Well done. There, we, there go. we go. Three refills. <laughs> Good spotting. <laughs> so we'll get the price straight on. We don't want to mess about with anything like this. Loads of you have already bought them. Um, so three of those today for 8.38 as well. Oh Such my. good value. So another mm -hmm. 66 metres. Oh, wow. So good. And this it? is all that you're going to need once you've got yeah, this. You don't need to buy that again. This is all that you need now. Mm -hmm. That's it. Yeah, exactly. And I think the thing is as well is that we can see how popular <laughs> it is. I know you have a big amount of stock, you know, we do, because yeah. you've ordered it in. But that, by yeah. the popular popularity is not going to last that long. No, please to be don't honest. worry about the stock because we do have a lot. Yes, you yes thank we goodness. We allocated yeah. a figure. Uh -huh. We didn't know how many no, we, can always get we needed um, for today's show. But the, the difference is always with a launch show is these deals, isn't yes. it? It's the prices, the it's deals. the fact that you're getting discounts. So, you know, yeah, you, you, you still get these, can't guarantee 838 every show. No. That will be for a limited period, I would imagine. That's why I always think the best time to get it is the first day, yeah, the first definitely. show. And, and guaranteed you know, stock. Today, guaranteed. we know we yeah. definitely have lots of yes, stock. Yes, because it's new. <laughs> it's new. Thank goodness we have enough stock <laughs> to be able to kind of, uh, you know, uh, obviously talk to Natalie and add more in when we need to. Mm -hmm. But, um, I mean, if you, if you think for less than... This is where my maths is going to do, but for, for well under twenty pounds, less than um, eighteen pounds, mm -hmm. you're going to get five refills if you wanted to get both yes. these bundles and the and tape the pen. The tape pen itself, and that is that's going to do you for a long, long time as yeah. well. You know, you've got it there, haven't you? Yeah, absolutely. So, great little present for someone as well. Oh, if they love crafting. definitely. Yeah, maybe teaming it up with something like the magazine, or you know, yes, that comes with yeah. those crafty bits in mm -hmm. there as well. Yeah and then popping this yeah, together. It's great, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Really, really good idea. So loads of you coming in. I mean, people are multiplying again on the mm -hmm. refill bundles. Um, as Anne-Marie said, it's here, it's available today, and it's available at this price as well, yeah. at this discount launch price. So it's such a great, great time mm -hmm. and an idea to be able to get this. Um, it, I, I'm, I'm so excited for them. <laughs> Aren't you? We have been so excited all day. Yeah. It, just the whole day has just been absolutely wonderful, hasn't it? it? Has. Um, and the, the, the thing is as well, I do think that for people who haven't used a tape pen before, mm -hmm. once you use one, you don't want to go don't back. Go back you still use out. different adhesives for different things because there's different yeah. purposes, but it's the ease, isn't yeah. it, of a tape I felt pen? A bit, I felt a bit sad for my double-sided tape in my, <laughs> in my toolbox earlier. I was like... <laughs> I think you're going to be retired because yeah, you've not got to get a like no. flick it up or anything no, like that. It's just going to be quick. Yeah, 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 yeah. Super speedy. Uh huh. Absolutely, it is. Yeah, it's just yeah, super speedy, super strong. Loads of it. Twenty-two meters on each of these as well. Yeah. Um, it's just fabulous, and yeah. I like how pretty it is. If I I'm know. Really honest with you. So. <laughs> so pretty. <laughs> yeah, that's where I'm like, oh look at you, aren't you lovely? <laughs> I just like have it on my display. Yeah. It's just got to be there, hasn't it? Yeah. yeah. Just out. On, yeah. On, yeah. You know, like normally your craft desk and you put everything back into your no, drawers, no, no. you'll be like, ta-da, yeah. you can stay out here. <laughs> yes, we've just had a question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, of course. Um, some people have just asked they can just get the tape runner um, on its own. Yeah, you can get it individually. Mm -hmm. Of course you can. We can bring it live for you individually as well. It, it's nice to have all the different options, That's really, it. We, isn't it? We wanted to just make everything available in the refills, yes. in yeah. the bundle with the refill, mm -hmm. with the pen on its own. Yeah. The, I think you can get a refill on its own as well. Yes, you can. You know, I think, the, I think we've got every option well. available. Yeah. yeah, so 3 99 which is brilliant, isn't it, for the tape runner that you've got there as well. And a lot of people will want more of the tape runners as well because they might yeah. be thinking, well, I want one, you know, at home. I want one in my bag. Yeah. I want to make sure that I've got one. Maybe you've got a caravan or something like that. Yeah, and you take exactly. It, you you know, want to take it out work, and about. If yeah, you do work sure. in craft. So it is nice to have more than more Definitely. than one if you're using it at you know, different places and things like that. Yeah. And again, a brilliant price at 3 99 yeah, it is fantastic, mm -hmm. isn't it? Mm -hmm. Honestly, we have, we've been waiting for these for so long. Yeah. We've spent such a long time researching uh -huh. all the different kinds of 
yes. adhesives yeah, that yeah, you can get yeah, in yeah. them, um, the actual uh, case in mm. itself. You know, we had so many boxes we wanted to take, like the plastic free yeah. packaging, it had to be refillable, mm -hmm. you know, all of those different things. So it's taken us a long time to get these. Yes, so yeah. to actually get them to wear now, uh -huh. it just feels yeah, like fab, so it? exciting. Absolutely. Oh, I'm so, so glad that we're able to share that with you as well. Now, do you know what we're going to do? We've got other adhesives we want to share with you. Um, we will leave these with you for now. Um, if, of course, that bundle does sell out, we will manage to get um, some more stocked in for you. So that's not a problem. Um, so if it says sold out, bear with us and we'll just reload it in for you because it's the brand new show. So we know we've got a good stock. Now, on the last show uh, that, that we did, obviously, an adhesive launch, yes. it was all about the super size construction. Bad boy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, and it was so, so, you know, so many of you managed to get this. Now, you can buy one of them for 9 99 mm -hmm. We've still got the deal on at the moment, we though, do. for three for two. We do. So I would just ignore this myself. Yeah. I, I In all honesty. Um, because why do you want to pay that when you can get them for £7? Yeah. Less than £7. Yeah. Um, so that's one. But if you would like to get three of these today, that is your opportunity. Mm -hmm. Then you can get them not for £30 today. We'll give you one of these for free. Um, it's still there. As we always say, you have limited times on these kind of offers. Um, it's still available at the moment, which is brilliant. Three for two. One free. It's amazing. Mm -hmm. What is that? £6.66 each? Well done. Good math, yeah. <laughs> Bargain good, price. Bargain, bargain, bargain price, price, isn't it? Yeah, and for people who maybe haven't seen construction glue, why do you need that as well as the tape pen? So construction glue is a wet adhesive, mm -hmm. okay, which means that when it's you're gonna use it with anything that's porous, like your paper, cardstocks, yep. um, your fabrics, your felts. Okay your kind of MDF, like kind of balsa wood yes, things, yeah, even yeah. ceramic, someone mm -hmm. told us this the other week, mm -hmm. didn't yeah, they? Yeah, they did, yeah. Like anything yeah. that's kind of porous, because it is a wet adhesive, it's gonna kind of fuse those surfaces together yes, right. beautifully. Mm -hmm. So it's gonna give you a super strong finish. Brilliant if you're doing any kind of construction, as it yeah, says, yeah. you know, box making, um, making any kind of, um, I, I don't know, like projects that are a little bit more mm -hmm. dimensional. Mm -hmm. yeah. Some of those cards that maybe have got a little bit of movement yes, in them as yeah, well, yeah. you wanna make sure that they're nice and secure. Mm -hmm. And um, they are just, it's fantastic for that. Yeah. But we have had people fix all sorts yeah. with this. We were told well. so much on our I was show. in the in the green room earlier, just at yeah. my lunch, and Hayley came off sewing street. She right. was like, oh, I forgot to tell you, I fixed my boots. Oh, and I was with like, the construction guy. Oh, she was Brilliant. like, look, I fixed them. Fixed, they're done. <laughs> she genuinely fixed her boots with a construction But you glue. said that you'd fix Joseph's, fixed Joseph's school, school shoes, shoes with it. Yeah, so, I had to go and buy yeah. new ones last week, though, because <laughs> wrecked them even further. Um, <laughs> Why do boys just wreck everything? Honestly, yeah. But shoes, we had the lady yes. say she'd fixed her ceramic, yeah, ceramic yeah, ornament yeah, yeah, yeah. with uh -huh. it. There were so many there different things. There was, stories that people had sent yeah, in. Yeah, it's and, amazing. And this is, instead of the 60 mil, 250 mil that we've actually got in this so it's going to be again long lasting um like you said before as long as you just pop the top on and have yep. that little click you know that it will keep yep. it fresh yeah it has the lid attached to yep. the bottle so you can't lose it no which is good um and when you pop that lid on mm -hmm. i've just kind of placed it on the top but when yep. you actually pop it upside down and if you listen uh -huh. to the can hear it kind of yeah. clinking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's when you know that that lid's on secure. Yeah, um, so just make sure we all like the bubble. Yeah. Um, just make sure that lid's on nice and secure and it yes. won't dry up. We had someone get in touch and tell us that they'd had one mm -hmm. with the lid open but lid on yes, yeah, yeah. for 12 months yeah. and it was still absolutely yeah. fine. Yeah, they'd come back, they'd been away for a year, hadn't they, from yes. their house and they came back yes. home and it was still working still perfectly worked. well. still worked, absolutely fine. Yeah, so it, we don't know how long they last but we know definitely over a year, yeah. <laughs> So, um, which is brilliant and you'll have used it up, I imagine, in that time. I know, anyway, this is the thing, people. when someone said, like, what's the shelf life? I'm like, well, we don't know because it never lasts that long. <laughs> oh, no, exactly, <laughs> that's the thing. Um, so brilliant, brilliant deal on those. It means as well that you don't need as much storage space because mm -hmm. you can just have those big ones. So keep checking out. Um, on those. Uh, well done to all of you getting them. Now, we also have a deal today on the smaller bottles. On the babies. Don't we? Yeah. yeah. The babies. And, and I just, I, I feel like you need both because say if you're like going in your bag, you're probably going to want a little one to throw Definitely. in. Definitely. Yeah, like yeah. So this one is great for getting into my toolbox. I can't fit this one in my toolbox yes. that easily. Yeah, yeah, Something's yeah. got to come out really yeah. to fit that in. Whereas these two, um, they're perfect to just get in the toolbox. Mm -hmm. But like you said, you know, if you wanted to decant some yeah, bigger ones, you if you've got a couple of empty bottles yeah. you know you can kind of have this one at home mm -hmm. and then just yeah. keep refilling keep your filling. smaller bottles yeah, exactly then you can do that as well yeah so they should be 17.94 if you were buying six of these individually at their individual price now we brought them at the price that we normally bring them which mm -hmm. is 12 pounds 99 mm -hmm. on the last show 
we are going to beat that price today. I believe we are going to bring the lowest price that these have been on at. Mm -hmm. How exciting. So for one day only, if you're thinking, I want the big yep. bottles, I want the small bottles as well, you know, for different reasons, different purposes, then this is going to be your chance. And construction glue is just something you're going to always, always need. Always, always. Yeah, you just, you know, even if you've got some, get some now mm -hmm. while it's on offer. Yeah. Because it's, it's not going to go out of date. You still no, exactly. <laughs> um, Nine pounds ninety nine. Best price ever. Yes. Such a good price, yeah. isn't it? Best price. Never been better yeah. than that price yeah, um, on incredible. any show. Obviously, since we launched here at Hobby Maker, um, and, and it is. I mean, then you get in sixties again if you want to. Uh, split them out, split yeah, them to your friends, you know, yeah. share them, share them around. Yeah, at that sort of deal price. Yeah, sure. So, I mean, um, I, I don't share things like that, but <laughs> you know, you can. You can if you're not oh, Anne Marie. Oh. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but you've got that chance today and uh, they will be going back up to £12.99 but we wanted to just make it possible for you if you want the big bottles you want the small bottles as well um, to be able to get both really yeah. to be honest at the very very best prices that we can um, you'll know um, if you're watching the, the previous show that we did when we launched the Super Size they were £12.99 that mm -hmm. is where they should be that's where they'll go back to but I know that until midnight tonight we're going to be doing a £9.99 deal on those which is I mean it's extraordinary for six yeah. bottles isn't it yeah it's it's amazing, isn't mm, it? It's yeah. such good value. Um, it really is fabulous. And you're just gonna you're just gonna use it. Yeah. Everything. Uh -huh. everything. And do you know what else I like with the big and the small is the precision. You know, because yep. you've got the that precision. doesn't change. No. Yeah, absolutely. You've got the exact same nozzle on yes. both of them. So it isn't like we've got a bigger bottle, so you know, mm -mm. you're losing that precision. No, you're exactly. still getting that there as yeah. well. So you will, you'll get it exactly where you want it, which yeah. is what you need with your construction glue. Just get that sort of wiggle room of where you want it. Um, so they're down to nine pounds ninety nine, best price ever that we've seen them. <laughs> um, so well, well done, of course, if you've managed to get those. Congratulations. Um, lots of people coming through. Okay, now we did tell you on the last show that these had gone, didn't we? And we didn't know when we would next get these back in. You did a stock take. Yeah, I think down. we must have uh, located literally one box. Yeah, because there's 14, <laughs> there's 14 sets, that's it. And when we saw that these were back on our poll, we were like, are they back? And you were like, no. no. Um, so there is only 14 chances. Yeah. Um, so they've obviously, yeah, like a big box has just been found in yeah. stock take. And um, we wanted to bring them back on for you because we, yeah, you don't know. What what were they out of stock before for like eight months or something? It was a very long time. Was this about the one that was like a year and was it over a, a year? year and two months or oh, something? Yeah. So who knows if that will happen again? And, and these are magic glue, aren't they? Because they're purple, but yeah. they're dry clear. Yeah, absolutely. So they'll go on to your project purple, which is brilliant if you mm -hmm. have any issues kind of seeing yes. the clear yeah, adhesives yeah, yeah, when yeah. you're putting those on. You see that, um, but they will uh, go on purple mm -hmm. and they will dry clear. So if yeah. you do have any adhesive that kind of goes onto your project, mm -hmm. kind of comes out the edges, anything mm -hmm. like that, it's not going to be purple forever no. as soon as it starts to dry it goes purple um mm. so just brilliant for foot inserts papers yes. yeah, any yeah, of your yeah. lighter weight projects Definitely. i just feel they're fantastic yeah. for and you're getting 12 you're getting 12 yeah. of these glue sticks as we know um there's that that 7.99 brilliant price 14 okay seven chances <laughs> left now and that that is actually it because we thought they'd all gone you did a stock take we yeah. found 14 extra chances so we wanted to bring them to the show because we know how many of you um uh, were sort of going what we don't know when they're going to be back <laughs> in stock four left i'll leave them with you they're going to yeah. be a sellout so well well done if you've managed to get them of course um, we have the craft glue pens. Is this the uh, the one behind it? Yeah, yeah, yeah perfect. <laughs> These are great, very, very These popular as well, aren't fab. they? Do I have mine with me? I feel, I feel like I did this last time. I don't have it with me today. <laughs> Do you want to oh. open it again? No, because I feel like I did that last time. I think it's okay. Are you sure? There's not definitely not one open in there. Um, let's make sure. Let's just have a I don't want to. No. no. Oh, oh, yes. Yes, yes, this must be the one we opened last time. See. Perfect. There we are. We nearly did a double day then. We, we didn't did. Need to. We didn't even need to. We've already got this one. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's not here. He's now. not here. He's gone. <laughs> um, so you're getting six of these craft glue pens. Again, these dries clean. are great because they've got, again, they've yeah. got the little ridges at the side. Again, really ergonomic, nice and easy to hold, just like you would a pen. And you can do those super fine mm -hmm. kind of lines if you want to, but you can go in and do your smaller kind of yeah. dots as well. Um, so again, really good for that precision. Mm. Um, it is a dries uh, clear glue yeah. as well. And in the lid, 
<clears throat> if you can get in super, super close to the lid, you will mm -hmm. see there's almost like a little pin in the lid, a plastic pin. Oh, yes. So that is going to go into the nozzle so it isn't going to get blocked. Oh, it isn't okay. going to dry Perfect. up. Um, That's clever, You're going this it? way. I don't know if you can see it from the overhead. Yeah. So um, that it pin is going to go into yes, the, the okay. pen so it's mm -hmm. it, it can't dry out. Again, very well thought out, very yeah. well de you know designed, isn't, isn't it? it? And yeah. it's a nice squeezy bottle mm. as well. So if you do have kind of dexterity issues, it's yeah. really nice and easy to kind of squeeze yeah, which is as fabulous. well. Yeah, yeah. It's um, and you're getting them for £11.94, so we're talking less than £2 per craft glue pen that you've got there as well. Um, oh, we're going lower? Oh, so we oh of course we want a deal. Are you crazy, yeah. Laura? Of course we want a deal. Then. <laughs> we always want deals. We always want a deal. Uh, um, oh, wow. Okay. Very good. £7.99 like instead. Um, so you're looking at yeah, just over a pound, really, yeah. a pen, aren't you, to be able to get this? And it is. It's, it's super precision, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, definitely. Uh, mm. It's brilliant for any, uh, again, if you like kind of lightweight paper embellishments, yes, yeah, you know, yeah. if you're making paper flowers, mm -hmm. things like that, yeah. that, it's just ideal, yeah. isn't it? And again, with your sequins, you know, if yes. you're getting your pearls or anything like that, and you're thinking, yeah. well, I want things like that, it's, it's great just kind of do a little dob where you need yes. it, isn't it? Yeah. Um, and easy to use, that's the other thing. Um, once again, we've said about children, yeah. it's going to be one they're not going to get super messy with. Um, Bowie, did I tell you when Bowie came home covered in glue? <laughs> oh my gosh. So he came home from school, he wears a green, it's green, his uniform. Came home, he was covered in white. And I said to him, I said, oh, have you been painting today? Like, covered. And he's like, oh no, I haven't. I was like, well, what have you been doing then? And he was like, I've made a moon. I was like, okay. And he was like, this is all glue. <gasps> so happy with himself. I was like, oh, great. Wonderful. Like, at least you know in school, paint is like washable. You know, they use the kind yeah. of water. Like, anyway, here we are. Um, so yeah, so use something like that. Don't give a child like mine, who's the messiest child in life anything Just like a pot of glue <gasps> open glue no i'm yeah. like oh anyway they had a lovely time but yeah this isn't going to do that so that's much that better to good. use uh, loads of you coming through with that 7.99 keep on checking out um we've got a fantastic deal on the white craft glue so i do want to bring this across because mm -hmm. this is so good um 12 bottles in total for you to be able to get of your premier craft glue um and once again, um, this this works the same as the pens. Yeah, in absolutely. It's just the same bottles. adhesive that's in there. It's just a different bottle. There's just everyone's got their preferences, haven't yeah. they, on what yeah. they like to use. And again, this one though, it has a lid that you can't mm -hmm. lose. It, no, it screws off, but it doesn't. Yes. come off it doesn't fall off it's yeah. not going to come off that lid isn't going to come off you're not going to be able to lose it mm -hmm. and again when you close that it seals it, it pushes that pin through so yeah. it completely seals that adhesive so again it's not going to dry up yes. it's not going to get lost yeah, yeah, yeah. you know it is again just perfect yeah um but mm -hmm. you've got i think it's 40 grams in this in this one yeah um what yeah. you get in here i can't remember what you mm -hmm. get in this one but have a look on one of the boxes yeah I? um 18 mil. oh 18 mil yeah you? Um, so you get more in these, yeah. Um, but you know, it's horses for courses. Depends yeah. what you prefer to use, doesn't Absolutely. it? Absolutely, yeah. So you're getting yeah. twelve of these. Would you like them for a pound a bottle? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's do. I love an adhesive show. We kind of talk about oh. why we use each different thing yeah. as well, and you know, we we do these kind of deal prices as well. Yeah, definitely. Sometimes you just don't know because no. we, we're demoing sometimes, and we're like, oh, I'm just going to use this glue, and you might be sort of thinking, well, why, why that one? Uh -huh. Why yeah. not that one, and not another yeah. one? So. And when you come to craft, um, you know, when you're sort of starting out, I think initially you think there's just going to be one glue for everything yeah, and then you definitely. sit there thinking what yeah. <laughs> like, you know you probably just think there'd be a prit stick and you just use that yeah. you know and, and that's all and actually there's so many different so uses many for different everything kinds. yeah um and fabulous fabulous price there at 11 pounds 99 for you to be able to get all 12 so that is a pound per one so you get a full box full um which of course is going to give you loads of uses lots of people of course asking about the tape runners brand brand new today um we have got the permanent tape um runner We've got that fantastic bundle. I mean, this is this is the most popular way to get it. This is what most people are doing, where you are getting one of the runners and two of the refills mm -hmm. as well. I mean, it's yep. just fantastic, isn't it? Yeah, it's su just such good value, mm -hmm. and it is just so easy to use. Yes, yeah, and yeah. And the fact that we're getting change from ten pounds, we're getting change from nine pounds. <laughs> you know, yeah, uh -huh. yeah. doesn't make it's, sense. Does it's it crazy, isn't yeah. it? Mm -hmm. Sixty-six meters of yes adhesive in there mm -hmm. permanent adhesive super super easy to use yeah uh, it's eight mil wide as well so it's a nice chunky width mm -hmm. it's, you know yeah, it's which is good it's yeah, yeah, yeah. it's just yeah. nice isn't it mm -hmm. it's wonderful. we've got people buying up to tens you know ten sets of these and i imagine it is because people are thinking it's the launch show it's the yeah. first day to be able to get this um i want to get it for me my friends my yeah, friends yeah exactly. you know, and I'm doing the got, same. like crafting clubs yes, things like yeah, that. yeah yeah and while you're at this deal price mm -hmm. of £8.78 for you to get one of the runners, two of the refills,
landfills as well. Um, we are over allocated, okay, on this stock. It, it, we've still got some to sell, mm -hmm. but we will then just reload some more in for you. Yeah. That isn't a problem at all. Um, so don't worry about that. Just kind of, we'll just wait until this runs out and then we'll kind of reload some more in. Um, should we have one more look at just how easy yes. it is to actually yes, refill yes, yes. as well? Because yes. it, it's just all been thought out and that's yeah. what I absolutely love it about this. It is just so easy. So yeah. on the very bottom here, there is like a little kind of button, if you will. So if you push in on the bottom half of the tape runner, mm -hmm. it's going to open that lid. You just take out your empty, yep. pop in your new one and close it. Amazing. It is that simple. Mm -hmm. It's so, so easy to do. Yes. You just can't go wrong because you can't put it in the wrong way either. So no. you, you, you don't need to look at it and think, well, which is the right side? Because mm -hmm. it, it can't go in that way. No, so, exactly. you know, there is only one way. It is so, so simple. Mm -hmm. It's just fantastic. Yeah, it, it, it is. It's brilliant. Um, so comfortable to use. Absolutely fantastic. Yeah. 22 meters as well in, in each of these refills um, and in the tape runner as well. So you're getting 66 meters. I mean, that is bigger than what? Bigger than a blue whale. <laughs> there we are. I like this. Oh my word. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, 66 meters. I don't think I could even run that. We were talking about our running earlier. Oh my goodness. Absolutely. So, <laughs> one is, is bigger it? than a blue whale. So, oh. you could have three blue whales that you could have. They're about 20 meters oh, as well. So, we can take round a blue whale and a half of one. Yeah. yeah all the way around. <laughs> Um, well done, loads and loads of you coming through with this £8.78. Um, it is such a popular way to get it. There's extra refills that are available as well. Um, so do, of course, keep on checking out with that brand new today. Right, we've got all the foam pads back in stock. So yes. should we kind of work through all of these as Absolutely, well? Absolutely, yeah. Yep. Yeah. So we're going to start with the strips. So we've got the strip selection. One of my faves. Is it your faves? One of my absolute faves, yeah. Mm -hmm. well, they're all my favourites when we get to them. <laughs> um, but at the moment, it's the strips. Different <laughs> sizes, haven't we? So we strips? do. So you've got two different sets within there. Yeah. Let me grab for you. So mm -hmm. you're going to get the chunky strip, okay. which is this one. Yeah, perfect. Thanks. So you're going to get a whole sheet that's those times mm -hmm. six. Yeah. And then you're going to get a sheet of... Um, I. Do I have this one with me? I think I'm out with my skinny strip. Oh, I've got some skinnies got here, though. Should we just there. take one off? Yeah, yeah let's do it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> We're just going to always so, blame Dave now, aren't always. we? Whatever. It's like, but yeah, you get so to see. So you've got that one. Yeah. And you get that super skinny one. So they're the three different sizes you're going to get Perfect. across your 12 sheets. So you'll get six sheets of the one that's got the two smaller uh -huh. sizes on. Yep. And then you'll get six sheets of the one that's got Brilliant. the wider size on there okay. as well. So lots and lots of variety. You see us use these mm -hmm. all the time for yeah. the frames, you know, kind of maneuvering around shapes yes. and things like that. Shaker cards are fantastic yeah. for. Mm -hmm. um, just in general, you know, these are the ones that I think I turn to more often yeah. than any yeah, of the yeah, others. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I think it's that you can cut into these as well. So you can yeah. make them the length you yeah, want. Yeah, I do all the time. Nice. You can see on my sheets. I've always got like yeah. snips and bits yeah. cut into. It doesn't matter you'll use it for something else. Yeah. You never waste any no, of it. No, absolutely you? not. No, you um, always come to them. And it's so good. I mean, £9.99 to be getting 12 sheets of this as yeah. well with all of those three different sizes is, is just fantastic. And I just love how they just Me bring a card too. up. I yeah. like that elevation. Yeah. And I said this earlier, with paper crafting, it's very easy for it to all look flat. Yes, you know, when you do, yeah. Even when you're just doing mats and layers and things like that, but mm -hmm. putting your toppers, your sentiments, embellishments, yeah. just giving them that dimension just makes a massive yeah. difference. But mm -hmm. also, obviously, when you look at your decoupage, mm -hmm. you know, your fussy cutting and you want to add yeah. some layers into your projects, then they're, they're just an essential. Yeah, they are, aren't they? Um, and of course, that super duper price of £9.99. Lots of people coming in, multi-buying. Again, foam pads are something that we have in the past sold out of. And we're yeah. saying, well, we can't bring you these. Um, you know, already about a quarter of the stock has gone that we've currently got of these. And it's because they are an essential. They yeah. are so popular. And people restock, restock, restock. Yeah, don't we they? just can't keep them in stock. No, <laughs> no that's the thing. <laughs> Oh. No, especially certain <laughs> ones like these ones, which yeah. are just, you know, a firm favourite, really, with, with everybody. Um, and it, it just, it's easy. It's easy yeah. to use, easy to kind of get so your projects simple. with that, that elevation yeah. as well. Um, and a brilliant price at £9.99. So massive well done if you get that. Um, should we come Do across to... Take those? <laughs> should I just keep them? I look like Edward Scissorhands. I feel like Wolverine. <laughs> Wolverine, yeah. There you go. Maybe that's my next job. Um, <laughs> used to be an actor back in the, the day. There you go. <laughs> so, oh, do you know what? I was a juggler, yeah. Um, I, I told Bowie about this yesterday, that I went clown school. And um, he was like, what? You went to clown school? And I was like, yes, me and one of my best friends, Zoe, we were at clown school. And then he got the boards. He's like, juggle them, mummy. I was like, sure thing. Um, yeah. You went, went to clown school? Yeah. As if this is a thing. In Barcelona. Yeah, we were in like the mountains oh in Vic in word. Barcelona. Yeah, clown school, you know. 
My life That's is good. That's hilarious. No, I'm not going to juggle. Um, I did that in jewellery maker and it went horrendously wrong. So we won't, we won't do that. But these are the circles. Again, yes. they're fantastic, aren't circles they? Circles we absolutely love because you are getting... Um, all of these tiny, mm. well, I say tiny, so they're like a, kind of like a centimetre, I would say, yeah, aren't they? Yeah, they're great size. Um, but they're brilliant yeah. for your sentiments, you know, yes. absolutely perfect yeah, yeah, for yeah. using for all of our little bus and sentiments, mm -hmm. all of those little tiny embellishments, things like that. Um, but I also need to remind people that you can still use the rest of the sheets. Exactly. Sheet. Okay, uh -huh. so once you've taken your uh, circles off, yeah. once they're all gone, mm -hmm. you can still use this. Mm -hmm. as an adhesive because yeah. it, it still does the job it's yeah. still foamy uh -huh. it's still going to give you that height exactly yeah. and nobody's going to see it under no. your project anyway no, you're not going to know that you know, you've if you're that, popping that under a topper yeah um, but yeah like laura said you could use this so if we could take the top mm -hmm. off let me yeah. just grab that with my pokey tool just the top mm -hmm. carrier sheet yeah. so not the underneath yeah, the top, it, it doesn't, doesn't want to come. come off. It doesn't want to come off. It says I don't feel like it's this. It's very sticky, yeah. I can get mine. Oh, there you go. There Do you it go. like that. Um, there's this one, so you can just see... Oh, how cool that look to ink yeah. through? That's great, isn't it? So you've got a stencil right yeah. there on that as well, which is just brilliant. So there's so, so many uses, of course, with these, and they are down to £9.99, 12 sheets again, um, for that super discount price. 20% of that's already gone. Um, we've got the Midnight Black as well. It's handy having a black one, I think. It is really handy. This would be great along with our steampunk. Oh, yes, it uh, would. Pads. Yes, yeah. yeah, 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 absolutely. Yeah. Anything where your project is using black cardstock, darker mm -hmm. cardstock, where what you don't want is that flash of a white foam pad at mm -hmm. the side. You yeah. want that kind of darker finish. So yeah. these are absolutely ideal. Um, and you're going to get the two large sizes yeah. in here. So you're going to get the 19 um, by uh, 38, mm -hmm. which is the rectangle. And then you're going to get the 24 by 24 square. Yeah. yeah. They're super, aren't they? They're the only ones that are done in black, aren't they? They so, are, yeah. Um, only chance to actually be able to get those. And again, we're matching that price, £9.99 for you to be able to take advantage of those. So a super duper opportunity on them. Always very popular whenever mm -hmm. that colour is in stock. So well done if you've got those. We've then got the small foam pad selection that we can see here. Yes. So this has got a real variety in mm. it as well. So you have got... The kind of one centimetre. Do you have the teeny tinies in here as well? Is it just those two? I can't remember. Um, it's just those two sizes, isn't it? Mm, yeah, yeah, I think so, actually. Yeah. I mean, it's tiny. It don't is get me wrong. Tiny, but yeah. we do do it ridiculously teeny tiny yeah <laughs> um, so Even you've got smaller. the kind of one centimeter squares yeah uh, and then you also have i don't know are they like three mil squares would you say they're very small aren't they they are dinky that? Mm -hmm. yeah but yeah. again great for your smaller embellishments yes yeah yeah these really come into their own when you are um doing your decoupage and you've got your decollage layers and you've got all those tiny little pieces. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is where you need all mm, the variety of foam do, pads because yeah. what yeah. I like to do with mine is I turn the sheet over, put all my mm -hmm. foam pads on yeah, yeah. and I don't look at what the shapes are. I just think, oh, that's a big space yes. and that needs a big one. That's yeah, a tiny yeah, space. Kind of Let's get, oh, that yeah. one would be great for a circle one, you know, yeah, and you end up yeah, using yeah. all the different shapes yeah, you and sizes. Then, aren't you yeah, well, really. definitely. Um, so that's your small pad selection. Once again, matching the price at £9.99. Um, and then we've got the large, haven't yes. we? We've got the large pad selection yeah. as well. Um, so another 12 sheets on this, um, which again, you can snip into these if you want to, can't you? Yeah, it's the definitely. same sizes as the black, isn't it? Yeah, you actually get in with these. Yeah, you've got the large rectangular and the large square as well. So again, six and six mm -hmm. of each yeah, of those. Perfect. Um, but uh, just brilliant for your larger toppers, yes, your yeah, larger yeah. mats and layers, things like that. Mm -hmm. um, those and the strips are the two that I probably use the most often. Yeah, 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 yeah totally. Um, so then £9.99 again. So we're making sure that we're matching all of those prices for you. So um, well, well done of course, if you have managed to get that, because um, they are, they are essentials. Yeah. And we wanted to make sure that now they're all back in stock, that we could bring them all to you at £9.99. So a fabulous price. The A4 adhesive sheets, they're back in. They are, but I don't think it's these ones that you've got, Laura. We they haven't the got them. pad ones. Oh, these aren't them, yeah. No. Uh. Um, we can probably just bring up a picture from the web. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see if we can find those um, as well. We'll have a little, we'll have a little gander. Cool. Why not? Yeah, because um, you can die cut these, you know. Oh, can you? Yeah. yeah. That's cool, isn't it? Yeah, they are really cool. Can I... Can I, just I mean, you can snip into them. Have I got a die before? <laughs> no, I've not done it yet. <laughs> we don't even know if we can play them, but... <laughs> we'll no idea. I've got a little... Mm. A little die. Mm -hmm. I'll use this die. I don't know if it's still in stock. What, the... Easter one? Sunday die. Easter Sunday. We can have yeah. another look as well. Who knows? We can try and find it. show you so Just doing cool. your own show now. I know. <laughs> I do my own things. Right, Laura's found these. So she's found <gasps> the four A4 foam sheets. I've not seen these before. Oh, so cool. Okay. 
nine so pounds cool. 99 because you can mm -hmm. if you've got some really intricate sentiments like yes, this but yeah, you yeah. want to still lift them up you still want to have yeah, that foam yeah, yeah. then you can die cut oh, through brilliant. this so let me get some of my is the Easter Sunday thing. dye available or is that sold no, I out I do think you know? it might have sold you think out it's sold out sense. maybe sold out Oh, I don't think I've got. I might have what to do you want to that tape now as well. I'm having yeah, to borrow yeah. everything. Uh, hey, which one? This, this one? one here. Just oh no, not this one. Sorry, these. You want to open them? Sorry. That's okay. Have we got some scissors or anything? Or should we just? I've definitely got scissors. <laughs> <laughs> Good. <laughs> I have got some scissors. <laughs> On a craft show, we'd hope, wouldn't we? <laughs> uh, <laughs> We've got some scissors. We've uh -huh. got some scissors. <laughs> Let me just get yeah that one. Okay, thank you. That bad. Let's yeah. not take the whole thing apart. Mm -hmm. Uh, I only need a little bit. I don't know where all my things are. I must have taken all stuff out. That's why I asked if you had scissors. And then, you know, who knows? <laughs> honestly, I've not put things back in. Do you know what I think I was doing? I was making room for my big construction glue, so I've taken yes. out loads of essential things. Yeah. And I think you just got excited about the tape runners. Yeah. Really just, like, filling it with that. Definitely. <laughs> okay, yeah. so let's just pop that mm -hmm. on the top of there. Okay. So cutting into that metal plate is just going to give us more, yeah. more cuts. Mm -hmm. <sighs> you plugged in. Plugged oh, yeah. in, not turned on. Perfect, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Perfect. Yeah. let's mm -hmm. have a look at that. Amazing. And see. Yeah. Um, but yeah, if, you're, if you've got these really intricate dye, yeah, yeah, yeah. dye sentiments yeah. and you want to layer them up, mm -hmm. sometimes you look at me and think, I can't put, there's yes. nowhere for me yeah, to put yeah, both yeah. parts. Yeah, of course. Um, you can actually cut through this. It doesn't matter. Because um, but also, through. obviously, the sheet you can cut to any size uh -huh. you want as well. Brilliant. So let's let see. me see. Yep, yeah, that has cut. Amazing. Let's just get this out of here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Let me just take that little bit of tape yep. off. So you do need to have a little bit of, mm -hmm. a little bit of patience <laughs> just to take this out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then it pops out, there we go. But it will pop out. You just need to kind of yep. help it out mm -hmm. is all. Lovely. Let me grab that on there mm -hmm. and then just go in with our, yep pokey tool just to take out any of that excess there mm -hmm. that's like in between because obviously the backing sheet is like a bit of a plasticky yes, kind of finish yeah, yeah, yeah. so your uh -huh. dye doesn't okay. always kind of cut 100 percent through it yeah yeah but you can see how that yeah. is looking yeah already and then of course once this is what we're going to do darling that's what we're going to do there we go <laughs> read my mind mm -hmm. Because you can make yourself, you yeah. can buy stickers like this. Yeah, and yeah. So they are expensive. They are expensive. Yes, yeah. So you can be make making your yourself, own you? with yeah. your dyes, Brilliant ideas, with your glitters, yeah. mm -hmm. with all of your other different, um, uh, you mm -hmm. know, embellishment yeah. bits. Yeah, definitely. Let's just grab. Super. There we go. So you do just have to. Well, yeah, just kind of tease those. Little yeah. Bits and get them out, and then they're there and they're done. But you'll get there, mm -hmm. and yeah. just get that. Amazing. D and that little bit of the A as yeah. well. Uh -huh. There we go. There and go. then let's get this onto mm -hmm. a little bit of paper. Yeah. Oh, there's just a little bit in the ink. I'll have mm -hmm. to get that because you know me. <laughs> I'm just going to annoy you, it isn't will. it? It's going to bug you. All the way home, I'll be yeah. like, oh. <laughs> And then take uh -huh. off your yeah. back in. Yeah. Oh, it's so cool, isn't it's it? It's so good. Yeah, brilliant. And then you yeah, can do this yeah, with any die as well. Yeah, it doesn't yeah. have to be. Yeah, and you've got that height then, haven't yeah. you? You've got that height. And mm -hmm. then go in and grab mm -hmm. your back in. So again, oh, just yeah. taking that uh -huh. a little bit slower because the, the kind of pressure yes. yeah, yeah, yeah. of the machine does make it a little bit uh, stickier mm -hmm. yeah. than it already was. So I'll just yeah. go in. I'm trying to do it all in one go, but I know, it's like, it's absolutely like, no, I don't not. Want, I don't want not, to do this. Not doing it. <laughs> not doing it. Yeah. So what happens when you... Uh, you can see that quality, that definition, can't you? That yeah. you're actually getting because of it being cut into the foam pads that you've got there. Yeah. And to have that sort of double-sided stick, so it's like sticking on the bottom, and then you've got that stick there um, as well that we can actually... And you could put your... Uh, if you wanted like, I don't know, a mirror card or a shimmer card or something mm -hmm. on the top of here, you could stick that on first yes. and then die cut it all in one go. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, you can do it that way for sure. Um, mm -hmm. Let me grab this last little bit and then we can go and add some glitters. Mm -hmm. And I'll pick a different one because we've done gold. Mm -hmm. I've got a few different ones with me. Yeah. So we'll see what we have. Come on. <laughs> so you do need to take, take your time with yeah. this. 
squeeze it up. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to leave it where it is because yeah, yeah. Uh, we're going to be yeah. forever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We get the, I, I will just keep, yeah. uh -huh. keep going with it. My will will go gold because all my colours yes, are sequins. Too. Yeah, yeah, perfect. So we're just going to dab that mm -hmm. in. You can see obviously where it's yeah, not it's amazing, stuck, it? but it yeah. looks so cute, mm -hmm. doesn't it? Yeah, it's lovely. Let's just pop that onto my other sheet mm -hmm. so that we can pop that away. But imagine we peeled uh, all the yeah, backing yeah. off. Yeah, it's incredible, isn't it? <laughs> it really is absolutely amazing. So It's so yes. cute, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. We just ignore the Sunday. Yeah, 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 if we took that off. Yeah. <laughs> <It's fine. laughs> Um, so, oh, so, so much. There's so many adhesives there. Now, don't forget that it's all about, of course, that brand new launch. Do you know what I was thinking? Mm. I don't know whether we could do this. Um, but, you know, we had, we launched the new collection earlier, which is phenomenal. We could, in the, in the last few minutes as well, could we, could we put one of them together with the tape pen? Yeah, of course we can. Yes, okay. Um, right. So, we're going we're gonna to have Davis here, and he is ready, and he is going to let you know about the next three hours, which is going to be absolutely incredible. Um, hello, Dave. You all right? Hi, Sherilyn. Lovely. Thank you. Looking forward to this evening. We've got three fantastic shows on the way. Five o'clock, of course. Uh, James is back from Creative Expression. I haven't seen him for about a month. Good to have him back with us. And we've got for you layering, uh, layering dyes. Mm -hmm. We've seen layering stamps. We've seen layering stencils. Now there's such a thing as layering dyes uh, from Sue Wilson. That's going to be a big launch at five o'clock. Followed at six by another look at the new pocket pads, of course, with Anne-Marie over there and uh, Hunky Dory. And at seven o'clock, uh, yep, we're back with the Dreamies. Hayley will be here with more and a brand new stamp launch, actually, from Hayley at seven o'clock tonight. So Dream is Sue Wilson with Creative Expressions and James and, of course, Hunky Dory, all to come between five and eight. See you then. Fabulous. So another amazing three hours. Now, we have sold out of our allocation of the Tate Runner Bundle, but we said there's loads. We can bring you more. So we are going to add more in for you, OK? Um, so we are just logging that back in. Obviously, the most popular way to buy this is to get one of the Tate Runners and two of the refills. We are talking um, at getting this at under £10. In fact, under £9 is the opportunity that you have got today, which is absolutely phenomenal. Um, and you've got 22 meters on each of these that means we're talking 66 meters that you're getting for eight pounds 78 it, 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 crazy, it is phenomenal it? they're so easy to open to refill um you've got of course those little inlets as well to fit your fingers um you've got the non-slip grip at the top mm -hmm. so you know that you can't get it wrong it is absolutely extraordinary um hundreds and hundreds of you have come in and taken advantage of this and of the refills um which you can also get which they're on the web um and it is just such an exceptional exceptional chance for you to be able to get this um, at £8.78. Um, now, we, um, we, we know how much you're going to love this. Now, at the beginning of the show, hour ago, <laughs> we had three sellout launches, which four times we kind of did. Now, this works, I have to say, perfectly with these. So if you want to have a little look at this new collection, it is available, so we can, we can get you that. You can absolutely take advantage of that as well. So we had um, the stepper cards. Yeah which we've got just there. They sold out four times. Yeah. Have, we got, have we got any left at the moment or are they yeah. going to be restocked for the later show? We have got more. That is brilliant. So yeah. that will be coming up in an hour, sold out four times. We then have the Miri mats, okay? The coloured oh, Miri mats, yours. okay? Have a little look on the web. They are available, the coloured Miri mats. And you got all five of the new... The new... The brand new. Yes, the brand new pads as well, OK? They are absolutely exquisite, right from getting um, your, your haberdashery, your garden days, your steampunk, your, your men's leisure and your paper art. Now, the great thing is, and this is what I love about this, these two launches, they're on the web, you can jump in and get them, is that the tape runner is perfect for putting yeah. these together, Ideal. isn't it? Yeah. You, you did the quickest card ever yeah. in that earlier show. <laughs> Should we do it again with yes, the tape runner absolutely. just to show how easy it is to use it? So we're just going to start by folding yep. our card in half because mm -hmm. it does come flat packed. Yeah, brilliant. So we're going to score, burnish along all mm -hmm. those scores, and then we're going to concertina the sides up to create those mountains and valleys to create that step effect. Yes, yeah, okay? fantastic. You can't go wrong. You can't kind of fold it back mm -hmm. on itself no, once you put that middle one in. Yeah. Uh, so it has to go down to create that mountain and valley. We're going to give those a really good burnish, making sure that mm -hmm. you get those inside scores as well as the outside perfect. ones at the top, because that will make sure it stands up beautifully when it's on display. Mm -hmm. 
And then we're going to pop that to one side. We're going to come to our pocket pad. So I've taken this one. We could have gone with mm -hmm. any colour background, yeah. but I thought this just picks out that kind of lilac mm -hmm. colour in there perfectly. Yeah. We're going to use our tape runner so that we can mm -hmm. just add that little yeah. bit of adhesive on mm -hmm. there that we need. Just add in yeah. that gorgeous border. Oh, I'm just going silver with uh -huh. this as yeah, well. Yeah, perfect. Um, and then I've got two foam pads on the back. It's just one of my strips perfect. cut in half. That is just going to sit Seconds. in the middle Done. of there mm -hmm. to give us that perfect it's amazing, frame. isn't it? Uh -huh. It's yeah. just incredible, so, isn't it? So, so yeah, that's how quick it's going to be. Five for three on the little, uh, the little, the, the, the paper pads, uh, the pocket pads that we've got there. An amazing deal, of course, on the Miri. And you see how those tape runners just work. I mean, so seconds, easy. Yeah. you pop that on and it's there. It's yeah. safe, it's secure. We know it's got that strength yeah. and 22 metres in like to be. lots of mats and layers. Yes. Oh my word, uh -huh. it is going to be a game changer. If yeah. you're using double-sided tape, mm -hmm. and it's still got a place, yeah, you know, don't get me wrong, yeah, yeah. Like, but if you're, if you're using double-sided tape and you're spending that mm -hmm. time taking the backing off, yeah. then pff, yes, it's I going know. to be amazing. Uh -huh. Shall we Should we just show one last time how easy it is to refill? Yes, because this is absolutely. what I love. It's not at all like fiddly or anything like no, that. No, not at all. It's mm -hmm. so easy. Uh, so the bottom yeah. of the tape runner has mm -hmm. got this little kind of button here. Yes, so yeah, on the yeah. very base, just push that in. The lid okay. will pop open. You just take out your old one, mm -hmm. drop your new one back in. You can't put it in uh, the wrong way. No, you can't physically go wrong. And then and it's there. The yeah. And we've got the refills still available as well. So if you want three additional mm -hmm. refills, £8.38 to get the refills. I mean, we've got crafters buying five, two, mm -hmm. sixes, twos. Some people have gone for 18. That's what we're seeing. It's sensible. You're getting stocked yeah. up. I know. You're getting you stocked up. You, you know you've got them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We know they're available. Yeah. You know things go out of stock quite regularly and it takes a long time. We also know you've got the discount launch price. Yeah. And that's the other thing. We all love to save. We yeah. never know how long launch prices are going to stay on for. Yeah, exactly. Um, um, we don't know um, when that price might go back up, so it's best to always get it whilst you can. Yeah. Um, I just, I just, I just am so happy that we got I to know. actually launch all of these fabulous, Me fabulous too. things today. And I would say, jump back on the website, go back, confirm, of mm -hmm. course, on that earlier collection as well, that five for three, and on those coloured mirror mats. They're both still available. But remember, the restock of the cards is gonna, it's gonna happen. You're gonna yeah. make it happen. So it will be with you in an hour. Um, and then you've got all of those new things that will I be know. coming to you with the next oh, few days. Goodness, How it's exciting! Be the best day, uh -huh. isn't it, when isn't that it? arrives? Yeah, it all just kind of come, and you'll be like, Zzz. I just feel like <laughs> having so much fun. I'd be like, I've got three hundred and sixty. She's like, I'm like, just, just, just with my tape pen, like, yeah, yeah, sure. I've got 66 metres to go. 66 metres, I can yeah. just order some more. <laughs> tape and everything. Are we? Yeah, yeah. Dave, 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 will, <laughs> Dave will probably like this fact. Dave, did you know that 22 metres, that is more than a big blue whale? You know the biggest <laughs> whales? You can actually use this. That's smaller, mm -hmm. bigger than a blue whale in your tape pen. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh Isn't that unbelievable? I know. <laughs> nice little fact <laughs> for you. <laughs> um, well, well done to all of you. Um, you're back in an hour, yeah. aren't you? Um, we are going to get to see all of that new collection again. Um, you're going to love it. You're going to get more demos as well. Um, of course, Dreamy's up in the final hour. And we have got waiting there in the wings. James, I can see it's a beautiful new collection um, with creative expressions. So very, very exciting. Thank you again Thank you. for a lovely, lots of fun. Um, and um, I'll see you on Friday at the same time, one o'clock. Um, and I'll hand over now to Dave and James. to watch Hobby Maker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, on our website or on YouTube. So you can watch at home or on the go. Here at Hobby Maker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and checkout and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the combine order button. Shopping made easy at Hobby Maker.
shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Hi everyone, good afternoon. It's done on five o'clock. Hope you're well. Thank you, Sherilyn. She's back on Friday. I'm with you right the way through until eight o'clock tonight. And as I mentioned a little bit earlier, got great shows lined up. Creative Expressions on the way. Uh, we've also got, of course, more from Amory and uh, Hunky Dory and Dreamies with Haley to come between now and eight o'clock. Lots and lots to look forward to. It's shift change time. So who's in the hot seat in the gallery today then? We've got Dan on knobs and buttons. There he is. And we've got Alex. There we are, there he is. He's taken over now until eight o'clock producing. He'll put all your messages on the screen. He'll set all those fantastic prices for you. In the studio, we've got Lauren on camera too and on the floor. Anne-Marie setting up for a later show, which I said, I'll see you at eight and it's not at six. Um, so that'll be in an hour's time. And we've got James back with us as well. Good to see you, mate. Good to see you too. It's, it's been great a while. To be back. It has been quite a while, yeah, far too long. Now, too James long. is here from Creative Expressions, bringing us a brand new collection from Sue Wilson. And these are layering dyes. So you can literally use the elements of the dyes to cut out different parts of the flower in different colored cardstock if you want to. But before we get to that, a bit of a treat. I know you've had a busy afternoon. It's been a very busy afternoon uh, with you calling in and ordering on the website. It's gonna get even busier right now because we've got, thank you Creative Expressions, a showstopper, a showstopper, an absolutely incredible deal. I've brought this dye to you before. I've shown this dye to you before. We looked on the system and so many of you bought it at the proper price, which is a good deal at 14 99 I think it was. And we may have done it for £12.99. I'm talking about this. Now, you may look at it and you think, hmm, good, but what do, I, what do I do with it? What could I use it for? I mean, this has got so many uses, James. It's it? really, really versatile. Yep. I mean, and we're going to be using it as lattice work, use it for decorations. There's so much you can do with it. And, and you it's can repeat sky. cut it. It's a repeat pattern. So there's no edge to it. So you can keep going for as long as your piece of paper. So imagine if you've got any florals, which we have in the show. <laughs> it's been planned that way. But look, look how gorgeous that dye looks. It's like a, a lattice that you'd have in the garden with your trailing plants, your trailing flowers, your trailing leaves all over it. Now, we've already got Francesca in, and we haven't even shown you what we're going to do with the price. We have quite a big quantity of this to give you which is good news, which means hopefully all of you watching stand a pretty good chance of getting this. I mean, I don't know whether you're a Creative uh, Expressions customer already, uh, whether you've bought dyes from them before in the past or not. It doesn't really matter because this is going to be an all-rounder. You can use it for all sorts. Totally snippable, total repeating pattern as well for backgrounds, that sort of thing. We've got people checking out already. Judith in uh, North Yorkshire's checked out already. Debbie in Greater Manchester. Francesca in Cambridge has checked out already. Okay. Let's put a clock on the screen. Only a 30 second one, 30 seconds to wait until you see where this price is gonna go. And I've got to thank you, James, for this. You spotted this, didn't you? I did, I saw it and I twisted a few arms and I thought this is gonna be perfect for this collection. Yeah, and perfect for this collection. Really perfect perfect to go to bring it on. For all sorts of other collections as well. It could be for sport, it could be for a, a goal, it could be for a tennis net, it could be for anything like that. An ice cream cone if you wrap it round. Yeah, absolutely, yeah. yeah. Okay, three, two, one first deal of the evening. Push that button, Alex. He's pushed it. Six pounds 99. Last time this was on air, dozens and dozens of you bought it. It was 12 pounds 99 and worth every penny of that. And I'm sure you've used it so many times if you bought it before. It is six pounds and 99 pence. 10% of the stock's gone. 
I just knew this was going to be a really popular one because there's, every, there's everything to like about this and nothing to dislike. You haven't got to think about it. It's no. going to be a great background. It can be a background. You can use it to put, over, as I've done, I've put it over the top of flower pots, cornets to give texture. You can go tone on tone. So much. I'm really pleased to be able to bring it to you today and that's yeah. a great price. And, and you know, a dye like this that would sell every day of the week at $14.99 has got no reason to be reduced other than creative expression is nice people. And they said, yeah, okay, yeah, you can have it. Yeah. Quarter of the stock gone, we had hundreds. A quarter gone, hello, let's give you some name checks here. Gian, or Jean, is it, in Derbyshire? Angela in Devon's checked out. Judy, Katrina, Elaine, Anne in Buckinghamshire. Janet in Manchester, Maureen in Kent, Janet in West Yorkshire. Loads more coming through. All you've got to do, if you've never ordered before, remember, call the call center, free phone number, and say that you're a new customer. Can I have an account? They'll set that up for you. It takes a minute or two to do that. And then say you want this, SP2884. If you want to do it on the website or the app, just tap the app. If you haven't downloaded it, download it free from your app provider. And the web website, of course, is hobbymaker.co.uk. And you too can make back your first ever purchase from us at Hobbymaker if you want it to be. What a great first purchase that will be. It's, it's fantastic. Yeah, yeah, it's a great dine at a great price. I'm really pleased to be able to bring that to you today, actually. Yeah, me, it is a, me too. So it's a good find, so. All right, well, I'll I tell you what, we'll let you carry on checking out on that. If that sells out, I'll let you know. If we have any left, I'll remind you a little bit later on. I know five o'clock's a bit of a funny hour. Maybe people are getting in, people have got distractions, you know, getting kids tea, that sort of thing. Let's move on, though, to the main event, because I'm excited about this. I know uh, James has got the boards mm. to show you that explains the process of this a little bit more. Straight from the outset, I want to let you know we've got a set A and we've got a set B. So if the whole I want it all bundle is a bit too much for you, you can choose either set A or set B at a smaller set, smaller quantity and a smaller price, obviously. But the best deal to save the most money is to buy the I want it all. And these are layering dyes. Now, I know, I think Sue's done some layering dyes before, hasn't she? She has, yeah, yeah. She's done some, some floor layering dyes once before, um, but that was a year or more ago now. So these, yeah, brand, brand new. These are only been about five days a week. Uh, so this is the, the most recent collection from Sue and most recent for layering dyes. So yeah, they're, they're really novel, really, really yeah. novel. great I mean, to use. I love layering stamps. I love layering stencils, both of which we've had on the channel before. But layering dyes is something a bit new to me, but it's perfect. Maybe, maybe if you want to colour them in, you can still do that. Just use plain white cardstock and colour it in with your pens or paints or whatever you want to do. But what I love about it, and if you look at this one up here with the tulips, I think it is, you can see you can use your different coloured papers. Maybe you've got some coloured cardstock stock from Creative Expressions or American Crafts or whatever, you can use the dyes because they're individual elements. So the petals are individual, the stems are individual, the leaves are individual. If I just take this one, which is the first one in the bundle, this one is your hydrangea. But look, it's elements that allow you to put the flower together. And of course, you've got the picture on the front to follow. If you're thinking, I don't know what goes where, that's uh, like, a, like a guide. But you can then use all the elements and your coloured papers to cut all the elements of the hydrangea out and put it together. So it's layer upon layer upon layer. It's not 3D exactly, is it? Because it still lays flat. It's it? still, yeah, it still lays flat. And this is the nice thing. It's so easy to work with. Unlike uh, some of the floral dyes we've got where you sort of make them into quite a dimensional piece, this is more flat, more layered. Yep. Um, and it, like Dave said, it's so easy to be able to turn around and use different coloured cardstock that we've got on today's show. Yeah, we so have. If you don't want to colour your card stuck up, you can just colour out different um, pieces of card and I'll show you in a minute the instructions inside actually shows how to layer up. Dead okay. Easy. So let me run through what you're going to get because you're going to get your, um, you're going to get your bundle A which is going to be your magnolia, your cone flower, you're going to get your hydrangea, you're going to get your tulip and you're going to get two sentiments, a special friend and also sincere thanks as well. So that is bundle A on the top, okay, but if you're going to go for all of it you get everything anyway. Bundle B is your hibiscus, your rose, your aster, uh, then you've got just for you, and you're too kind. Okay, so that is bundle B at the bottom. So, if you want the I want it all, you're gonna get all of that. All the sets of dies, so that's seven sets of dies in total, and four sentiments, not for £103.40. Bearing in mind, this is a brand new release. It's only been out a matter of days from Sue Wilson. If you've never met Sue, she's a fantastic crafter, a fantastic designer, a lovely lady. We don't see her as much in this country as we'd like to. She's based in America now, isn't she? She is, yes. But uh, she might pop over to see us one day, who knows? Should we get the price down? Okay, £103 worth. Today, the whole collection is yours for £69.99. And that is on split pay as well. 
So if you want to spread the cost into two payments, you can do that. Be our guest to take advantage of that. It's fee-free, interest-free, $34.99 today, plus your PMP, and $34.99 in four weeks' time. But we're going to run through the boards, aren't we, to have a little look yeah, at what we, we do. Yeah, should we take a look at what yeah, you can do with them? Look. Yeah. Because I think the thing with uh, floors, they're just so, so versatile, they're so timeless, aren't they? So what I've done here is I've cut out all the different elements. I'm going to start with the rows, and I will show you how it works with each of the packs. So as Dave was showing, you've got all your die sets inside there, but what Sue's done is ever so clever. Inside there is some instructions of how to actually put them together. They're dead easy to do, so she's numbered all the dies, and if you want to actually make what's on the front of the packet, you can follow the numbers, one through to five, six, seven, use your different coloured card stock like Sue's done there, and you'll be able to create exactly what's on the front of the packaging. So it's dead, dead easy to do that. So that's all the elements cut out. I'm just going to show you what some of our design team have done with them, including Sue herself. There's some amazing, amazing samples here. So let me just work through these quite quickly. So which flower is that? Is that so this is the rose. Right. So yeah. there's so many different ways you can use them. There's a little tag there that's been done for us. Let me go through each of these. You can just use them white on white, tone on tone. Nice. You can go really go to town there, which Sheila's done with uh, artwork and colouring them up. That's look, absolutely stunning. I think we've oh. got the uh, pot on today's show as well. That's we become very, very popular. So we have got the flower pot, which obviously works with all of these as well. So you've got your red roses, you've got your purple, all different colours, and then you've got something really nice and simple and stunning like the Sue's done there. And it's for weddings, anniversaries, it's so t absolutely timeless. And then this is the one we're going to have a go at in a moment, which I will demo to you to show you how that works. Okay. So that's the rose. Now they are available as individuals, so if you want the rose on its own, that one, where's the rose, where's the rose? Okay, £14.90. So you get about a one pound ten pence discount, which so should be fifteen ninety nine. Uh, the two bundles are going to be on the website for you. The operator can help you as well. Bundle A, by the way, is going to be thirty nine ninety nine, and bundle B is going to be thirty nine ninety nine as well. So if you bought the two bundles, you'd be paying ten pound more than if you buy the I want it all. You get an extra ten pound discount. Okay. So we're going to put the bundles, bundle A and bundle B, on the screen. So bundle A, remember, has got your magnolia, your um, comb flower, hydrangea and your tulip and the two sentiments a special friend and sincere thanks. Excellent, we'll have a look at the tulip now, shall we? Yep. So that's made up of 12 dyes, 12 different elements that make the uh, tulip flower. And I'll show you what some of our design team have done with those and Sue herself. So a massive shout out to all of our design team. Thank you very, very much yeah. and Sue for all the samples because they are stunning. I will show a few of these on my shows tomorrow as well. I'm just gonna go through a small selection just to give you a bit of idea what you can just do. And they are so, so easy to use as you'll see in a minute. And you said to me before we uh, came on air that you had a lot of fun during I the have, day. I've had a lot of fun with these, yeah, because I think the results are so stunning and yeah. they're quite easy to work with. Um, so this is the Magnolia. So there's 11 dyes in here with 13 different elements. And if I go through all the different samples here that we've got from our design team, you can see they're all so versatile. And it's so refreshing different. to have all the individual elements of the flower rather than just one dye well, you, that cuts the same flower out. Absolutely, don't. yeah, you don't have to just turn around and, and this, this is a good example here, you're actually using vellum on the magnolia. It looks really, really nice. Ooh. Different, really different uh, technique and uh, texture to the whole thing. But you could just do one flower head. You could do a whole spray of it. You could wrap it around the trellis work being the magnolia. So there's loads and loads that you can do with them, absolutely. So that one is your... That's the uh, magnolia. magnolia. I've got the cone flower here as well, which I can show you. So there's the elements from the cone flower. It's 10 of those. And then you use all those, build them up, and then you can do all these types of samples. So again, it doesn't have to be the whole flower uh, with the leaves. It could just be the flower head. You could do it in silhouette, like it's been, been done there. That one's actually just been cut into the cardstock, and then it's just raised. It doesn't show there too. So oh. That's just a really, really different. It like doesn't that. have to be a whole spray of uh, flowers. It can just be one element. So that's the cone flower. Yeah, lovely. And we've got more as well. We've also got the hydrangea. Now, I love it. I was going to say it's my favourite, but I actually got a lot of favourites in this collection because it is so good fun to use. So the hydrangea here, all these different elements make up the hydrangea flower that we know so well. And again, you can do all those different colours and the blues, the purples and the lilacs. And remember, a lovely every card packet everyone. has got a, like a little booklet. You open it up and every it shows you the step-by-step step yep. putting it together idea. Yeah. I'll show you a little bit, as we go through each demo, I will show you each of the packets to show you how you can, you don't really need it. It's nice though, if you want to re recreate exactly yeah. what Sue's done, you, you can do it, it makes it quite easy then. So this is a hibiscus, so really nice and tropical, I mean, at this time of the year. 
Oh, boy. It's, you can just go absolutely mad with your colours on these. Yeah. You can have all sorts of really striking colours. Again, just going with just the flower heads or build them up with the foliage and the leaves. So you're not stuck to just having to do one thing. This is made up with the same dye, just cut out multiple times. And I know that a lot of you, if not most of you, are probably now thinking of spring. We're thinking Easter. That's the natural thing to think about after Christmas, apart from Valentine's Day, of course. But flowers really kind of come into their own during those seasons. So they're all year round anyway, though, aren't they? $69.99 is your extra special discounted price. You save another £10. If you were to buy bundle A and bundle B, you'd be paying nearly uh, 80 pounds so to get the all the i want it all bundle both bundle a and bundle b together 69.99 saves you another 10 pound note and it's on split pay as well which of course the individual bundles wouldn't be because it's under 50 pounds and one pmp for the whole day 3.95 and i know many of you have bought stuff from hunky dory earlier and dreamies earlier on today so you've probably already done that this is a delivered price for you and it's only been out a few days so it's jz2896 and there's one more i think to show there's what there's one more and we've got some sentiments as well to show you so this is the aster uh, so there's all the elements there's 10 different dyes in this set so so again, I, I'll actually show you a sample, I think maybe tomorrow on the demo, something similar to this, just using the actual flower heads itself. Mm -hmm. It looks absolutely stunning. So there's so much you can do, or like Sue's done there uh, with the foliage as well, and also some of our design team that's been done here as well. Again, every single one's completely different because of the style of how versatile the die set is. And again, there's the flower pot that we have got on today's show. So it's, uh, it's worked. We haven't got many of those, I don't think. No, I don't think we but have. It's quite, it's quite a popular one. I'll tell you and what. After you've done the sentiments, I'll just... Shall we just go through the sentiments things? very, very quickly yeah, as well? Yeah. Yeah. So on the sentiments here, so these all tie in with uh, Sue's similar design to what I've bought you before, but all completely brand new and different. So for a special friend, all two die sets, you've got the shadow as well, just for you. And these are all included in the bundle. Uh, sincerely thanks and you're too kind. So they're all a two-part die with a background and the words as well. I think these are going to appeal to absolutely everybody because there's a lot of you that like to colour, so you can still do that with these. You just use white cardstock and colour it in however you wish. But there's also an awful lot of you that don't like colouring that would love to use maybe coloured cardstock for the petals and for the stems and the leaves, that sort of thing. That's where this is going to come into its own because we've also got this on the show, which is the foundation card pack from uh, Creative Expressions, the pastels. Now you've got 220 to 240 GSM, they vary. Four sheets of five colours, but look at these colourways. And bearing in mind the time of year we're in, it's still dark, early and late and so on. It's lovely to have a refreshing, bright and cheerful colour palette, which is what you've got there. Blues and pinks and purples and greens in there. So if you fancy that, you can add that to your order for just 6 99 And if you've already ordered uh, the die set and checked out, remember the phone call's free and it's no charge to order on our website. And of course, you've already paid your PMP. So that's a 6 99 delivered charge for you today. And what James was talking about, the flower pot, perfect to put these plants in and these flowers in. We don't have many of these. Um, James was right with that. You've also got Just For You as a little verse in there as well well um, we'll bring the price straight in on this 5.99 for your flower pot perfectly sized to obviously have these flowers inside them so fc 2885 lots of you already coming through for this Rita in nottinghamshire sue in bedfordshire and in kent and in greater manchester loving the idea of putting maybe the tulips maybe the roses into the flower pot we are flying it's so busy yeah i know so i knew it's gonna be a popular collection very click, yeah. Okay, well, enough, enough waffle from me. Let's have a demo from James. <laughs> Should we have a demo? Yeah, okay, yeah. so I'm going to, um, I've start, decided to start off with the, with the rose there for you because I just think it's such a, such a popular flower, so versatile. Um, and I'm going to show you just how easy it is to work with these. So don't forget, you can turn around and, as Dave said, use coloured cardstock, but I'm also going to show you how you can go a couple of steps further using some of our colour cloud and our pixie powders can as well. Can I just let everyone know before I forget, and I always do. I've forgotten. <laughs> it, we're gonna do, I haven't done this for a while. We're going to have a Davy B lucky dip. So if you fancy winning a card, an original card from James that he's going to make on the show today, all you've got to do is email in. It's studio at hobbymaker.co.uk with your name, your address, and your customer number. That's all we need, okay? Name, address, customer number, and one person at random will be selected at the end of the show to win one of James's cards. So it's studio at hobbymaker.co.uk. Good luck. Excellent. Okay. So as I was saying at the uh, top of the hour, this is how they come packaged. So I'll just give you a closer look there. So um, although we're going to do something completely different to what's on the front of the packaging that uh, Sue's done there for us, this shows you, I don't know how close you can get in there, but you'll see the numbers on the uh, packaging. You can actually follow through the number of the dies and then follow uh, Sue and actually make up an identical uh, design to that, um, that piece on the front of the packaging. 
So that will give you an idea of what you can do with that. But we're just going to take a few of those elements to start with and um, make a, a slightly different uh, design to that. So if uh, I show you how to start You've it, put yeah. yours on magnetic sheets. They don't come on magnetic They don't. Sheets. No, no, good point. They, they don't. I mean, it is a good top tip. It is a woodware magnetic sheet. So I just actually, that's how I store them like that in a, right. in a little wallet. And it's really clean and tidy. And I've always got the references to everything. Cool. Yep. Good. Yeah. So let me show you how we're going to start the card base off. So I've just got a, a nice... Uh, Dale card here, and I've just used some of the card stock that Dave was showing you just a moment ago. Mm -hmm. So we've got the nice pastel pink, and I'm going to make sure we start off as we mean to go on. We've got the card opening the right way. <laughs> I'm just going to start. I thought I'd show you some matte layering with the card stock as well, just to show you how I'm only really using one or two colours throughout the whole of the uh, the design. So let's go on with the pastel pink over the top of there, just to give it a little bit of a, a border. And then I'm going to bring in a embossing folder that I've brought along with me as well today. So it's a little bit like the, the lattice die. It's something I saw and I thought this is absolutely perfect to go with the, um, with the flowers that I'm bringing you today. Okay. So when you've embossed that through, using exactly the same cardstock, that's how it's going to look. So that's the front, like that. It's a 3D embossing folder. So you've got a lot of depth there. If you can see that probably quite clearly there now. That's impressive, isn't it? It is. It's a really, really, it's absolutely perfect for this collection. But we're actually going to use the reverse. Oh. So I'm going to use this folder in three different ways over the course of today and tomorrow. But we're going to use the reverse. So that's how that will look if you go for the folder. We've got that on today's show. And I'm going to uh, add a little bit of colour to that using some of our colour clouds. Now, if you've seen me before, you know I absolutely adore our colour clouds. They are little pots of ink with the felt top inside and it gives you loads and loads of colour in there. And this is the rose blush that I'm going for. And it's got a little ring of sponge in the bottom, if you've not seen them before. And you've got this donut sponge with a felt top uh, on top. And then you use these, these smoothies here that we've got. And you just apply the ink by popping it into the pot like that, charging up the, the smoothie, and then you've got the ink ready to use straight on your smoothie. And there's no need to wash these out. You can kind of keep the same colour uh, if you're going to do a, a batch of these. But I'm going to show you what, how I'm going to treat this piece of uh, embossing folder. And all I'm going to do is take the smoothie and just ever so lightly, just rub it over the top, very, very lightly. And you can see where that's going to be going already. So you're getting an absolute stunning design. And it's as simple as that. It's just using the colour of the, the rosebud from the uh, colour cloud with the pastel pink cardstock that we've got yeah, in the pack. Isn't it? So the colour clouds that I've picked together today for you in the sets are done very, very specifically to go with this cardstock and with this collection. I mean, we're, we're always putting the kits together, but this one specifically was done really, really to give that sort of tone on tone effect so mm -hmm. quick and easy, just using the right colours so that it works really well. So once that's dry, Oh, and another way, I'll just very quickly show you another way you can use these, just to colour your cardstock. So using the same smoothie that I had before, I've got a piece of cardstock here, and I've just gone around the edges, just applied a little bit of ink from the smoothie, and it's just a way of being able to colour your cardstock. So the sort of tone on tone, it just creates that slightly darker edge. I can go all the way around. I'm you still using these same horrible ink. lines, do you? Because no. there's no there's no jagged edges on the smoothies. So. None at all. So it's a real it's a it's a real good blending ink. And although I'm not using it to blend different colours at the moment, I will be doing later. But it just shows you how you can then use that for your matte layers, and you've got that really really nice uh, matching edge colour. So once those uh, and they're already dry, ready to work with. But I've just stuck those together, and I'll just pop that to one side. I've got one here that I've done earlier that's dry, and I'm just going to grab the tape off the back of that and just mount that onto the back of our card. And then that gives us our card base and we can start to work up the rows then mm -hmm. that we've got. Really looking forward to seeing how these dies work. Um, they're, they're, I wouldn't say they're revolutionary because um, we have seen something similar before, but it was a long time ago, about a year ago. Yeah. Um, and I, I just think it's the next stage on. We've seen, as I said, the layering stamps and stencils. Now there's layering dies, makes sense? It, uh, yeah, it does, it does. There we go. So that's just gives a little bit of dimension like that on there, like so. And what we're going to do is just work up a little topper on the left-hand side as well, which I'll show you in a minute. But let's have a look at the rose die first. Now, what I've done here is I've gone ahead and used some of our pixie powders. So if you've not seen those before, I'm just going to very quickly show you how that works on here. And I'm going to use the Aubergine Dream. So we've got these in a couple of sets. I've bought on two different sets. We've got the ones with the mica powder in, which are our pixie powders. So you may have seen pixie sparkles before. 
Pixie powder's got a slightly different size of mica, so a different type of sparkle. And then I've also bought some Pixie Bursts in a set of four. Now, Pixie Bursts are just dye-based, so there's no mica in them at all. They've just got the pure colour, so you get a real watercolour effect. So using them either together or separately, get totally different effects. But I'm going to use the Aubergine Dream to start with, and I'm just going to show you what I'm going to do. So I'm going to wet the card on both sides just to stop it curling to begin with. And don't worry, I will give you so all the details of the pixie bursts and the pixie mists and everything else, or pixie powders, um, after the demonstration. So don't worry about that. And I've just got my card ever so slightly damp there. And then all I've done, taking the top off, they've got a really fine nozzle that you can dispense the powder from. Mm -hmm. So I said, slightly different from the, the pixie uh, sparkles. These are pixie powders, so slightly different amount of, and size of mica in them. And the more you add, the more darker, obviously, the colour, the more intense it's going to be. The less you add, you get almost like a more water style, sort of water wash effect. Mm -hmm. Put that to one side. So once you've done that, you can go over the top with a little bit more water. And then you'll start to see how this then really fireworks out and comes to, comes to life really, really quickly from above. It activates the colour. So look at that. So wow. you've now got the colour activated, the dyes come out. Although you can't see the mica, once that's dry, I could go in, I could add a little bit more of the aubergine dream just to show you how that's going to work. There you go. And then you leave that sort of, uh, it depends on how hot your room is, but an hour or two just to dry and how much water you've put on it. Could you force dry it with a heat gun? It's not? better, you can do, it's better not to. It's better if you want to and you try, you're in a bit of a rush, maybe leave it for 10 or 20 minutes, then finish it off right. um, because that will allow the, the colors to, to soak into the cardstock. Right. Gotcha. But if you leave it sort of for a couple of hours, you're gonna get something that looks a little bit like that. So that's the aubergine dream. And then you can see, you'll see the mica. mica in there. So that's that sort of lilac purple mica. Oh, yeah. So this wet one won't show that, but that's, I just thought it looked absolutely perfect for a background of a rose. Yeah, so let me move this to one side and just clear that up a little bit. And then I will show you how we're gonna cut those little pieces out. Mm -hmm. So what I've got in the die set here with the rose is you've got two layers. So I'm just gonna introduce you to the larger head of these. So if you can see those from above there, you've got the, the solid background that Sue's designed for us. And then also this piece here that layers perfectly over the top. Right. And then what that gives you is the background and also the solid color on the front. So using this dry piece I've got here, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna cut that out for us and just run that through the machine and then I will show you the other piece that I've got as well. So let's just put that one through there and bring that one in there. So I've gone ahead and cut that one. I'll show you what we've got here. So when that cuts out, you're gonna get that just like that. So that's the two dies finished off. Mm -hmm. So you can see you've got that texture there. And then this one here I cut out previously just using the pink cardstock that's in the set on today's show and just lay the two over the top of each other, stick those together, and then you've got your layered, your layered flowers. So you've got all that detail, and I've not had to do any cover coloring or any fancy techniques, just use the pixie powder, and that sort of technique and texture in the pixie powder gives you the texture of the yes. leaves. And although it is flat, technically, it still has got a little bit of a 3D uh, aspect to it because it's two layers of cardstock on top of each other. So. Yeah, absolutely, yeah. So it's still got lots of dimension. So I would just go ahead and very quickly just pop a little bit of glue around here. And then you don't have to cover every area because they're quite nice large areas to be able to marry up and stick down. And I can glue that down in place like so. So that's what those two dies would do. And you can do exactly the same with each of the dies in the sets. And this just gives you an idea how all of these sort of sets work. So see, Sue's even put a little bud in there. So you've got the background and the top piece for each of the different size heads. So she if I was to glue, she yeah. does. So if I was to glue those together there, that's exactly how that's gonna look there. And that gives me the bud. Perfect. And then you've also got the leaves and the vines or the, the veins for the leaves. So you can actually add those together and that will look a little bit like that when they're two cut out. So you can see there, what I've done is I've used some of the Pixie Bursts. I've used the, uh, the moss one that we've got on today's show mm -hmm. and use that for the leaf uh, background. It gives you some nice texture. Perfect. And then you can go ahead and glue the vi uh, veins, rather, the leaves. So the best of both worlds really is to use the pastel cardstock we've got in the show and then add a little bit of extra shading maybe to it if you yep. want to. And that's exactly what I've done with this green. That is just the pastel cardstock, the green pastel cardstock with some of the green colour cloud put over the top Perfect. just to make it slightly darker. And then I've done exactly the same with this little bud here that we've got um, that I can just put a little bit of glue onto the bud. And then I will show you how we can bring the card together very, very quickly then. So I've just built up a couple of elements 
we got the, the rose head and the bud and the leaves. And I can show you now how using all those together, we can start to build up a complete flower. Or you may just want to use just the, the rose head on its own with a sentiment. You can do that as well. Absolutely. You're, you're the boss. You're in charge. You Absolutely. choose how many. You choose whether it's got stems or not, whether it's going to go in the flower pot or not. It's up to you. Absolutely. So what I've done is gone ahead here and just added a, a panel from one of Sue's uh, slim uh, die sets. And I've just added a little bit of colour cloud around the edge and I've just started to place down uh, the stem and the set of leaves that you saw me cut out earlier on. I'm going to use these flowers as well just to add to that. I've got some here. You can lay them down um, straight away with foam tape or with glue. So I'm going to lay down the leaves with some glue here, with some of the um, Cosmic Shimmer dry, uh, clears, dry clear glue. Uh, and the Cosmic Shimmer glue we've got there. available in the show. I think we've got a 60 mil we bottle of it. Yes. Okay. It's bigger than the one uh, I'm obviously using. I've just got a fine uh, nozzle here, but there we go. I mean, this is one of those hero products that have been used by crafters for, well, ever since I can remember. Yeah, hugely Brilliant popular. glue. £7.50, dries clear. Uh, QT2830. So I've just popped the, uh, the bud on there and the flower head on there, and then I'm bringing in one of our sentiments. I've just layered up, and again, I've used the same pink cardstock and the uh, coconut white background. Sincere thanks. Pop that down there. And then the only other thing I've done on my finished sample that I'll just show you is I've just used some of our water crystals in that bottom corner. But you can see how quick those come together just using the pastel cardstock, and um, it's just the pink pink and green. Is it okay to give away that card? Yeah, of course. That's yeah, going to be the giveaway give that, there, one away. Okay? Yeah, that card could be coming your way in the post in the next few days. If you just send an email to studio at hobbymaker.co.uk with your name, your address and your customer number, uh, we'll spin the wheel, announce the winner at the end of the show. So you've got about 20 minutes to get your emails into us. Okay, you could be winning James's card. Now, what did James use? Have we still got any of the showstopper left? It's going very, very, very quickly. Remember, should be um, $14.99, has been $12.99, but that's been previously the lowest price it's ever been. Showstopper for this hour, I know, it's £6.99. If you're treating yourself to these wonderful layering dyes from Sue Wilson, it's a perfect accompaniment because it's like a trellis in the garden. Half the stock, and we had hundreds, half the stock of this has gone, and over half the stock of the plant pot's gone as well. I and mean, if you wanted this and the plant pot together, how much was the plant pot? I can't remember now. Five ninety nine. So you're looking at about twelve, thirteen pounds for both of them, and they they'd be really, really useful to use in conjunction uh, with the layering flower dyes that we've got here today. Now the other things that James used, because I know it's frustrating if you see something. Oh, what do you get? What other colours do you get? The colour clouds. We've got two sets, but we'll show you set B a bit later. This is um, is this set A or set B? That one. Rose blush. Rose blush is in set A, is that right? That's rose blush point, So yeah. that is set A, there we go. Those are the colours, you'll get uh, four of those amazing colour clouds. Uh, basil leaf, the violet haze, there's the one that um, James used in the demo, rose blush. And then the last one is your warm cocoa colour, okay? So £22.99, pence. you get all four of them. They're a really good size. And a number of people I know that use these that say they last, they seem to go on forever. They don't dry out quickly or anything like that. They last a very, very long time. And you just basically pounce your smoothie or your blending tool, whatever you've got, onto that kind of sponge lid and it soaks the ink up into the colour cloud. So that set of four, £22.99, that's YQ2807 if you want those colour clouds. Now, the, um, the Pixie products that we used, now that is the one that actually James used, the Pixie powder, Aubergine Dream. You're also going to get your Aqua Lagoon, you're going to get your Pixie powder pale olive and you're also going to get your burnt orange and that's these. And these are the ones that have got the mica in them. And seeing the bottle is all well and good, but when you actually see the effect you create with these, when activated with water, when spritzed with water, and let them dry naturally, ideally, look at the light reflection from the mica. Isn't that brilliant? You get all four of those, and you use the tiniest amount, because it's literally, um, it's not even granules, it's just powder, dust. It's, really. it's just, you use a very, very small amount, yep. yeah. And it, uh, it really kind of just magnifies and multiplies when you add water to it. £13.99 for all four bottles of that. 
And also we had the embossing folder as well, didn't we? Yes. Um, that embossing folder is a three-dimensional rose bed embossing folder. Now, embossing folders, I know, are always a great price from Creative Expressions. Tonight is no exception. £6.99 for a three-dimensional rosebud embossing folder. A quarter of the stock of that has gone. A quarter of the stock gone just by you finding it on the website. So it's UW2885. UW2885 if you want that one. Just want to think of anything else that you use that I've not shown. Was there anything else that you used? I, th I think you've done a good round up there. I think Dave. I have, yeah. yeah you have. covered everything. All right, we'll do another demo Let's and I'll round up what we use in this demo at the end. Perfect, All right. thank you very much. So we're gonna have a look at the High Ranger uh, now. I'm just gonna carry on from where Dave left off there, just with the, the pixie powders, just showing you. Though on those swatches you saw the single colours that are on today's show, if you took all of those and mixed those together, if I just bring in my white piece of card, it's easy for you to see, you get some absolutely stunning different coloured backgrounds. So that's using all the pixie powders there that we got on today's show. So they've all been specifically chosen, again, to work with all of the cardstock and also the colour clouds that we've got on today's show. So the whole colour palette really, really works together. So if you're unsure about your colours, if you go for the pixie powders or the colour clouds with the colour um, with the colour cardstock, you know you're going to be on for an absolute winner. I've done the, the heavy work for you in choosing your colours for you. They work together lovely. So what I've done for the Hydrangea is I've actually used the... Um, the Lagoon that we've got and also that Aubergine Dream and mix them together. And I looked at that and I thought that looks perfect. That looks just like the hydrangeas I'd love to have in my garden. Mm -hmm. And I've used that technique to make this card here that we're going to have a go at together, putting together. So this is the card that I've done and it's bringing in that lattice concept. Just as it is, cut out on its own. I just want to have a little look at that lattice um, with you because when you've cut them out, there's so much you can do with the lattice. There's so many different ways you can use it. Not only can you use it as it's cut out there, you can also use it as a mask with your colour clouds to bring in those sorts of techniques there. So really quite modern sort of geometric style. It's amazing. Using yeah. it as a, uh, as a mask. You can then use it purely just in one tone to do a sort of negative reverse of the trellis work that I've done. Um, you can also layer them up. So if you want to put one or two together, and just, I'm not sure if this is going to show up, but if you just shift those ever so slightly, oh. you get almost like a like a um, white cane furniture, yeah, sort yeah. of wicker furniture te technique. Uh, and you, if you want to twist them around ever so slightly, you can get some quite geometric. Oh. That's oh, going to play with the camera there, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> so there's a lot you can do. That's just using two together. You can create a lot of really sort of modern, different backgrounds. If that so make you there's want lots that of ways of using it. So yeah. I think. Both that and the rose embossing folder are probably my two favourite products of all time. They're, they're so universal. They well, really that is really an are. absolute must-have. Six ninety-nine. It's never been that price before. It shouldn't be that price. It's been twelve ninety-nine. If you've got a little bit of a queue on the phones, please do bear with our call centre. You'll get through to them. They're, they're above us here in this building. Um, it's free to call, so it's no charge for the phone call, even on a mobile phone. It's just your time, so they'll get to you as quickly as they can. So going back to the hydrangea um, technique, what I've done is I've done exactly the same as we just did with the rose. I've done a nice sheet, an A4 sheet of the pixie powders. I then used it as my background and I've cut out these four elements from the uh, hydrangea set. So they're just like the, the rose. You've got the, um, the instructions inside and all the different elements that cut out for the different hydrangea. So you don't have to use the largest. You can just go for the small pieces and I'll show you exactly what I mean by that. Mm -hmm. So I've got some green... Uh, color cloud here. This is our uh, basil leaf and the nice thing with these products you can actually go over the top of the pixie powders because it's all water based and you can start to give it a little bit of a green tinge because I don't know about you I always strive for really nice sort of purpley colored and I die, you can put the feed in them, can't you, to make yeah, them yeah. different colours. Yeah. But they always end up sort of green, so <laughs> <laughs> around the edges, try as I might. So I thought I'm just going to add a little bit of green colour cloud to these. So again, you could just go in with the lilac, um, the like card. Green around the edges. But it just, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it just adds a little bit of dimension, because what we're going to do is layer these up over the top of each other. Okay. which I will show you, of how they glue together. So I've taken four of the larger elements that we've got here, and I'm just going to glue them together into, I guess the easiest way of displaying it, uh, explaining it is like a, like a square. So I'm just going one on top of the other. This is exactly how you would do it to make a large gotcha. right. um, hydrangea head. So you can already see that sort of shape coming together, that sort of pom-pom shape. Mm -hmm. Then you've got these smaller pieces that Sue's done for you. And I'm going to take three of those. You could take two. It's entirely up to you. 
And again, you could stick these down with foam uh, tape or pads, or you could use the glue like I'm doing, depends on what you want to do. So you could make it more three-dimensional with you, glue gel or pads. Absolutely, yep. Yeah. Yeah. It's just to show you, sometimes you don't always want that dimension if you're gonna post it. So I think no. this is a nice, uh, nice set of flowers with the layering techniques. And then a little tiny one in the middle just to apply that there. Let me just get rid of that ink off of there for you. And then I will show you how the one that I've done before finishes off look. So that's actually using foam pad, just one mil in between each, just to make it slightly raised. And then I've done exactly the same technique, just using the middle size and the smallest size. So I can make two different size sort of pom-pom heads, if you like, of the, um, of the hydrangea. Perfect. So pop those up to there to one side and we're bringing our star of the show, the, uh, the lattice there. And what I've done is I've gone ahead and cut out some of the leaves from Sue's set and exactly like the rose, they come in two parts, so you can cut out the leaf and the inner piece, and I've done exactly the same technique that I did before. I used the pixie powders and the pixie bursts just to create that texture on the leaves. I haven't spent ages coloring it in, I've just done the powders, and I think that's where the, the, the marry up of the pixie powders with these dyes works so, so well to give that texture. So I'm gonna go ahead and just start to layer up my, uh, my card design like this. I'm gonna pop one of the large heads there and I'll just pop some foam pads on here and the smaller one there like so. And we'll pop some of these leaves down. So I tend to just glue the leaves down flat because I think they sort of sit in the back quite nicely. And the nice thing is because they're separate, you don't have to, you know, they don't have to go anywhere particularly. You can see it's completely different from Sue's sort of design there. Yeah. It's just to give you a bit of an idea, a bit of inspiration. You can follow it if you want to, or you can do your own thing. You could just do one stem pop one leaf in there as well. There we go. I won't pop loads together. There we go. And I'm just going... The big collection, James. Um, I will go through what you get in the big collection again right after this demo, but 50% of the stock is gone. And they're supposed to be enough to last three shows. One today and two I'm today. back on tomorrow. <laughs> Getting quick. I'm not surprised. I said it's, it's been a great start for 2024 for me for the first show. It's been something that I've really enjoyed using these dyes because it, they are for all year round. They really yeah. are for all sorts of uh, birthday celebrations, every anniversaries, occasion. every occasion. What I didn't show you there, all I'd done with the lattice, I sort of missed a bit of a step there, is I've just, again, gone ahead, used some of the warm cocoa colour cloud. I've literally just coloured up the lattice as quickly as that. And that's why I bought the colour clouds on because they work so well. I've just pounced it over the top. You could I also won't do use it that all. as a stencil, couldn't you, as well? Yeah. I mean, you'll see almost got a bit of a texture there almost. But yeah, that's exactly what I did with some of those other cards. I used it as a stencil just to show some of those geometric shapes. So that's all I did there was almost like the waste, if you like. I made sure when I was colouring it, I did it over the top of a blank sheet of card to, uh, to make use of it. Perfect. So I just coloured that up first like that. And I'm just going to mat and layer that onto some black card just to frame it up. Just to show you how the whole card comes together very quickly with some glue. And then to finish off the background of the card, I've already shown you very, very quickly how just using one of the pixie powders works. So all I've done with the background here was use some of the offcut that I had from cutting out the hydrangea before I coloured it. And I've actually used that as my background. So if I bring in my card blank that I've got here, all I've done is snicked in. That's why I always like to do larger A4 sheets because you can, you, you can always use them and it's better to have loads. And I tend to do one or two sheets and then let them dry. Um, and then I've got my background here, with some foam tape on. I can just peel off and I can mount that onto my pixie coloured background. I think they work so well, not just for the flowers, but also for the background. So just, it's nice to use just one or two colours. So again, all I've used here is actually white and um, black cardstock. And then everything's been coloured up with colour cloud or pixie powders, I think. Perfect. I'm telling you the truth there. Yes, I am. So I had to just, I'm just looking at the design, just reminding myself, just but I just had to check myself there. I don't want to tell you, for, but yeah, it just goes to show you what you can do with just the uh, white and black cardstock, color cloud, pixie powders. But again, you could just use those um, pixie um, pastel card sets that we got on today's show. Um, I just thought it'd be different to do something just in white and black cardstock using the, white, uh, the wet products because they're so easy to use. Down it goes. And down it goes, it's as simple as that. So it's an eight, I think it's seven, seven by seven. Just Isn't that gorgeous? Pop that That's down. The and then the final bit, uh, you're so kind. Again, it's shadow sentiment, so we can pop that there. And if I bring in the finished card, 
the only thing that I have done, I will just stick a couple down just to show you how easy they are to work with. Um, I've actually used some of our water crystals. So what they are, little clear plastic beads which are flat on the back. They've got absolutely no, um, no little air trapped inside. They're completely crystal clear. And mm -hmm. I'm just going to pop those down with some of our uh, Cosmic Shimmer Glue. And they almost look, when they're dry, they show white there, but on here, You'll see where they're all finished off and dry. It looks like little water droplets. If I can just yeah. catch that on the side, almost like, yeah, like dew drops. Okay. Just adds a bit more interest there. Well, if you want the, you uh, the fantastic water crystals, you get two packs and they're $3.99 for the two packs. And you're going to get um, 120. Oh, so it's one pack, yeah? 120. Yeah, one pack is three ninety nine. Yeah. yeah, so that's one pack. I've got two packs here, but it's one pack, one hundred and twenty in there, uh, and you get three different sizes of the dew drops as well, or the water crystals. Uh, three pound ninety nine. Wh two eight nine five. But the main feature of the show is the brand new launch from Sue Wilson, the lovely Sue Wilson, and it's selling very very quickly. Very busy indeed for it because what these are are some of the most popular flowers you can think of, but in layering dyes. Rather than having one dye that cuts out the whole bud and the stem and the leaves all as one, and you can't really do much with it unless you can snip into it. These are basically um, sections of the flower that you cut out separately. Now you can use your colored cardstock so you don't have to color them in at all. You can add a little bit of shading if you want to with the color clouds or whatever you choose to do. But you get set A and set B. Now set A is on the top shelf, set B is on the bottom shelf. Now you can buy either of those as smaller sets. You can buy them individually, but of course that way you're paying more for the dies than if you buy the I want it all. So if you want the I want it all, it's $69.99. If you want set A, that's on the right hand side of your screen at $39.99. Um, but then if you want set B, that's $39.99 as well. So do the math, that comes to nearly £80 if you buy the two sets separately. If you buy them as they are wanted, all bundle on the left, it's JZ2896, and it's only $69.99, and we can offer you split pay on that, whereas we can't offer you split pay on set A or B separately, okay? But if you just run through and have a little look, if you scan along, you can see all the flowers that you're going to be getting, all the different elements. And the thing is, you can make a bunch of tulips, and they all look different, because their heads can be pointing in different directions, the stems can be going in different directions, you can use colour cardstock to great effect. It looks really effective. Use your pixie powders. Use your pixie bursts. Use your cosmic, shim uh, cosmic shimmer clouds as well, colour clouds. All of those ways of adding colour if you want to. Or just use the sheets in your pastel A4 pad. That's entirely up to you. But that, all of these are coming your way. All of them. I'll run through what you're going to get again. You're going to get your magnolia. You're going to get your coneflower, hydrangea, tulip, two sentiments, uh, a sincere thanks and a special friend. You're then also going to get your uh, beautiful uh, hibiscus, you're going to get your rose, you're going to get your aster, and then other sentiments just for you and your two kind. Now, the plant pot is now limited stock. If you want that to put your buds in, you can do, but we've only got a few left now, literally down to the last one or two, I think. Five pounds and 99 pence for that. What's the stock of the um, background light? The lattice background. Well over half the stock went about 10 minutes ago. This is $6.99, it should be $14.99. So a great deal, SP2884, three quarters of the stock of this has now gone as well. Um, and what else did you use that I haven't shown yet? Ah, the other pixie bursts. The pixie bursts. Yeah. Here we go. So this is the, I, I love what you do with these boards. They're fantastic. You make my life so much easier. <laughs> so these are the pixie bursts. We've got a set of four of those, which we haven't shown you yet. We've got the orange slice. We've got the wild moss. We've got the very berry, and we've also got the fire, fire, firefly glow. There we go. So those are your pixie, your pixie bursts, and they are only thirteen pounds and ninety pence. They don't have the mica in, but they've got a really explosive colour. They're really, really vivid and beautiful. But if you want the one with the mica in, that is the other one, which of course is the pixie powders. But if you're getting closer to see the colours, look at them. What I love with the pixie bursts is if you really like those watercolour techniques that you often see with sort of water uh, ink splotches, so easy to create those just by spraying water and puffing the powder over the top. Perfect. It's really, really simple. Okay, we've got five minutes left for you to get your emails in to be in with a chance of winning James's card, the first one that he did this evening. It's studio at hobbywaker.co.uk. Uh, we'll announce the winner after the next demo, if that's all right.
Excellent. Thank you, Dave. Over to you. Yeah, no problem. So I'm going to show you how to use the tulip flower now. And it is using the flower pot. So I've just realised that it's now probably going to be sold out by the time I've even finished saying that. Well, if it... So it, it will give you some good ideas anyway. Yeah, we'll have to see what exactly. we can do. So it is using the flower pot and the lattice die. So you'll see different ways you can use it. And we're going to have a go with the tulip um, flower layering dies as well. So I'm going to start off with the flower pot very, very quickly. Um, for those of you that have been lucky enough to get it, that is exactly how you can cut it out. It cuts out one piece like that. And then I've got gone ahead cut a second one just create the the rim of the flower pot perfect use for craft card yeah it's uh, it is it's just craft yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. absolutely it's, it's it's a great way of just creating different techniques without lots of hard work and this is the nice thing with the color cloud just going in there and adding a little bit of color down the edges and i'm just going to take some of that off actually because you don't need a lot of ink with this and then just very very lightly add a little bit of color into there i'm going to do exactly the same with the rim of the pot that I've cut out separately. And we've got the smoothies on the screen, by the way, if you want those. Um, how many did you get? How many smoothies? There's two in there. Two for 4.99. Yeah, it's two of these, li these large sizes. Yep. So and you can wash them out with water and use them with different colors or get a, get a few of them. Uh, and then you can keep using them again and again, using the same color. Mm -hmm. So what I've done, I've used our um, really popular lattice die there, just a different way. I've cut out of um, craft card and I'm gonna layer that over the top of the flower pot. And then what that does is it creates a bit of a texture, and just like Dave said at the top of the hour, and he's absolutely right here, it's like an ice cream cone. Mm. It looks just like that same sort of texture. And all I do to stick these down, little tip, you don't have to try and cover every area, just the little bits you need to, and you'll find that it will hold itself down quite happily because it's so, so light. And I've then, just to finish it off, just snicked away the excess. I've used this lattice dye in so many different ways over the years when I've been crafting. It's, um, it's only been around for a few years, but it's very, very popular. Very, very popular. So that then gives me my texture on the flower pot, which I then went in with a smoothie again, same color, and just added a little bit of color just to the edges. So when that's all completely dry, and I layer the top up, like so, it's going to look it looks just so like real. that. It looks so real. And it looks so real. It's just using a little bit of colour and also the craft card. And it's just being clever with the, with the different types of uh, surfaces that you're colouring, really. And then using Sue's layering dies, uh, in the tulip set, you've got these little flowers, um, sorry, the little leaves, which I've cut out of the pastel green cardstock. And then again, I've coloured it using the uh, colour cloud. So you can see the lighter colour and the darker colours. So mm -hmm. again, just using the pastel cardstock, cut out the various different types. And then I know we're short on time, so I'm just going to jump ahead and show you what I then done. So when you cut loads of those out, you can then actually just uh, stick those in behind your flower pot on the back and just start to create your, your flower pot of, of leaves and foliage. It looks really effective. I love it. It's so simple. It's just picking out the, the right colours, really, for the, the coloured cardstock. It works really, 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 really easy to work with. And then I've got here one of our pixie powder backgrounds. Get the card around the right way. Always helps. And one of our um, Sue Wilson's Noble dies, the loop circles that I bought on when I was here with you last. It's a fairly new collection. And um, I just thought it looked really nice just to focus on the flower pot. And I'm going to just stick that one down as well over the top in the center. Mm -hmm. And the blue and the green works really, really well. And then the star of the flower pot, of course, is going to be the tulip heads. So again, these come in two parts that Sue's done. And all I've done is I've used the uh, lemon meringue that I've got on today's show, just to add a little bit of color, just to show you how the pastel yellow cardstock and the pastel lemon meringue really works. So the two colors, tone on tone, comes together really nicely. I don't know how clear that's gonna show up. And I'm gonna add a little bit of chic pumpkin just to add a little bit of the orange. And the nice thing with these colors is they will blend together and as it dries, they will soak into the cardstock. And that's what the color cloud's so good at, is it just blends itself together. You just leave it to dry and it will do all the hard work for you. So that's how I treated the, um, the heads of the tulips. Yep. And then when they're dry, they will look like this. And then you can go ahead and then start to dress up your flower pot. So I'm just gonna pop these down into position like so. The loop circle die was popular when I bought it 
in when I was here last. So it only just launched then. I just and that's the one we back. can see on the picture, yeah. Yeah, it's this one here. That I've got in the in the background that I've got here. Yes. So there's five, oh no, eight dies in there. Beg your pardon. We've only eight got dies. literally, I think, single figure stock available of that, and it's on the screen if you would like it. Seventeen ninety nine for those. Um, again, they work beautifully well with everything else that's in the show. This is what I love about your shows because you actually put the shows together. You know what works. So. Yes. Yeah, yeah, especially, with, I mean, well, all, all shows we put together. And then this one, I've really thought about the, the card stock, the, um, the colour clouds, because I know sometimes people struggle with colour. So I thought, well, if I can get all the colours together that work with the card stock and the colour cloud, you can't go wrong. It makes no, it really, no. really easy. And there's our card come together. So just a sentiment, just a different idea, putting it on the angle again with the craft card, like Dave said, for the flower pot, it ties it all together. So you're just really working with two colours, the blue, the craft card, and then let the flower pot. Excellent. Well, we I, you know, the, the, the difficulty is choosing out of all of these wonderful flower die collections, die sets, which one to go for or which set to go for. That's why most of you seem to be going for the I Want It All bundle, which saves you the most money. It's almost like you're getting uh, two or three of them for nothing, really. Well, you know, at least two of them for nothing anyway. Um, and that big bundle is going fast. But if you do want individuals, if there's one particular flower that takes your fancy, if you're a rose fan or a tulip fan, you can buy them individually on the website, but you will pay, of course, a little bit more. We'll still give you a discount, but not as much discount as if you buy the I Want It All bundle. One thing I've not shown you, though, is this collection of colour clouds that James has put together from Cosmic Shimmer. Um, you're going to get the Chic Pumpkin and also the Lemon Meringue, both colours James used in that last demonstration, OK? Then you're also going to get Scarlet Woman and you're going to get Summer Sky as well. So if you love the concept of the colour cloud, get yourself some smoothies and just blend to your heart's content. But um, they're always very, very popular. I know lots of people here uh, use these colour clouds all the time, like Sandra Rushton uses them a lot. I know K. L2831 gets you that set of four. That is set B. And already lots of you coming in for that, loving what you did with the tulips, which is fantastic. Yeah, they're, they really are so easy to work with and they blend so, so lovely. They really are. Real okay. Stable. Now, I'll, I'll be honest with you, I don't know what's going to play out tomorrow because there are two shows with James. I'm not here tomorrow, but he will be. And we're supposed to be having this collection in both shows. Now, whether we can get any more stock of it, I don't know. As we stand at the moment, the stock is going very, very, very fast, much quicker than we thought. So we knew it would be popular, but it's even more popular than we thought. JZ2896, 69.99 gets you all of these brand new layering dies and the sentiment dies as well, four sentiment dies. Uh, and it's on two split payments as well. Thank you for all your emails, by the way. Now, the card that you could be winning is the one in the middle. That's, the rose, yeah. I think yeah. so. Yeah, that's cool. what, uh, that's what uh, James did yeah. at the beginning of the show. One of you who's emailed in your name, your address, and your customer number is going to be a winner of that wonderful card. Are you ready for the, are you ready for the wheel? They've brought that back on TV now, they Wheel of Fortune. They have, yeah. This is our version of it. OK, so good luck, everybody. Your names are on the wheel if you sent in the email. <laughs> <laughs> You're feeling dizzy, Dave. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my word. Um, Samantha Thomas. Samantha Thomas. Not Thomas. Sorry. No, Samantha Thomas. Congratulations, Samantha. We'll get that to come on, in the post to you in the next few days. So many congratulations. Yeah, Alex apologises for getting your name, spelling your name wrong. Um, but brilliant. That card is on its way. What a show. What a show. Remember, everything that you've used is available, is on the website individually, the colour clouds, the pixie bursts, everything else. Um, the 3D embossing folder, by the way, as well, that's going very, very fast. It's only, I think it was 6 99 for that, wasn't it? For a 3D yes, 6 99 yeah. For a 3D yeah. embossing folder is brilliant. £6.99, over half the stock of that has gone. And the showstopper, quickly, that we started with, and maybe you weren't watching at five. Maybe... You get, get home from work at half past five or get home from wherever at half past five. This was a bestseller at 12.99. That was the last time I showed it to you on a Creative Expression show. Um, nearly every one of these that we had available is in baskets. It's a case of who checks out first. I don't want you to miss out. It's only £6.99. SP2884 will get you this today, which is brilliant for trellis work for flowers, but it's it also a sports net. It could be a goalkeeper's net. It could be all sorts of things. And it's snippable. It's extendable. You can cut it multiple times to make long strips of that mesh if you want to as well. James, you've been brilliant. Great to see you. Great to, see, great to be back. Yeah, thank you. Don't really enjoyed it. Hopefully we can get some more stuff. I, I'm going to try my hardest to try and get some more of those. I'm going to show you different ways you can use it again tomorrow, hopefully. More, if I more can get of these? Some, I'm, well, no promises. Okay. I'm going to, going to, we'll see what we can do. Fingers crossed. Yeah. What time are your shows tomorrow? One, uh, one o'clock and four o'clock. <laughs> Four o'clock. Okay, yeah. brilliant. James is back then. Anne Marie's here. We've got some more fun with Hunky Dory, and also we've got Dreamies to come before eight o'clock. Stay tuned to Hobby Maker. Hey.
Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. Here at Hobbymaker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and checkout and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? Every day our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. We're always busy here at Hobby Maker, but there are certain days when certain things happen that make <laughs> the phone lines explode, make the website explode. Well, not literally, but you know what I mean. We just get so <laughs> many orders because everything's ticked. You need it, you want it, the price is right, the deal's fantastic, it's hunky-dory, you can't go wrong. Yeah. You've had a good day. It's it. been a cracking day, yeah, definitely. And it's been so good to see some of these products that actually come to wear, like the Tate Runners particularly. I was saying in the, the last show, we've spent a, quite a good few years researching the right adhesive, the right casing. It had to be replaceable. It had to be plastic-free packaging. There were so many things that we needed like it to do. And it, honestly, it feels like it's been years in the making. And to actually get them to air today... Today is... Well, Sunday was the yeah, day, wasn't it? Yeah. But I, was, I wasn't here Sunday, so I didn't see them. Same. Um, yeah. First time I've seen these today is right now. Now, I know we did the straight-sided tape runner, the, you know, the continual strip, in the earlier show. And mm -hmm. I think it went completely... Crazy. Yeah. Crazy. OK. Yeah. You've been able to restock it, I believe, on yeah. the website. We have got, for the first time today, the Dotty version of the adhesive tape runner. 22 meters of dots. Now you might think, why do I need dots? Why don't I just go for the, the, the straight? Dots will stick to the finest 
yeah. filigree die cuts that you need to stick down. When you struggle putting glue on things and glue seeps out and gets messy, even if it dries clear, it still shines and it, it, it looks a bit unsightly. Dots will only stick where you need them to stick. Yeah, they are fantastic. They are great. Let me see if I can show you can yeah. the difference on here between the dots and the, the plain kind of tape, if you will. So the dots one uh, has a slightly blue tinge to it as well. So you can, um, there we go. If we tilt that forward a little, there we go. That's one Levi. So you can see right. the dots there versus the tape. So the dots, because they're not in a continuous strip, those dots are just gonna kind of detach themselves from each other and stick to your project, yeah. to all of your die cuts, all of your detail work, they are just, it is just a game changer, isn't it? Once you've got these in your life, I don't think you can go back to double-sided tape and things like that. Concentration on Levi's face to get that in focus. <laughs> that's so hard to see. Brilliant. Okay, now what we've got is not only the tape runner itself, it's a refillable tape mm -hmm. runner. Now that, for me, is a massive game changer because the less plastic we throw away, the better. Yeah, absolutely. In this day and yeah. age. So you're going to get 22 metres of sticky dots in the tape runner. You're also going to get two 22 meter refills that you just literally pop inside the casing. So once you've got the casing, all you need to buy in the future are the refills. Now, £12.47, that is your start price. Do you want me to show you how easy it is to refill yeah, as well? Yeah, because honestly, it's so simple. So on the bottom of the tape runner, you have uh, like a little button. So you're just going to press that button that's on the base of the tape runner. You're going to open that up, take out your old one, drop in your new one. It can't go any other way. That's the only way it can go in. And then just clip the lid back on. That's okay. it. How much should these be normally then? For just this on its own, mm. 3 dollars Oh, OK, that's good. Yeah, still a really good price. You can get it on its own on the website if you just want one. OK. Or maybe you're going to get the bundle and you want another one. But hang fire. Yeah. Three ni three ninety nine for a dotty tape pen, twenty two meters. Now I'm starting to doubt myself, Dave. It might not be. I'm sure it's three ninety nine. Can we double check, Alex? Five ninety nine. No. Four forty nine. Four forty nine. Sorry, the purple ones were three ninety nine. Yeah. Four forty nine for the dotty one. The dotty one's always a little bit more money yeah. than the one that isn't dotty. It's a more expensive adhesive. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. So four forty nine for one of those normally on its own. You're going to get one of those, and you're going to get two of the refills. And how much are the refills normally, Alex? Three ninety nine each. Okay, so fifty p cheaper. But you can one. get those in a bundle as well. Okay. If you just want extra refills. Okay. We've got all options available. All bases covered. Yeah. Right. So, if you've never used the dotty tape runner from Hunky Dory before because it's brand new, only came out on Sunday. We're only at Tuesday, so no one probably received them yet. I would no. Have Twelve pound forty seven isn't the price. That's what it should be. Let's show you what we can give these, all three of them, to you today. Less than a £10 note. And remember, if you bought anything today from Hobby Maker, that is a delivered price. Buy two, buy three, buy four, buy ten. However many you can afford, go for it. Because when these are out of stock, it may take weeks, maybe even months sometimes, to get them back in stock. We know how that goes with sometimes with, like, with glue sticks. We and... know what Dan's like. That's what you're trying to say. I wasn't going to say that, but yeah. <laughs> yeah they, once they're out of stock, they may not be in for a little while. So grab them. Three, that's 66 metres yeah. of dotty it's adhesive. It's amazing, isn't it? Absolutely incredible. We were saying earlier, because we were trying to work out like how, how big is 66 metres? And Director Dan was like, well, it's like three blue whales. A blue whale is 20 metres when long. When Sherilyn said that to me before I took over at five o'clock, I thought, what, it blue just, whale, what? I thought, what? Yeah. So to try and visualise 22 metres, it's, it's bigger than a blue whale. That's big. It's massive, isn't it? Probably 60, other things we can relate to. Of dotty adhesive. Think about all those things that you struggle with, those really tricky, fine sentiments that are whisper, whisper thin. I mean, your yeah. favourite sentiment, for example. Yeah. It's not easy to stick down. No, is absolutely it? not. No. With this, it will, the dots will only stick to where the die cut word is. Yeah, and where you put the pressure, it's just so easy, yeah. Can't go wrong. No, you can't. Think about maybe if you went for that amazing lattice die that we had in the last show. Oh my goodness, this would be perfect. Perfect, perfect to use on yeah, that. Yeah, absolutely ideal. Use it on all those really intricate fine things mm -hmm. that you struggle. Even if you've got fine tip applicators on your bottles of glue, it still can seep out. It can still yeah. go onto surfaces you don't want it to go onto. But to get, of course, just one case is all you need. And then going forward, 
refills. But I don't know how often you use your dotty tape pens or any adhesive tape runner, but this should hopefully last you a while. But if you can go for it, I'll go for a couple of sets. Definitely, definitely. Get them because I know that I need more than one of these. Mm. I know I need one in my toolbox. Mm. I need one on my desk. I need one at home. I need one for the kids because this is going to be so good for them to use for their crafting because yeah. they're not going to get in a mess. Exactly. They're not, you know, it doesn't matter if you leave the little lid off, it's not going to dry up or anything like that. Nope. It's just fantastic for the kids to craft with. Um, and at that price, it's so affordable. And I know I've got a stash of refills as yes, well because exactly. there is nothing worse. And it's even got a little lid yeah that when you're not using it kind of stops the glue from going where you don't want it to yep. simple as that so they thought of everything very ergonomic you've got a non-slip grip on the top there for your finger it's branded hunky dory as well um again the if i just open up the box to show you the refill again um they're just really well thought through and you you resisted the temptation to bring something to market until it was exactly right yeah yeah exactly yeah. that yeah and and it has been such a long process to get here and i couldn't believe it when they arrived last week because they arrived a little bit earlier than we anticipated as well and when, oh, when they got here i was like oh my goodness Hallelujah. we need to get these to air immediately absolutely <laughs> well, half the stock has gone in six minutes and we're not talking 50 or 60 or 70 of these we're talking hundreds and mm -hmm. hundreds and hundreds of them nine pounds and 98 pence you're saving about two pound 50 off what the price should be and the, what the price should be is brilliant anyway and lots of you are going for multiples lots of you are going for threes paula in essex is going for three mm -hmm. lots of you are going for two i can see there maureen veronica carol Jeanette, Caroline, Lois, all putting these in their basket. I mean, you know one thing with Hunky Dory, that the quality of everything they do is superb, whether it's construction glue, yeah. whether it's card kits, whether it's uh, the little books that we have here today, whether it's the Miri, or whatever it may be, you will know that they will not put anything for sale until it is right. That's why we've waited, and today, or Sunday was the day that they launched. Today, we can offer you these dotty tape pens. Now, Amanda sent a message in. Hello, Amanda. Good evening to you. Amanda says in Essex, uh, Hi, Anne-Marie and Dave. A UK bus is 11.1 metres long, so you could go along two of them with a glue runner. That's amazing, isn't it? Thanks, two buses worth of yeah. <laughs> glue yeah. dots. That's incredible. You're full of great information, Amanda. Thank you for that. <laughs> I can relate more to a bus than I can too. a blue whale. Me too, to be fair. I don't know. I'd be a blue whale. I've seen an actual bus. Big, no idea. Yeah, I've seen a bus. I haven't seen a blue whale. Don't want to see a blue whale. Uh, thank you for that. Okay. ANHD 93, two refills and your refillable tape runner. How about that? Should we leave that with you? Okay, <laughs> because we've got a lot of other things to get in, haven't we? Lots of other restocks as well. It went crazy at two o'clock, Dave. Absolutely bonkers. Now, the refill bundle quickly that Amory talked about, if you just want refills on their own, how many did you get? How many refills? Three. Okay, a pack of three. We can give you details on that quickly, I believe. Okay, it's coming up on the screen for you any second now. So if you're gone for maybe that last offer and you're thinking, I want some more refills, it's not going to be 11.97. That is what it should be. It should be 3.99 each. If you just want three more refills, 9.58. So you're looking at about three pounds twenty. Twenty percent saving. Yeah, I think that's why it's such a random price because when Dan was working it out, it's like it's random, but it's twenty percent. Yeah. I was like, we'll take it. Yeah. <laughs> So if you go for the one with the tape runner, you've got the main case that's refillable. Yeah. And then you could have another three. So that would be, you another then have... Another 66 metres. Yeah. Go so on, Dave. That would be, be 132 wow. metres. Wow. <gasps> if you buy that and the previous one um, and one P&P for the whole day. That's amazing, isn't it? That's... How many buses is that? Oh. <laughs> uh, about 12, <gasps> I think. 12 buses. Yeah. Yeah, if you could do two, two buses with one tape runner, there's three. So, yes, it's 12. Yeah, we're measuring everything in buses yeah. now, Jimmy. Yeah, I can relate yeah. to that. I can, I, can, <laughs> I, can, I, can, I can picture a bus. I can't picture a blue wire. Um, okay, what do we want to do next, Ooh, Pat? Do you want... Where are our boards? Yeah, we have got boards for those. Oh, here. Have you got them? Oh, these. there. Dave's got them. Do you want these? Dave's got the boards. You know what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's just so you can see all the pictures better. Okay. You can see all the imagery. Absolutely stunning. So this is our brand new selection of pocket pads. And we have got five brand new themes for you. So first of all, we have got the haberdashery, which is just so sweet. If anyone is into sewing, soft crafts, dressmaking, um, anything like that, they're going to absolutely love this one. It is so gorgeous it's got those real kind of kath kidston vibes as well with yeah. the like the pastel yeah. pink and the pastel blue it's really really sweet isn't it you've got all sorts of different uh sewing 
bits and pieces in there. You've got the uh, the kind of bobbins. You've got the sewing box. So you've got 16 designs, four yeah. of each. Yeah. So if you want to fussy cut them, decoupage yeah. them up, make them more dimensional, you can do that. Yeah, absolutely. You can do that for sure. Um, alternatively, you can use them all as individual toppers. And oh, I think perfect. in total, I think we end up with 320. Wow. They're A7 in size, by the way, as well. Okay, the next one. This one is our uh, men's, men's leisure time. Leisure time. Um, look at all the different kind of hobbies, sports we have covered here. It is so cool. We have got all of your kind of regular ones. You've got football in here, we've got golf in here, but we've got cooking, we've got chess, we've got walking, we've got just kind of relaxing on the sofa, we've got boxing. One day men look. Absolutely, yeah. Uh, we've got this, we couldn't work out what this one was earlier. Is it like karate or judo? Yeah. No, judo. 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 Sorry, I just got a Le I got a Levi, look from Levi. Levi, needs, <laughs> Levi needs it, knows his judo. Yeah, yeah. I got a, a proper side eye. <laughs> it is brilliant, isn't it? It's so cool. And for those of you that always say, "Oh God, guys are so hard to make cards for," there's a solution. It's perfect. Solved. Absolutely perfect. Whatever the pastime yeah. that guy may like, it's going to be in that pad somewhere. That's definitely. For sure. That's called men's leisure time. Yeah, and then we have got our garden days, mm -hmm. which is again. Uh, perfect for men, women, you know, you've got kind of the gardening theme in here as well as some more feminine in it, images as well. And um, you've got the fabulous little welly bobs here as well, which are just gorgeous. I love those. Uh, we have got the shed there, the gloves. It's just lovely, isn't it? Great for birthday cards, kind of retirement cards, that kind of thing. Yep. So that's our gardening days. Perfect. Next, we have got... Our paper art. Now this one is spectacular. It is so dimensional. It, if you like paper quilling, if you like paper cutting, paper folding, but you can't do it, you don't have the patience to do it like me. Yep. Um, you don't, you know, you just, it's something that you wouldn't even want to entertain. So when you talk to me about this one, I, in my mind thought, oh, it's a pad full of paper that you can then quilt. No. But no, it's images that are being yes. quilled that are on the printed pages. It's amazing, isn't it? Look they are these. so cool. I'll tell you what, Carla Bagshaw, right up there. I know, right? Yeah. right? I thought that as soon as I saw it. They are just amazing. And again, such a huge variety of different styles within this one pad. So that is your paper arts. And then finally, we have got a bit of steampunk. our steampunk. Yeah, absolutely amazing. Really kind of grungy, moody, you know, really rich, deep, dark colours in here. This one is going to be great with your gold miri mats. It's yeah, going to be fabulous. Totally. Now, we've got the miri mats in the show as well, so don't worry. We'll sort that out for you as well as we go. HP HD 48. OK, so that is five new pocket pads. Mm -hmm. Stunning paper, stunning quality, stunning, stunning imagery. And you've got... Uh, 64 sheets in each, so that's 128, that's 256. Uh, well, th well, about 320, 330 sheets approximately. Not 24.95. You're going to get all five of them, and they're brand new, brand new pocket pads. If you want them, we can let you have virtually two of them free. 14 pounds, 95 pence. That's amazing, isn't it? For five pads. That is three pound a pad. Yeah. Three pound a pad to make potentially 64 cards. Yeah. It, it's it's just insane, isn't it? It is. <laughs> well, that's why it's been so, so busy on the phones earlier and on the website. Remember, it's a free phone number, free to order on the website, hobbymaker.co.uk as well. You can oh, Maybe you order them earlier on. You're thinking, do you know what? That's so good. I think I'm going to get another yeah. one. Yeah. One PMP. Yeah. No matter how many things you bought today, between midnight last night and midnight tonight, it's just one PMP. You'll get your email confirmation overnight. We are getting busy and busy and busier for this right now. <laughs> we have also got another special offer on the Say It With Style and other pocket pads as well, which you can let you know. But if you fall in love with those five, and that's what you want, mm -hmm. three pound each. It's the best value, isn't it? It's the Incredible. best way to get the brand new ones is in this way, where you're getting the two free ones. It's okay. And now, fabulous. just so we're covering all the bases, we have also got um, the mirror mats, and we've got the pocket pads, which is on uh, a buy three for two. Uh, so if you want any of the... Uh, we haven't got room here. No, if there's want, no room. If you want any of the Say It <laughs> There's lots to pads, choose from. The previous collection of pocket pads... I think there's about... Oh, I was going to say I thought there was about 15, but I think there's more than that. I think it's there's about more 20. than that. Um, we've got music to my ears. We've got uh, beautiful botanicals, perfect pets. 
uh, Mystic Moments and also Garden Visitors. Those were the previous five that we had available. They're also on the pick and mix as well. So are the brand new ones yep. and so are the Stay It With Style as well. So if you just want to choose, cherry pick three of the pocket pads, either Stay It With Style or the pocket pads, you can choose any three, you'll get them for £9.99. One of them will be free. So that's another option. And that includes, remember, the brand new ones, the previous releases, they're all there. They're just a little drop down on our website or if you want to talk to the call centre and they'll read them out to you or whatever, uh, just give them a call, free phone number, 0800 001 4433. So that's the um, three for two on all of them. But the main bundle is five for 15, three pound each, bargain. And do you want to do mirror mats as well quickly? Yeah. Okay, let's do those. Now, the big bundle of mirror mats, which is obviously what most of you want to go for. Did you get, is it three lots or four? You get all three, three yeah, yeah, of the metallic. So you get the gold, silver and the rainbow in this bundle. Okay. So how many in each? How many of each? Mm. Mm. 288 in total. Can't do that. I was going to say, divide that by three, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> 288. So that's 96 <laughs> Miri mats in rainbow. There you go. 96 of those. 96 of your silver. And 96 of your gold. But if I just take one sheet. Have you Wait. Got one yes. I won't take it. I won't, I won't ruin it. <laughs> know what I'm like. <laughs> I've got a reputation. I saw you looking as soon as you started looking for one. <laughs> <laughs> I just I just tear everything out of the pads. It's so funny. Look, there we are. Look at that. Perfect, isn't it? Absolutely perfect. Perfect edge. Isn't that? Uh, and that goes for all of them. All, yeah. all of the, uh, the little pocket pads are the same size. These are the mirror mats that are going to give your sheets really good strength. Um, yep. And also, of course, it gives that beautiful metallic border, just the right. And you came up with this idea, didn't you? I did, yeah, because I just couldn't quite be bothered cutting the <laughs> sheets cutting to the right four. size. So you got the guillotine man at Hunky Dory to do it for you, and yeah. now it's a product everyone it's, Well, it started with little books, and then it's just expanded into everything else that we do. <laughs> it makes sense. I mean, if you're snipping into a for Miri cardstock all the time and getting lots of waste. Yeah, you know. that's the thing. It's the wastage that you get, especially yeah. with some of the sizes. Um, but yeah, the, the value of these, is slightly bonkers. Look at this, 288, equally in gold, silver and rainbow mm -hmm. for 14.97. Basically that's 4.99 each. Yeah, it's, it's, it's just... It's just too good to miss. It really is too it good is. to miss. And of course you can use these for your sentiment dies yeah, as well. Yeah, definitely. You can still, like you can cut the middle out yeah. with one of your dies and still put your um, pocket pad over the top. Great idea. You know, really, maximize further, that yeah. mirror yeah, yeah for sure um because nobody's going to see if you've got a sentiment card in the middle of there once you put that on mm, perfect yeah so grab your mirror um we've also got the mirror <gasps> in multicolor. this is just fabulous i know we I have know, know, restocked know. this at least four times today <laughs> four times four <laughs> times this is sold out today if you just yeah. got in you're gonna get how many of these do you get uh, you get 80 of these 80. ones. Okay. In all those different colours. Yep. It's all so mirror. 20 different colours, four of each. There you go. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> but again, sized absolutely perfectly. I mean, this um, not, may not be the right colour for this, but just. Let's find you a good colour. What about this one? There you go, with purple. That does work, I think. Ooh. You like your bronze. Black or bronze? No, it's like your bronze, that one. Oh, hang on. Uh, or there's copper. Or the rose gold. There's lots that would actually work with that. You've got your regular gold featured in here as well. Look at the bronze, look at that. Oh, it's awesome, isn't, isn't that it? Rich. It is so cool. But yeah, either of those two, the rose gold or the copper, would look really good. Okay, that's copper. But you've got how many colours in total? There's loads. 20 different colours, yeah, and you're going to get four of each to give you your 80 all together. That's the copper. And everyone's favourite or my favourite. Oh, it's lovely. Rose isn't it? gold. It's so nice. It's just such a classy colour, isn't it? Look at that. Now you've Beautiful. heard that this has sold out how many times today? We've restocked it four times. We've so stocked yeah, four, it four times. Four somehow. And we don't restock, you know, 20 or 50 or 60. We restock hundreds. Yeah. So to say that it's been a busy day today is the understatement of the day, basically. Five ninety nine to get a, a lovely variety of yep. colour, all cut to fit the pocketbooks brilliantly. Um, so yeah, grab those, grab these. Uh, one PMP for all of your orders today, remember. And we've also got foiled stepper cards 
These are also amazing. Now, this is, this is new for you, isn't it? Yeah, this is brand new today. Um, <clears throat> and this was something that we were, we were kind of discussing when we were talking about things that we can use alongside our pocket pads. Because obviously, we've brought you quite a few different ones now. And it was a bit of a discussion about what we could do to make it easier to craft with them. Like, what, what could we introduce that's going to make them, like, off the chart amazing? This is the answer. And, and this was it, yeah. Um, and they are just so spectacular. Um, I, I, I did a show with Natalie the other day, and I think she made a step of card. And I got lost with the measurements. Yeah, it's, it's so... There, was, there were so many scoring lines, so many cutting lines. I wasn't really kind of... I was obviously listening to the director and producer and everything else, and I thought, oh, I've, I've lost where she's gone now. You haven't got any of that worry. It's no. die cut and scored for you and foiled marvellously for you, and you'll get a perfect stepper every single every time. Every single time. And what I love about this as well is that you've got those foiled sections, so where you would normally do mats and layers, where you might look at it and think, actually that front panel where it's like a rectangle and then the step along the bottom that's so hard to cut that as a mat and layer yeah. you know because it isn't just a straight shape it's a bit of an unusual shape and i i know the measurements they're in my head i'll never forget them but if you're not that confident you can't remember the measurements you don't want to waste your cardstock no. you don't have a scoreboard maybe you don't have all the equipment you might definitely probably wouldn't have a foiling machine that would be able to do this kind of coverage no, no, no. All on 350 GSM Adorable Scorable. So it's all top quality, all taken from our core colour range. So it's going to match your essential book of sentiments. It's going to match the A4 Adorable Scorable that we sell as well. But that foiling is just absolutely stunning. You but, could be cutting these panels out if you wanted to, if you didn't want to use it as stepper cards. Yes, yeah, but I'm sure you will. Yeah, want to. definitely. Um, Let me show you how look, easy look they are. Look at the colourways. You've got Hunter Green. You've got a chocolate brown. Look at that Air Force Blue there with the silver. And you've obviously foiled in the correct colour foil that complements the colour. Yeah. So gold goes on the yellow, silver goes on the blue, silver goes on the pink. But absolutely beautiful. And it's a combination. You've got like a lattice crisscross. You've got a ditzy dot one. And you've also got the kind of flourishing one there as well. Almost like a William Morris pattern. Yeah, it's gorgeous, almost. isn't it? But yeah. you don't have any duplicates. So you're only going to get one of each foil on each colour, if you know what I mean. So yeah, 16, yeah? you get 16 in total. Yeah. 16 of these under a pound each. It's about 70 pence a card for pre-cut, pre-foiled, adorable, scorable stepper cards that fit these pocket pads. And the the style pads brilliantly. So if you're thinking, but yeah, what do I what do I put the pocket pads onto? Order yourself a few of these. Get maybe two, three, four of these, and they fit on the panel beautifully, as this proves. Look. Wow, what a busy yeah. show! It's amazing, isn't it? Loads so, of you I know are getting in from work or getting in from what you've been doing during the day, not having seen earlier shows today. Um, we're live at 25 minutes past six now. Get your orders in. If you're watching this on a repeat a bit later, I just hope everything that you want is still available and in stock. But we're going to do a demo with this to show you how easy it is to do a stepper. The easiest stepper I think I've ever, ever seen Honestly, in my Honestly, this card is going to take me about a minute to make. Is that all? Yeah. Honestly. Yeah? Minute on the clock. Let's Here do it, it goes. Yeah? Go on, Dan. Okay. You're so you're going to fold in half, first of all. Burnish all of those scores. You're going to fold those steps up to create your first side. You're going to concertina the other side to create the other steps. Another really good burnish on all of those scores. Three quarters of the stock is gone. Wow. OK, so that's the card done. We're going to go to our owl from our steampunk. We're going to pop that onto one of our mirror mats that's already sized perfectly. And then we'll go in with a couple of foam pads just to lift this up so it's got some extra dimension so we don't end up looking too flat. And we're going to add this onto the front of this card. You're so cool. Just so cool. Like um, collected. This. It's a 50 second card, everybody. Done. Get away. Is that not the most spectacular 50 second card you'll ever see as well, yeah. though? Yeah. That all the work has been done for us. Look at the foiling on that as well. That is amazing. And because it is a stepper and that angle of yep. each step is, is hitting the light beautifully. So yep. the mantelpiece, that's going to be a real pleasure. Stunning, isn't it? Absolutely. Yeah. You get your envelopes as well. So, oh, you, you know, that comes with your envelope. We worked this out earlier that to make this card with one sheet of your pocket pads, one of your... Um, Mary Matt, couldn't mm -hmm. think of the word. One of your stepper cards and the envelope, it was, I think it was 86p. No way. Honestly, we worked it out. That is awesome. 86 pence. Multi-order, that's yeah. all I can say. Seriously, because, you know, yeah. These are flying the stock. What's the update on the stock now, Alex? 
Okay, as we stand at the moment, everybody within their basket, that's all the stock we have at the moment. I don't know if we can restock it. We'll see if, what we can do. Yeah. Uh, but at the moment, yeah, if you've got it in your basket, it's not yours until you check out. And there will be certain people that miss out. I do want that not to be you. I don't want that to be you. That's what I meant to say. <laughs> uh, QCHD37 <laughs> is the product code for 11.99. I was excited about this because I love stepper cards. I do. I, I've never really had the inclination to make one because I didn't really know how to do it. No, there's so um, many people. I mean, I make them all the time. They're one of my all-time favourite cards to create because I think they look so amazing from a flat piece of card. You can make something so dimensional um, and it looks so unusual as well. If you do sell your makes, you know, these are the ones that are going to stand out. But yeah. if you don't get the measurements, if you don't have the equipment, you don't have the time, you don't have the patience, you don't have the skills... Well, I don't Just know if you're the same, you. but everyone I work with who's a, like a professional crafter like yourself, everyone that I work with says they hate measuring yeah. and trying to avoid it at yeah. every possibility. Yeah. So this is the perfect way of not having to measure a stepper card because it's all been done for you. Yeah. Well, I just think the icing on the cake, you could have left it without the foiling, but I think it's the foiling that makes it. Yeah, it is the foiling. It was something that we, we definitely wanted on there. So like I said, when we were talking about this, I was like, what about right foil stepper cards? And everyone was like, what? <laughs> and I was like, you know... Foil, stepper cards, yeah. with foiler. <laughs> Why not? Look, and I can Look, do it. Dave can do it. If I can do it, anyone can do it. Doing it. How easy is that? See? There we go. I haven't got Skills. my burnisher with me, but there we go. Look. Do you not have your burnisher with you? Can I borrow your bone too? Do you not have one in your pocket? <laughs> Funnily enough, I don't walk around with one. <laughs> yeah, I've got my hobby maker gift card in my butt pocket, but that's not. Is that room for everything? No. <laughs> kitchen, I've got a kitchen sink in my car. And all yeah. That, yeah, okay, that's fine. There we go. Yeah. How about that? Skills. Oh, it's gorgeous, that colourway as well, isn't it? The, the green and the gold. Absolutely incredible. QCHD37, 11 99 Can we get more stock? OK, if this sells out, I'll let you know. If it goes out of stock temporarily on our website, we will restock it for you. We have and did anticipate that might happen. Uh, but, yeah, quite simply, if it does say sold out, give us a couple of minutes and we'll get it more stock loaded on the system. Call the call centre and they'll help you as well. They're lovely up there. They're in the building in the UK, just outside of Birmingham. Um, and it, it's a free phone number, 0800 001 4433. We'll get you through to the call centre. And uh, if you've never shopped with us before, I always suggest just give them a call because they'll set the account up for you. You can do it yourself on the website, but get them to do it. It's free, free phone. Loads of new customers today as well. So welcome if you've never shopped with Hobby Maker before. Lots to tempt you, which is... <laughs> okay, should we do a real demo now? Go on then. A real card? Yes. Uh, okay. Uh, no, we can't have a minute for this one, Dan. No, it's not a minute for this one, It's not Dan. a minute for this one. I, I do have some extra things I've used, though, Alex. I'm sorry. I should have, uh, should have told you about these. So we're using mini shape builders. Moonstone dies, squares, starbursts, and hexagons. Yeah, and the straight edge nesting dies in hexagons. Okay, well, <laughs> hexagons, yep. yeah. We're going to find those and we'll put them on the website for you if you fancy purchasing those. Also, I asked Liam to add this to the show because it's back in stock. Oh, okay. This is our brilliant backgrounds paper pad. Paper pad. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. yeah. I remember how popular that yeah. was. Yeah. Land C&A, yeah? Yeah. That's the one back in stock. That is your discounted price, £9.99. pence. How many sheets do you get in the pad? Uh, I don't have it with me, but I believe it's 48. Okay. 12 different designs. And you've got lots of scenes, but of yep. course then you've got printed uh, pattern paper on the reverse, so you can use either the scene side or the pattern side. It's Where's Jimmy gone? Can you find us one? Jimmy? <laughs> Jimmy, Jimmy. <laughs> okay, so okay, what we're going to do is I've taken a few of my different... Uh, kind of hobbies, sports, and I wanted to kind of cut them out and I thought I just don't want to do them just square. So I'm going to go with this hexagon that's on here. Um, so I went with this at the, uh, oh, I haven't got my low tat tape with me. I know, and I used the one that we had on here before. Oh, we'll get one for you. I know. Sorry. Let me see if we can, uh, we might be able to cope without it. Lauren, <laughs> any chance of low tat tape? Have you still got the stuff from the last show? Because it's in there. It's like a little stack of low tack tape. <laughs> so it's here, you ask for things and people bring them to you. I know. It's wonderful. It's pretty awesome. Why can it be isn't like that it? at home? I don't know. I don't know. I need to get those kids trained. Mm. Like, Oi, kids, I want this. Get it me. <laughs> <laughs> Ring the bell. Oh, um, thank oh, you. We've got the die set. Alex has found it. Brilliant. So that's the squares, the starbursts, and the hexagons. £14.99. 
uh, TYHD08. Thank, Thank you, you so Mother. much. You. She's a star. That one's fine. Thank you. Um, so I'm going to go with a little bit of this just to hold my die in place. That's all. Okay. Um, so I'm going to just line that up on there. I'm going to cut all three at the same time. And I'm also going to cut one of these hex hexagons. So I've used the largest one from this set. And then I've used the number nine from this set to do my mat and layer with. Okay. So that we can get that perfect edge. You could use um, just the two from there and have your image a little bit smaller. It's up to you. It's just the way that I wanted this to look when it was done. Um, pop that on the top of there. That on there. Let's have that through there. Mm -hmm. And then we can see how this is going to look. So I've already prepared lots of them, so we don't have to cut loads of them out. I just wanted to show you how we got to the finished result. Stepper cards at the moment are saying sold out, but we're restocking them, aren't we? We're going to try and get some more in a minute. So if it's saying sold out, do bear with us, jot down the item number and we'll get more stock added uh, as soon as we can. So. Okay, so what you end up with is your gold miri one like that and then we have the shape so i've cut through three at once there so it just gives us that lovely kind of edge all the way around yeah. okay so i picked this one because i thought do you know what sometimes you'll you might have someone that you're making a card for and they like kind of multiple sports multiple hobbies mm -hmm. um and i thought actually it was quite nice to get a few on one card so i have got all sorts on here and um, we're going to play a game of blockbusters to get across the eight by eight cards. Okay. <laughs> so they're going to sit on here. So let's get this down first of all. I so I love that show. Um, I, do you know what? There's quite a lot of game shows being revived at the I moment know, though, isn't there? Yeah. So I'm just going in with my purple one here because I'm just making, just using flat kind of paper on card. So I don't want to use my dots on here. Just want to use the purple one. I remember just how popular those scene pads were, massively popular, because they're such a problem solver. And it's in stock, it's in the show if you want it. For they're amazing, nice aren't they? Mm. And then all we're going to do is just kind of get all these across the card, just kind of layer these in. Blockbusters. I know. You made it. It's awesome, isn't it? I can't remember what you had to do. Did you get, get... to get from one side to the other? Was that all you needed mm. to do? Yeah. So I'm going to go kind of like that, I think. And because we've cut them all the, all the same shape and the same size, even though they're all completely different hobbies, they just kind of work. It's a great card, isn't it's it? It's cool, isn't it? It just looks really good. So then I'm just going to take some of my foam pads and I'm going to just stick these on with our strips here. I could do all of those. Put them. I could do all of those sports. Could you? Yeah. Which is your favourite? Boxing. Boxing. Just <laughs> Can you imagine? We were saying earlier, it looks a bit like um, Fred from First Dates. I can't pronounce his surname. Syriac. That's him, yeah. Mm. So we're just going to add these onto here. And I'm going to put them at different heights as well. So I'm going to put some with like one layer of foam pads, some with two. I couldn't even do the fishing. I'm scared of fish. Are you? <laughs> yeah. I'm scared, scared of fish. fish. We have a fish tank at home with like tropical fish in. Oh, and I don't mind that. It's the, it's the big ones that kind of flap when you Yeah, catch no, them. I don't want them. No. Um, we have a fish that's an, it's called an upside down, upside down catfish, talking catfish. So if he comes out of the tank, which he often does, what like not on his like? own, oh. like, but he makes a really funny noise. That's why it's called a talking catfish because it makes a noise oh. when it comes out of the tank. Um, but when he. When cleaning it, you mean? Yeah, so yeah. when we take all the, like, the scenery bits out there's like a little temple in there and there's some wood and things like that. He, he lives inside the temple usually so mark tries to get him out of the temple but he doesn't so he takes the temple out and he's just like and i'm like oh my gosh he's on the floor no. <laughs> and it's like making this funny noise oh my goodness he freaks me out <laughs> I must admit, tropical fish tank appeals i would quite like one of those at home yeah we do uh, yeah. it is quite nice but when i was a kid i got sent um sea fishing with my dad's friend who lived next door it scared me to death yeah i don't think i'd like that no okay so just add in i'm going to go in flat with these ones so just creating a little bit of like kind of different movement with them different kind of heights this one's a little bit wonky so i'm just gonna move this one over just give it a little twist 
That's it. And then I'm going to go to uh, our dotty uh, dies, our dotty alphabet that we had a few weeks ago. Uh, Alex will have to find that as well. Okay. Uh, making him work tonight, aren't we? He's just sorting out. No, stuff you're fine. Moment, so. Don't worry. There's no uh, no crazy rush. If you search for dotty, I'm sure they will come up on the website. Yeah. <laughs> Amongst other things, probably. Isn't it? <laughs> So just add in our tape onto here, our foam strips. They were like dotty initials, something like that. Mm -hmm. And that is going to go up in the top corner on here. So it just fills that space nicely as well. Um, nice, chunky sentiments. And love then, that. I love that alphabet, by the it's way. It's cool, isn't yeah, it? Really nice. Really cool. Just really versatile, isn't it? You know, I, you could use that for absolutely everybody. Yeah. Um, and then I'm going to do something that I, I don't like to do because it's a little bit naughty, but it's a little sneak peek for something that's coming on Thursday. Oh. Oh, by the way, we've got more stock of the stepper cards. They've just been loaded. They should be on the website now. So if it's saying sold out, try again. It should be absolutely fine. Or call the call centre and they'll order it for you. 16 full step of cards, £11.99. Okay, sneak peek of what's coming up. Sneak peek of what's coming up. So, you know, we have the essential book of sentiments. Yes. We're bringing you the bigger book of sentiments Ooh. on Thursday. Okay. So imagine the essential book, but with bigger sentiments yeah. in. So it is a customer request. We have so many people getting in touch saying we love the essential book of sentiments. But can you do them any bigger? We'd like them a little bit bigger. So we were like, yeah, we can. Yeah. <laughs> this is not so a problem. Lovely, because Hunky Dory is a UK based company, family run business. If you say, can we have this? If it's possible, let's yeah. say probably yeah. Yeah, absolutely. And then I'm just going to go in and add, because I said to Nessa, I was like, when do these launch again? She's like, Thursday. And I was like, oh, she was like, use it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, okay. Okay. So yeah, Bex is, um, Bex is launching those on Thursday. She will be here. Look at that. What a card. That's brilliant. Just using some of the images from the Men's Leisure Pocket Pad. Uh, remember, the, the set of five pocket pads we got for you today is incredible value. Um, and that's what we use there, the, um, the Men's Leisure Time one. And you know, they're pennies each, to yeah. be fair. Yeah. The background, remember, is from the new pad that's back in stock, the background pad. Um, and that's only $9.99. That's on the website now if you want it. If you want the pocket pads, this is the brand new release, OK? You're going to get your heartfelt haberdashery. You're going to get your gardening days. You're going to get your paper art. You're also going to get your steampunk. And you're going to get your men's leisure time pocket pads, all five of them at this incredible price, $14.95. So it's under three pounds per book. And each book, you've got 64 A7 sheets, 16 designs, four of each. So potentially you've got hundreds of cards that you can make from this. And don't forget, now we've got added more stock of the stepper. This is the perfect size image to put onto the stepper. Could you actually put the bigger books on there as well? Would that you could, you just have to trim them down. Oh, okay. So like, you, you, just kind of crop the image down to right. fit. But yeah, you could use all sorts on there, toppers, yeah. I mean, anything the, the, really. Don't get me wrong, the steppers aren't just for these books. It's yeah. just that they work brilliantly well with them. You can use them with decoupage and all yeah. that sort of thing. All sorts you want to of things, do. yeah, okay. definitely. But yeah, we've got more stock of the steppers. And remember, they're in the most delicious colorways. They really, really are. Um, you've got, as you can see here, you've got like a custard yellow. You've got an Air Force blue, a royal blue. You've got a wonderful Sherwood green. I'm making up the names, but you're doing like a very good job. You've got your purple. <laughs> you've got your beautiful. That's like a, a like a mulled wine. Mulled isn't wine it? color, absolutely. There we go. Lovely lavender. That lime green with the silver is beautiful. But look at the foiling you've got on the there. That's what's done it for gorgeous, me. Gorgeous, isn't it? Look, you've got the foiling on all the panels. And, you know, I, I, I sometimes think sometimes when you're trying to put maybe paper panels on yeah. these little steps, they can look a little bit messy. They can look a little bit wonky if the glue's not set properly. Yeah. This is just a perfect finish. No measuring, no scoring, no cutting. They come flat packed like that. And all you do basically is fold them. And even the back seconds. of the steps is foiled as well. So like even on the reverse of oh, those little steps, they have the foil on as well. You so you can look at it from above. Yeah, it just looks amazing, doesn't it? It does. Wow, such a busy show. 11.99 gets you your steppers. QCHD37. 
Now, the dotty tape pens, just in case you've just got in, because we know in the evening lots of people have got distractions, dinner to get, that sort of thing. Um, this show was the first time I've seen these. I didn't realize that Hunky Dory were going to develop their own tape pens. They did, they released them on Sunday. I was away, I didn't see it. I didn't know anything about it until I came in today. Now, in the earlier show, we gave you the straight tape runner with yep. the, the, the continual strip. This hour, we're bringing you the dotty. Now, everyone I'm sure who's watched us for a while knows the benefit of the dotty. If you've got fine sentiments, really filigree artwork, die cuts that you want to stick down to use glue, can get really messy. What you've got with these is the dots will stick where you want them to on, on the fine little bits of cardstock, but they won't stick where you don't want them. Yeah. And you're gonna get a 22 meter refillable tape pen and you're gonna get two refills. <clears throat> so this is the cartridge that fits inside that pink case. But when that runs out, take it out and just throw that cartridge away. And then you pop this in. So you've got literally 66 meters of adhesive for under 10 pounds. And once you've got that, all you need to buy in the future are the refills. And we've got yep. a deal on the refills too. Yep, we have indeed. We've got every single one that these uh, that's available on this is in baskets but we are able to get more stock okay so don't worry we have preempted all of this we kind of knew that it would be a busy evening and busy day so if it's saying sold out at any point don't think you've missed out we can reload stock nine pound 98 for the tape pen and the two refills 66 meters of refill uh, of, um, of of dotty tape pen now the refills if you want those because lots of you are buying these and the refills at the same time now the refills individually are 3 dollars but we've got the bundle and that's where you save the most money. So if you've gone for the tape pen and the two refills and you'd like to buy more refills to go in there, £9.58 is the new discounted price, introductory price, won't last that price forever. Three refills, that's another 66 metres for under £10. DZ. DZ, am I American? DZHD47, <laughs> DZ, DZHD47, £9.58. pence. Now, Amanda in Essex. Hello, Amanda, good evening. Oh, Christine, sorry, in Lincolnshire. Hi, I'm trying to find the dotty alphabet, but not having much luck. Great show, Christine. Oh. Now, actually, Alex has found it for you, Christine. He's had about 10 things going sorry, on Sorry, well, I didn't help. I was like, Alex, find this. <laughs> Alex, find this. <laughs> She's so demanding. so demanding. But he's found it. So here's the dotty alphabet. <laughs> And that's not your price, okay? So thank you for the question. Thank you for the message. OBHD19, so this is every letter, did you do, it's um, letters yeah, and? Yeah, it's uh, your letters and your ampersand. Ampersands as well, yeah. so the and, comma. Uh, just your and. Oh, your and, okay, yeah. right, okay. So, so every yeah. letter of the alphabet, and it's got that lovely dotty detail in one side of it, really lovely font. 59.94, not 80 pounds, under 60. And we got it on split pay. Look at the split pay, that makes it, 29.97 to pay today and the big letters they're they what, are, a couple of inches uh, yeah let me find you there we go there's the packaging so you can see them okay they're a, they're a good size but they're not not too big not too big either so when we um yeah. i did a show with Haley a few weeks ago and i made an eight by eight card and i put joseph along the bottom comfortably Great. on an eight by eight card so well they're four centimeters by three and a half all of them okay so yeah very very attractive as well it's, it's almost got a little bit of a fairground look to it i was thinking that like a bit circusy yeah 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 like that a lot like that oh look da you oh it was dad wasn't it oh, yeah i was thinking you spelling my name for a minute no no, no, no. no i wouldn't be sorry i didn't have space dave okay there wasn't room with That's the true. blockbusters as well true i couldn't i could have done dan but i don't think you do all them sports dan do you he does all of them all of says. them Come and, come and show us your uh, judo. Judo. Come and show judo. us your judo. <laughs> 59.94 then, for those of you that want that uh, letters of the alphabet die set, OBHD19, and it's on split pay, remember, 29.97. Uh, do you want to do one more demo? Yes. Is that all right? I do indeed, okay. yep. <laughs> um, let me see. I've got two left. I think right. we're going to do this one because we haven't done the paper arts one yet. Now the paper arts one's brilliant. When I saw the words paper arts, I thought, oh, it's paper that you can quill and you can sculpt and all of that. But no, it's actually pictures of am amazing artwork that has been quilled. And if you know Carla from Carnation Crafts and We Are Makers and so on, um, that's what she started. That was her craft when she started crafting. She still loves doing it. She's very good at it too. Okay, so we are going to make a cat flap card. A what? A cat flap card. Oh. 
You've seen one of these before. I have. You I have. have. No, you said it, yeah. Yeah. I misheard what you said. <laughs> so let's get the base of the card started first of all. So we're going to go in with one of our Dior Design paper pads. You'll be able to find this on the website. It is Fantastic Foils. <laughs> Well, I think we put the duo design pick and mix on at um, two o'clock. Okay. Yeah. So I'm just going to go in with this one first of all. And I'm using some of our gorgeous pink Miri. It's ready for 19.98, the duo design paper pads. So you get one free, three for two. And then this is going to go on the inside of our card. So we need the score at the top. Do you realise Alex is having steam out of his ears? At the <laughs> I've not finished yet, Alex. I've got, two <laughs> <laughs> I've got two more things for you. Yeah, yeah. You've seen it, haven't you? So there's the straight edge, nesting hearts, and the hugs and kisses. That's definitely on the website, because I, I looked the other day, I checked before I used it, I checked. And that'll be the last two things, Alex, don't worry. That'll be it. Don't tell him that. Oh, okay, maybe not. Nesting. Ah, <laughs> uh, I feel like... Oh, it's found it. It's found Found it. And then this one is... Glitter... Glitter-tastic, is it called? Glitter... Yeah. <laughs> I'm making sure that tell he's... Tell you on the uh, this is, everybody. Yeah, he's I'm... working, you know. You can't get more interactive than this. Can Not you? Not £14.99 for <gasps> our nesting guy hearts. Um, we can let you have them for £7.49. What? It's Valentine's Day. In how many weeks? Two and a half. £7.49 <laughs> and you've got one, two, three, <laughs> four, five, six, seven. There's eight dice. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's good value, isn't it? It's amazing. It is. And actually, they're big enough, you can make them into, um, like, you can have, like, bunting. Yeah, definitely. Bunting in the windows. Yeah, you absolutely can. And having a romantic dinner. So we're going to cut away the white there. Is your mark very romantic? No. No? No. no. Not at all. No, I'm not either, so it's absolutely oh, fine. Right. Yeah, absolutely Wait fine. Wait for each other? Yeah. Indies. You reckon? <laughs> Alex, our producer, reckons he's really reckons romantic. Reckons he's romantic. Yeah. I can imagine that. I can imagine he will be, actually. Yeah. There was no doubt. There was no doubt. OK, then we're going to crop one of these down. So I'm going to trim it down to a smaller size. So we're making it into a square rather than a rectangle. And again, we're going straight onto some more of that Miri. And then we're going to add this on to our, let's just make sure that's the right way up. I'm going to pop two strips of our foam down the middle so that we're still getting that height now mm -hmm. on here. So let's just pop that on there. And then I'm going to go in with my heart die now and cut another one of these out. So I think... This one is the perfect size there. It's a lovely craft, isn't it, paper quilling? I know it's yeah. a bit time consuming. It's gorgeous, isn't yeah, it, though? It's really, really lovely, yeah. It really is. So I think I'm just going to go with that one. So let me just get a little bit of tape to hold that in place. Are we OK? Yeah, with go on, the, then. Um, are we OK with the tape, dotty tape runners? We've got more stock of those now. We'll have a little look for you. And I'm going to cut the hugs and kisses out of our Pink Marie as well. Okay. okay, so let's go. <laughs> Have you not? I think I dial it down a bit when I'm here. I think. What, your accent? Yeah, mm. I think I do. It's my telly voice. <laughs> Everyone no, says, because I don't talk to anyone on the phone. Everyone says I, I, <laughs> I, I end up talking a bit brummy after I've been do here for you? like four or five days in a row. Yeah. I pick it up. Yeah. The couple of little mannerisms. That's funny. Mm. I like it. <laughs> okay, let's grab this. As long as I don't think I'm taking the Mickey, that's the only thing that worries me. <laughs> Nobody talks like that here. <laughs> I 
What are they doing in there? I don't know. They're on Low some, tech take. It was on the four o'clock show. There you go. <laughs> so we're just going to lay that over the top there. Let's go to our hugs and kisses. <laughs> You've got another hour of this I day. Know. If I'm going I know. home. I know. <laughs> you can tell it's their, their day off tomorrow, the, the crew, can't you? They're demob happy, I think that's what it is. What have I done? You are? Hugs and kisses. There you go. No. We found that for you on the website as well. So it's on the screen. 9.99 for your hugs and kisses. So this is where your dots are going to come in so handy because they're just going to stick where we need them to. Even if we go over those letters, so they're only going to stick to our cardstock. So we can get that adhesive on there. It's perfect. I'm going to add it to our parchment. So it's sticking to our parchment beautifully. Mm -hmm. um, Natalie was using this to stick acetate on the weekend in her shows. Okay. Um, obviously parchment, there's so many different surfaces you can use uh, them for as well. Of course, if you're putting something, sticking it onto acetate, the last thing you want to do is have a gluey mess on the back that's visible. Yeah. The dots virtually disappear, so you yeah. can't really see them. So we're just gonna <laughs> trim around here with our scissors just to get a little bit of a shadow around our sentiment there. So just taking that in. Lots of practice. Yeah, I can watch you do that all day. <laughs> so we'll just go around the edge of there. Oops. Let's round that off. There we go. That was a snazzy little dance, wasn't it? And then we're going to just kind of add that, shall I put it at the corner on the side there? So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pop a little bit of our dots onto there so that we can add oh, that on there. Look at there that. we and go. There's your cat flap card. There it is. There's your cat, cat flap card. Love Who it. needs a Valentine's card? It's up for grabs if you want it. <laughs> Everybody is going to be... <laughs> Grabbing that, that's for sure. Alex will definitely be grabbing that one at the end of the show. I'm sure about that. As seen on TV, Alex, there you go. <laughs> Fiverr, it's yours. Yeah, uh, right, it's not now, for free. <laughs> what have we got stock-wise? Where are we? Okay, let's recap the stepper cards. Okay, now these are going crazy. We have restocked them. I don't know how many more we've added in stock, but they are going ballistic. We haven't got many left again. How many times did you sell out of these? Uh, but Fifth, fifth restock it's had fifth now. Fifth restock yeah. today alone. We now are. I know a lot of you watch us all day, right the way through from one o'clock to eight o'clock, and thank you very much for those of you that do. But I know a lot of you have things to do during the day, can't watch during the daytime, watch shows on repeat, or watch the evening shows when you get in from work or school or whatever it might be. These have sold out five times. Fifth restock today. They, and just to prove the point. They will be going back on the machines tomorrow. Super quick, uh, because we just didn't really know how busy they would be. Um, you know, it's always difficult to gauge how popular things can, are going to be. You can never accurately predict no. how popular No, so we, we allocated an amount, um, and obviously that went very fast, and we got some more. And now we're just basically on a, you can have as many as you like, because they're being remanufactured tomorrow. <laughs> right, so you're just so we are printing to order. Yes, essentially. Order. Look, yeah. I've just done that without any tools whatsoever. I haven't even got a, a scoring tool. Look, didn't even measure anything, didn't have no. to. But I love the, the finishing touch for me that makes these, these special is the foil. Yeah, it is amazing. Should we do another uh, quick one? Have we got time? Yeah. Show you how and to make I love the one. fact that they're foiled on the back of the steps as well. So that really finishes it off a treat. You get 16 of them in adorable scorable. So bendy ink technology, lots of gorgeous colors. Uh, and you never need score or cut or measure a stepper card ever, ever again. 16 for 11.99. Oh, that's my favorite card. I know. I'm going to give you that to fold up, seeing as you're an absolute pro now. Thanks. While I do this bit. So we've got a little bit of uh, sticking to do. A little bit of, you are getting envelopes getting included envelopes as well. Yep. So you can be making these kind of cards uh, for, what do we say it was, 86p, including the envelope. Yep, and including the topper. Including the, the topper, including the Miri, mats, 
uh, it's just amazing. Now we are actually going to layer up a few of these. I've done a little bit of decoupage on here. Um, so we are using a couple of our sheets. I think I've used all four actually for this one. So we're going to go in with our first layer just as like the kind of rectangular shape that's there. It's gorgeous, the black one, isn't it? It's so I thought it was beautiful. a dark green one, it's not, it's a black one, but look at that. There we go, all done, all schooled, all folded. Dave, I could get used to having like a, a what, like a, a sous crafter, like a sous chef, yeah, but. You're Debbie McGee. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's add this layer on next like this so i haven't done all the layers i've just picked out some of the chunkier details mm -hmm. um and then i'm just going to go in and add that butterfly onto there as well just lifting up those wings let me just press that down with my die brush to get that shape on there uh where's the this one yep yep let's just uh, let's just have another burnish I was not burnished enough. Just a, you know, just another. Did you do the inside scores? No. Ah, uh, that's oh, why that's you see. Right. You need to make sure you get these ones on uh, the inside. Good, good tip. Yeah. Though. There we go. And then again, we'll just go in with see, some foam. <laughs> just to keep you on track, make sure you're doing your inside scores. Yeah. So we can add that straight onto there like that that's gorgeous and then we'll add a little sentiment from our essential book of sentiments and um, we've just gone with one that's like kind of ivory but obviously there's gold ones uh, black ones in there as well so you could pull out any of those but i'm just gonna tuck that one up there and have our anniversary wishes look a stepper card foiled how Super quick was that and it's so two minutes three minutes yeah yeah definitely <laughs> Uh, whatever you do, all the items on the show, there's not one show or one item in particular that is kind of leading the way everything is popular. The pocket pads, remember the brand new ones today, five for 15 pounds. Each pad has got 64 sheets in it. So there's hundreds of cards you can make out of these pocket pads. We've got the pick and mix, any three for two with the say it with style and the pocket pads as well. If you only want three, we've got the stepper cards with the envelopes. We've got the pocket mirror mats yep. as well that go with the uh, pocket pads as well what a show thank you for your orders thank you for watching and there's one more live show to go through until eight o'clock we've got Hayley and the dreamies Anne Marie, it's been a pleasure thank, thank you, you very much see you soon two weeks two weeks yeah are you off i'm going to frankfurt next week oh for the craft event. yeah right yeah. right oh. so i'll see you on the sixth that'll get messy <laughs> it will you know andy and scott and liam are going uh, well i'm not going as long as that oh i'm only going monday tuesday they're there for the whole weekend yeah. who knows what state they'll be in by the time i meet up with them on monday who knows okay then i'll see you with Haley then for dreamies right after this Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. Here at Hobbymaker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and checkout and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. 
Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects, and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1 p.m. to 8 p.m., and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. What an amazing evening we're having here at Hobby Maker. Thank you ever so much for tuning in. A really busy, hunky dory show. Uh, and it's going to get, I'm sure, as busy with the Dreamies today. Lovely Haley's back. Always busy shows when you're here. You're right. Yeah, I'm good, thank you. Are you? Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> um, one thing that I know you love about the Dreamies, you love everything about the Dreamies, I know. But one thing in particular, you love the fact that Haley draws the stamps that she sells and you can craft with. We've got a brand new one in this show that you've not seen before, but it follows the same sort of style that we've done previously of the winter bear, the dog, the puppy, wasn't it, that we did? Yeah, yeah. So we've got a rabbit coming up in a second. With Easter not that far away, um, and you're probably planning Easter projects and things like that. But we've also got some amazing, amazing um, paper packs for you as well. Now, look at the blossoming blooms. Now, are the, is this new today? It is new, yeah. Is it? Yeah, brand new. Brand new. Now, look at these colourways. Look at the artwork you've got on all of these papers. And all of your papers are always loose, aren't they? Yeah, so you're getting 48 sheets and you get eight different designs. So you're getting 12 of each, but that's really so you can use six of each side. But if you prefer 12 of one side, then you absolutely can use just the one side that you prefer. OK, so the blossoming blooms are all over here there we go that's what you're getting all of that there and the carrier sheet on the front of the actual pad itself has got uh, images of course of all the sheets that are inside it so you don't have to keep on trying to remember what's in there um, and you've got remember in total how many sheets 48 and they're um, 120 gsm and they're uncoated as well so if you want to do your inking and all your stamping and stuff on there then you can do and I know loads of you love to use the, uh, the Dreamies paper pads for things like covering MDF and that sort of thing. And we've got really cute MDF projects in the show. We've got little bird houses, Easter baskets that you can put little eggs in, that sort of thing. Yeah. Uh, and of course the Easter stamp, or the bunny stamp, because a bunny's not just for Easter. Okay, let's get the price in and let's show you what you can have the pad for. £8.99 pence if blue's your colour. Or maybe you collect all the pads that the Dreamies bring out. Um, this is a great price. £8.99 for the 8x8 loose leaf papers. As Hayley said, they're all uncoated, so you can add all your effects. You can fussy cut the flowers out if you want to. Um, and you've got patterns and images of flowers running all the way through it. But always amazing value for money. RP2790 is the item number for that. Evelyn in Cheshire is in already. Rita in West Midlands is in already as well. Maybe you collect all of them. Maybe you've had the gold and the black one that's been really really popular um we haven't got that today have we oh, which gold, one the black gold and gold one? yes we have yeah oh, i've got it it's over here okay did that's, you want it yet or? i'll just say that's in stock <laughs> well. so just to give you a heads up that has been sold out so many times i've lost track the black and gold is available on our website as well for you which i know loads of you love so if you've been looking for it wanting it couldn't get it it's in stock right now the other new thing though i want to let you know about is as i was saying the stamp and you draw this 
Yeah. You draw all these characters. I'm obsessed with bunnies. <laughs> I have been for a long time. Got home? Two. Two. Yeah, Boo and Tiny, uh, two little black bunnies. Um, but that one we've called Aeroplane in ears because that's kind of what he's doing. He's got his it two is. up and, and down. And it follows <laughs> the technique, the drawing technique that Hayley um, has done before with the bears and the puppies and the dogs and that sort of thing, uh, giving you these little fine lines. So rather than having a, a defined outside edge, um, it's more... Um, how can I put it? It's, it's a bit, it gives you a little bit more leeway when you're colouring it in. Yeah, that's it. Um, it kind of looks a little bit fluffy already as so, well, doesn't yeah. it? Um, but then because it is so fluid on the edges, you've not got to worry about staying in the lines. If you go a little bit out, it's going to be fine. It's not really that defined. And for cutting out as well, you've not got a solid line to stick to. You can just cut about a couple of mil um, border around it and it'll look great. It is only... £4.99. That's all it is. Add it to your order, add it to your collection. OW2763. OW2763 is your product code. Under a fiver for a hand drawn stamp that you can reproduce, you can sell, you can make your own Easter images. Haley's absolutely fine for you to do that, but it's been drawn by Haley. You know the artist, you met her, you meet her regularly here. And it's just nice to know that, isn't it? Yeah, that's it. So you can make and sell with all of this. Like, I'm quite happy for you to do that. And any of our card kits you saw earlier as well. We've worked with artists that are happy for you to sell and uh, make what you sell as well. Make and sell. What you, sell what you make there. That's sell what you it. Make. Yeah. <laughs> all day. the words, wrong order. <laughs> um, so you can do all that, whether it's for yourself or charity. We're quite happy for you to do that and make some money back. That is really, really good. And just to give you a heads up, we have also got stock of the bear. And you can see that the, the style is very, very similar to the rabbit, but they all kind of work together really nicely. There we go. Look. So if you want the bear, that's back in stock by popular demand. Uh, the winter bear is what we call him, the wintry bear. He's four ninety nine as well. But you can really um, build up a collection and make this something that you're known for, known for actually making of yeah, this style of card. Yeah, that's it. Especially if you have got quite a collection now, and that is what's on your stand. Yeah. Like we don't sell um, like loads and loads. We are a small company, so your stand is probably going to uh, stand out a little bit because of that, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Not everybody's going to have. Yeah. Exactly. Okay, right, over to you, Hayley, what do you want to show us? Right, so we're going to make this card then with this gorgeous little bunny. So we're changing it up a little bit and we're doing um, kind of like a, a cut across there and we've got that nice aperture almost halfway down. So then we're rejoining it with that oval there and we've just got that nice little tent fold card there that's um, using obviously the blossoming blues and that bunny as well. Beautiful. So first off then, I'm going to do the card base. So it's about a five by seven, I would say. Um, so I'm just going to stick my paper on there already and then we can do the actual cutting to change that shape a little bit. So just using a little bit of wet glue there. Make sure we put some in the middle because when we chop that up, we want to make sure it still stays stuck. So then I'm just going to bring in my paper trimmer. Mm -hmm. And then we're just going to chop this at two different points. So if you really want to, you can do it at completely different angles. I'm kind of going to go for similar angles, really. And we're just going to take out this central section there so that then we can reposition it back together. Okay. So we've got that piece originally. And then just before we stick it back together, we're going to do um, the inside part as well. So I've just got some of this spotty paper. And it's nice that you've got, obviously, the images of the flowers, but then you've got the pattern as well. to give Yeah, it relief that's it. We do try and put in quite a lot of different variety. So you have got florals in most of the paper pads, but then sometimes you do just want something that's not floral. Yeah. Maybe it's for a mail card or just someone that doesn't like flowers. Um, which if is you put a floral backing paper on that, it would be a bit too much. It would be floral overkill. Yeah, that's it. So then to rejoin these and make sure that it's going to stand up, we're going to use this oval die cut. So this is just one of ours that we've had in the past. I'll definitely bring it back in stock. So we're just lining up the bottom of the card there so that it's in line and then just going to attach this. So make sure you don't add glue to anywhere that is going to go through the middle and then stick it all together. So we've just added glue at the top here and then just this little overlap here so that then it's still going to lift open. Perfect. And make sure that that is stuck in place and then that is going to hold that up um, when it stands up, it's still going to stand. So then I've just got another oval that's just going to pop in the centre. So again, this is one of the um, sort of watercolour papers that's in the Blossoming Blues. Mm -hmm. So again, just sticking that down, just using that same wet glue. 
And although the pattern on the reverse of that is quite bold, it doesn't come through the other side. No, of the that's it. You can't see it. And it is, with it being uncoated as well, it is nice then for stamping on, for doing your flower dyes and things like that as well. So we're going to need to make our little bunny then. So I'm just going to um, grab my, in fact, we'll use a bit of acetate. I thought I got my messy mat out, but I've misplaced it, shockingly. <laughs> <laughs> So we're just going to stamp out this rabbit then. So I've just got a little piece of watercolour card. And I would suggest if you are using the Easy Blend pens that watercolour card is the best for that just because you want that movability of the ink. Now you can try it on um, smooth stamping card and if you're happy with the results then by all means use that. Um, I just find it easier on the watercolour card to move that ink around. So we've got our nice little bunny there. So cute. And then we're just going to do him white and pink. So he's going to have a little um, bit of grey to him, just so that he's got a bit of shade in. Was he modelled on your own rabbit? Yeah. <laughs> was, was he posing for you? <laughs> I wish. I wish training. he sat still long enough. <laughs> now, the Easy Bend plans, um, we have these as, in as many dreamy shows as we can uh, because they're brilliant and they're amazing value. 12 pens in each pack, three packs, different colours, 36 double-ended pens. Um, and you've got a bullet nib and a brush nib and they're just great they really are water-based should be 59.97 no that's what they should be they should be 19.99 a set you can have all three sets for less than 10 pounds a set 29.99 for all of those and just look at those array of colors perfect right so i've just added a little bit of pink just onto my bit of acetate so you'll just see it over the front here and i'm just going to pick that up with just a little bit of water and then we're just going to add the pink in for his or her little ears so just on the inside of that line there so just adding that in and you can see it blends so easily and so effortlessly mm -hmm. So we'll get rid of our pink and then obviously like i said i just want to keep him quite white so i'm just going to lay down a little bit of my gray and then we're going to put plenty of water into that do you ever go right in with the pen directly onto the watercolor card I do sometimes, yeah, definitely for, um, you know, if you're doing maybe some floral work or something like that, or you've got an image that's got quite a lot of smaller bits, that's definitely really easy to do then to go straight in with your pen and then just drag the colour out into the smaller areas. So I just find it easy this sort of way, especially when you've got a big open space like this to get the blending right. Mm -hmm. So that then plenty of water and dulling down that colour just gives me the, the base really. What, then, in, what ink pad did you use so that it doesn't... Uh, Versafine it okay. was. So that is a pigment ink. I okay. always get, com I say confused, I always forget which one's which. I think everybody does. It's yeah, a bit of a minefield. It, it is. <laughs> but obviously if you're using alcohol pens, you then want the other one of that, which is dye based, I think, isn't I think it? You're right, yeah. So we're just adding in that little bit of grey there. So he is a little bit greyer than the one that I've got, but that's fine. You can have him whatever colour you prefer. So on the one that I did earlier, he's a little bit more white, just got more grey shading just around the edges. And then if I just give this a quick blast. So we've got the grey, obviously, of the Versafine there. And then I'm just going to go in with my actual pen, like you were saying, just to fluff up that edge a little bit more. And also then, if you wanted to... Um, create more of a border around him this would then blend in and give you that nice edge so I'm just adding in my little flicks just to make him even fluffier and just in the same grey tone that we've been using there and it's lovely to have a stamp that you can decorate and colour to whatever colour the rabbit needs to be maybe you've got a pet rabbit when you want to make it colour for someone that has <coughs> or you're looking for a really lovely Easter card which would be perfect yeah absolutely so then if I take in a little bit of the water again and just blend that edge, if you really wanted to, you can then create more of a sharper edge just around the edge that is just giving him a bit of a frame, really. But it's completely up to you. Like, you don't have to do that. On this one, I haven't really. But you can see that there is a bit more definition than just around his eyes. Not his eyes, sorry, his ears. So then wipe away that ink. And then I'm just going to use... <laughs> And then I'm going to bring in my card so we can then pop our little bunny onto the topper area. So just grabbing my hot glue, I'm just going to pop him in the centre there. And then we can start to add our flowers on. So I've been using the Fantastic Frills for this card. 
So I've just got a couple of small ones, four medium and then one of the larger ones, but it's still only the smaller in the collection. And we're just gonna frill these petals and just make that a really nice full flower. It is, yeah, fantastic frills. So just concertina folding those and I've got three together. And just keep going round. So then I've got my foam mat somewhere. There we go. So just popping these apart and then I'm just gonna grab my ball tool so we can press into the middle there. And then just add in a little dab of glue just into the centers there. Now your fantastic frills, the stamp set comes with its own die set as well, doesn't it? It does, yeah. So, so um, you've got plenty of dies in there. I'm not sure exactly how many, but um, you also then get the outside edge of the um, flowers and the solid ones as well. Mm -hmm. um, so then with these middle ones that we're just going to crease down the centers, um, and then we've just got four of these to do. So we can layer up the two of each to make a flower. So just pressing in the middle there and separating these out. And then we've just finally got our two little ones that are gonna be single flowers just for on the edge. I mean, you've got quite a few signature looks, but certainly flowers. Yeah, that's it. Flowers are on pretty much everything. I think I've made one card today so far without flowers. That's it out of the six I've done. <laughs> <laughs> it was a speed one, that. And then I was speed crafting and they still said to me, oh, you've got a minute left. I was like, oh, slow down then. I'll <laughs> oh, slow down. <laughs> Is that I've the fantastic done. frill stamp, Hayley, that one? Uh, no, it's the other one. That's the stamp, yeah. Um, it has got matching dice somewhere. I'm not sure what's happened okay. to them. But I'll show it at the end of the demo. Yeah, that's fine. So I just used my ball tool then on the smallest flower. And then we're just going to create kind of an arrangement of flowers just around our bunny. So we're just popping one there. Have I just dropped? Oh, I've lost the flower. Have you? Well, that was there a second ago. We're going to have to skip a flower. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll add our little one on there. And then, hmm, what Mystery. happened to it? Things disappear in this place. The rabbit maybe did eat it, yeah. yeah. Do you know what? We'll just cut another one. Do rabbits eat flowers? They do, don't they? Mm. <laughs> yeah, they do eat yeah. flowers. <laughs> Just Evidently, Dan, our director, has got a rabbit as well, which I didn't realise. And you've got a cat and you've got a dog. Um, oh, you haven't got the rabbit anymore. OK. Well, it, it escaped into next door's garden and it ate all of the next door garden's flowers. You have to watch them. They'll eat anything. <laughs> Do right. flowers have the, ro the roam of the house? Yeah. Right. Yeah, and they make a, a lot of mess. <laughs> Put it I'm that not way. Don't ask any more details about no. that. No. <laughs> they get hay everywhere. They get food oh, everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> right, so we'll just cut another one because I've lost my... It'll turn up in a second, won't it? Yeah. So I'm just cutting a couple of those same flowers then and just going to fold them again, remake it and hopefully not lose. Oh, there it is. Oh, you found it. Where there it? it is. Oh, I think it was just attached to my mat. Oh. Yeah, so we don't need to make another one after all. But we, we saw them die cutting. <laughs> mm -hmm. So then just pop in that one just under there and then my last little one just onto the side there. So then I've also got a little bit of moss to pop in the side. So we've got some of the green. So this is either in your mixed mosses or your essentials. Mm -hmm. So just going in and just adding those little bits of green in there. So again, in fact, let's be careful not to do what I've told you not to do. Stick it together. <laughs> get too carried away and then go, oh, no, now it won't open. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a real fan of you when, when you add the moss. I, I, when, I, when I first saw it, I thought, what, what do I use that on? How do I use that? But it makes yeah. such a difference. Yeah, that's it. It really does. So then I'm just going to lift that up just so that we can add that little bit of glue in there and it not just stick straight down. And then same on this side as well. So just pop that into there. So then just a little bit on the inside as well. And then just a little bit on that side as well. So then we've just got our, um, oh, we've ended up with moss on the inside. Hmm. That's fine. 
So then we've just got um, a sentiment and some butterflies. So the sentiment is actually from our Bunnies in Bloom kit, which I'm not sure, is it still in stock? It might have sold out earlier. Oh. Yes, they have sold out. They have gone. <laughs> They've all gone. And then just to finish off, we've just got a couple of butterflies from our filigree adornments. So just popping those at the top as well. And then I'm just going to finish off my flowers and those butterflies just with a pearl in the centre of each. So one up there and there. Now we've got the bumper bundle of pearls back for you today as well. Give me the number again, Hayley. How many? Um, 7,200. Is that all? I think. <laughs> 7,200 pearls. I'll give you details of it at the end of the demo. But uh, we've got it in stock today. And the pickup tool, this is what I use for my model making every single time I, I, I sit down to do my model making. I use this. It's brilliant. It's got basically a wax tip and it picks up little gems and little, uh, in my case, little windows. Yeah, that's it. You can use it for sequins, seed beads. You can use it for pearls, obviously, faux gems. Anything like that. Yeah, and if then you're a jewellery maker, um, yeah. it's going to be a new best friend. If you do any of the gem art pictures, brilliant for that as well. Yeah, definitely. And then just pop in those last couple just in the middle of those flowers. And then there we go. Look, isn't that beautiful? And of course, the star is our brand new aeroplane bunny because it looks like his, uh, his ears are propellers. Aren't they cute? <laughs> Really cute. Now, um, we're very busy for the new pad as well, the Blossoming Blues paper pad. This is the stamp set that we were talking about when we talked about the, um, the Fantastic Frills. Ah. No, it's not. Um, oh, it's for the next thing. Oh, oh is it underneath the, in front of you? Those are... Oh, are these then? Yes, they might be. Ah, that's, buried. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, now the other it's one. that one. Yeah, that's the one. <laughs> so you're going to get... There we go. They were there. They were buried. You're going to get <laughs> the dies and you're going to get the stamps to match. Um, and brilliant. I mean, they, you'll use these every single day. I feel sure about that because you can always add a floral embellishment on any card you make or any project you make. Think about canvases and home decor, frame decorating, anything like that. The stamps and the dies together, incredible value. I don't know how, Haley you do this. 19 99 not for one or the other, but for both. Yeah, so that's what we used in the demo. Uh, CQ2709 is the item number, CQ2709. Now, if you want your pearls, if you've not seen these before, be prepared to be amazed. Look, each of these little boxes have got six compartments in them and six lids. And you get all of these. Every single one of these you're going to get. And they're coming in different shades of the same colour. So you get uh, three shades of pink, three shades of blue, three shades of purple. You get your metallics. You get your greens and you also get your uh, kind of citrus, your oranges and yellows as well. But look, the, the lid on each one is completely separate. Really cool. So you can reuse these storage boxes when you've actually used up all the pearls, but it will take you probably months, if not years, to use up 7,200. Um, well, maybe not, I'm not sure. But you get the whole lot, should be 59.94. KF2716, every time these are on air, they fly. 32 pounds and 99 pence gets you 7,200 pearls in three different sizes and in uh, so many different colorways too. KF2716. Uh, and we've got the uh, moss in the show. The moss is available. And I think, have we got a picture of the moss? Because I think this is all... Okay, let's have a little look because it's in two different colorways now, isn't it? So you've actually got... This is the mixed mosses collection. So if we can have a little look at the picture because there are... We're just working on it, but it's 19.99. So these are the mosses you're going to get from the mixed mosses collection. So you get 10 colours, 10 grams of each. So you've got reds, you've got greens, you've got browns in there. Um, you've got uh, a, like a denim blue in there as well. And basically, it looks a little bit like coral, but it's soft. And it can also look like foliage and trees for model makers and that sort of thing. But again, a little bit of that on a card in between the flower just makes the flowers pop. It, it does, absolutely. And because you've got all those different colours as well, it's, it'll match loads of different projects. So the pinks and purples and the blue in particular, they're really nice for if you're doing maybe a sea sort of theme that you can use it for coral. Um, but then obviously the green mosses, the brown and the whites as well, are using pretty much all my different card making. Fab. Okay, so those are some of the things that we were using. We have got MDF coming up in the show. We've also got another stamp set to show you too, which, um, I mean, every home needs a fairy door. I'm sorry, every home <laughs> should have a fairy door because the fairies need somewhere to live and somewhere to get out. So 
There's your fairy door. You can make it into a card. You can make it into a little ornament if you want to as well. You've got little verses on there as well. It's a wonderful day to be happy. Have a lovely birthday. You've got little toadstool and um, is that a little fairy? Yeah, little fairy flying. There we are. Look. So there's the door. And again, you could put this onto all sorts. Put it maybe onto craft card, colour it in. £12.99 for all these stamps and it's TG2772. But we're doing a deal this evening. $9.99 for all of those fantasy uh, fairy door stamps. There we go. So that is fantastic. We've also got more stamps for you. I know that um, you're going to be using these in the demo. We've got this stamp set, which is little postcards. I, these are adorable. I love anything postcardy, as uh, anyone that knows me will vouch. But aren't they gorgeous? So, so sweet. We've only got a couple left of these from the earlier show. So if you fancy getting the stamp for that fantasy postcard, Really cool. Both of those together for £5.99. And then the little fairy stamp set. Is that that one, Hayley? It is, yes. Okay, so the little fairy stamp set that's being used in the show. Uh, there we are. So you've got two fairies. And also you've got uh, happy birthday, make a wish, take care. You matter to me. But again, they're really lovely outline stamps. That you, You've drawn these again, yeah? Yeah, yeah, all of them I did, yeah. Very easy to colour them in as well. Nice open... Uh, surface areas to colour those in. So we're going to be using those in the demo as well. £14.99. pence. That is not your price. We're doing it today for £12.99 for all of those. And they're large stamps as well. Uh, so you can go for the fairy door, go for the fairies, go for the postcards. The postcards could be being sent by the fairies. AL2783 is your item number for those. And they're going to feature, all of that's going to feature in the demo, isn't it, Harry? It is, yes. Lovely. Right, so this is the card then that we're going to make. So we're doing kind of a gatefold card there and just using that fairy door on the top of there. And I was just thinking that we can tie it in because then it's kind of like you're opening the fairy door and then there's a fairy inside. Mm -hmm. So I just thought it'd be quite a nice little theme that we can go with. Cute. So first off then, we'll do our stamping and colouring of our fairy door. So I've just got my Versafine ink pad again and we're just going to stamp that out just again onto some watercolour card. So just giving that a good press. And again, anyone that's worried about stamping or anything like that, definitely get yourself a stamping platform, whether it's just something basic like this one or if it's your um, Crafters Companion ones or anything like that. Mm -hmm. Just so you can go back in again, if you do feel like you've not pressed it hard enough, like you can still make use then of the actual cardstock that you're using rather than trying again and just thinking, oh, I've made a mess and getting a bit of waste out of that. Well, we've got lots to choose from. We've got the new Sizzix one, which is A4. Yeah. That's in stock now as well, because Sizzix are with us. Right, so I'm, I'm not sure which blue I use, so I'm going to have to give it a test. We've just got a little bit of water, so I've just laid down um, a dark blue, so I'm just going to... Oh, yeah, it's that one, I think. So I've gone for the darkest blue in my collection, and then I'm just watering that down, and we're just going to add loads of that blue just into this doorway. Honestly, those pens are going to be your new best friend. Yeah, absolutely. So easy to use, just fluid ink that comes, once you mix it with water, obviously it's not fluid ink, um, but just scrub it onto um, a glass mat or something like that. Um, messy mat if it, or mylar, or something like that if you've got it. Um, works just perfectly but and then blending got, that out. You've got 36 colours, but of course when you water it down, that then opens up a whole... Yeah, range of colours, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, hundreds of different Yeah, colors. of course. So just flood fill in all of that with that blue. And then once you bring in the Blossoming Blues papers, it's a really good match. Oh yeah. So it just works really easily with that. So then just going in, best tip that I can give you is just plenty of water and just taking it steady, you know, moving the ink around plenty, yeah, but not worrying about, oh, I need to get it done really quick or anything like that. Just taking your time, blending that ink out and making, making sure that you're happy with those results then. And the best thing for me about watercolour is if it's not perfect, it doesn't matter because it's, it's kind of like as the water's dried, you've got a little bit of a pooling area and it's just, it looks like that. That's, it, that's the nature of watercolour. I think watercolour looks, looks more natural. Yeah, definitely. So do I. Sometimes alcohol pens can be a little bit too bold, a bit too yeah. bright. So you can see there from that same bit of ink, because I've not watered it down as much, I'm getting these really dark blues out of it as well. But then if you wanted to then maybe add in some of the blue direct from the pen, mm -hmm. like maybe onto these berries or something like that, you're going to get an even darker colour. 
and then you can then maybe put in a little bit lighter on the berries and whatever you want to do with that really. So then um, I would carry on obviously and then build up this image to make sure that all of the bits are covered. We can do brown obviously around the edge, we can add in our greens, but I've got one somewhere. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, I've misplaced it again. Um, that I did a little bit earlier on. So I've just chopped that out and fussy cut around the edge there, just leaving a little bit of a border, added my little yellow bit so it looks like there's a light on inside. And then I've created a background using the background snippets. But could I tell you where I've put that stamp? I'm, do I'm not doing well today, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I'm losing everything. Could I possibly borrow your sample of it, Dave? Which one do you want? Uh, the preparing? background snippets. It's got the script the and the... Yeah, I've got yeah, it. Yeah, thank you. Ah, <laughs> and I can yeah. actually show you how we got... Oh, I'm passing it on. <laughs> thank you. Bang, background, background snippets. snippets. Great for effects. You've got, uh, <laughs> you got text on there and all sorts. Musical notes, I think, as well. Yeah, musical notes. You've got your little damask, your script, and then this brickwork. So it's the brickwork that I wanted to use, which is how I've created this background here. These are going to be a really useful stamp set to be uh, to be in your collection. They're only nine ninety nine as well. ZN two seven three five. So again, just going to put down some of my brown. And now this, I'm not actually using watercolor card for. And you'll see the difference in how the ink just will not move. Um, but it doesn't really matter because we're going for that sort of effect where the brickwork is just messy. So I'm just taking my bricks and then just dipping them into my ink pad. And I'm just going to pop them down and roughly. Just press that, and if we don't get the full imprint, imprint, in, imprintation, imprint. imprint. Yeah. Oh, it's getting late. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what? We ordered takeaway to here for the first time ever, and it's it's obviously it's filled my belly and just lost my brain. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's chicken. Uh, it was recommended by Liam and Andy. It was <laughs> for the first time ever. Oh. Yeah. To be fair, I'll give you that, Alex. Um, I don't think so. <laughs> oh, no, I didn't. <laughs> right, so I've got a bit of um, brown ink on here. chicken shop near here, <laughs> basically. Yeah, sorry, everyone. I'm just having a conversation in my head. <laughs> but you can see as I'm laying down this ink, it's not moving the same. You know, if I try and go into this area, I'm not getting... It's sort of going chalky then, where um, because the, the ink is not going into the paper and it's not smoothing over the top the same. So just spreading that around and then just trying to make it so that the brickwork looks a little bit messy, really. You know, it's not meant to look perfect. So then I've got one that I did a little bit earlier and I've left a load of space in the middle because that's where our fairy door is going to go. But then obviously if you wanted to add in some little darker bits, you could then go in with your actual pen, just add some brickwork textures. You can really build that up if you want. Obviously carry on putting as much ink on there as you want. Um, but I just wanted it to look a little bit like uh, just a brick wall and a bit messy. Yeah, but realistic. Yeah, absolutely. So moving that to one side again. So this is where we're going to put our little fairy door on. So I've cut it the same width and it's going to just pop on there. In fact, should we try it that way? Yeah, I think that way looks a little bit better. And then we're just going to pick this up just using some hot glue. So just popping that onto the bottom there. And then I'm just going to rough up these edges just using my scissors. Now, if <laughs> thanks for the warning. Was, was that you, Alex? Or? There was something in our ears. Watch yourself, be careful. But a good tip is you can actually just get a tool for this that is your distress tool. Yeah. So if you are someone that's a bit clumsy, like I'll, I'll say that about myself, I am. Um, if I'd slip like that, it's obviously better to slip with an enclosed blade exactly. than your scissors. Yeah. So definitely get yourself a tool. Yeah, they're on our website as well. They look yeah. like little round buttons, but it's got yeah. a steel blade in the middle. Yeah, of it, so. it's a really handy tool, especially if you like that sort of effect. So just layering that up onto the blue. So this is in our assorted cardstock bundle as well. Um, so you might get the blue, you might not, um, but mostly you probably will because we have got a lot of blue in the um, collection that we're bringing. Yeah. Now you get 50 sheets <laughs> for £7.99 pence in the assorted cardstock bundle. Have I got that here? Oh, it's under the mosses, right at the bottom. Oh, here. That's it, yep. We don't have enough room in the studio. I'll tell you what. Uh, <laughs> Not when I go. come in, you don't. <laughs> look at this. Look at the colourways in this as well. And look at that yellow. Wow. 
So if you fancy that, there you go, 50 sheets, um, and GSM, does it vary? or? Um, it's 300. 300 GSM. Yeah. Okay. In all those wonderful colorways, uh, just £7.99. That's a really good price, isn't it? For 30, uh, 50 sheets. 50 sheets of cardstock, PN2715. You've got dark green. Uh, it could be a black, actually. Dark green. You've got a yellow, a lavender, a pink, an orange, and also a... Uh, now that's like a greeny gold. Yeah, I use that a lot of the time for um, leaves and stuff like that. It's like a sage sort of green, yeah. isn't it? It's really it. pretty. Gorgeous quality. So yeah, Philly Boots, if you'd like, PN2715 for that one. Right, so we're doing um, a gatefold card then. So I've just added my background onto the inside of the papers and just adding a white panel just for writing on on the inside of there. So then... I'll just pop that in the middle and then I just want to add a bit of embellishment obviously I've got my fairy so the only reason I've pre-coloured her is because we're using the same colours and techniques as the fairy door so I've just already done her so she can pop in there and then we can add um, some of the and again she's postcard. really easy to colour in isn't she you've made she it she is that yeah there. that's it so then on the opposite side then I just want to use the postcards so uh, did you say they've nearly sold out Alex? We'll just double check to see. So just trimming these out. We've got literally two left of the postcard stamps if you want those. <coughs> so I've just trimmed that one out, but all I've done then is just taking water. I've used that same brown that we used before, just washing over this, just using that brown. So I'm back on watercolor card and you can see it just, it moves so easily on watercolor card. Like you don't get the lines the same or anything like that. It is just, it's fluid on there. So I would definitely recommend it if you are giving them a go. I think we should kind of mount a campaign to bring back the postcard. Yeah, I agree. I mean, email's kind of killed the postcard, hasn't it, really? Oh, I used to love getting postcards when one of my friends would go away on mm. holiday. Mm. And so they'd always arrive like a week after you got back. Yeah, home. true. <laughs> but you tried. Yeah. <laughs> Right, so we've just got those two little postcards then. So you do get two sizes in the stamp set. So just roughing those edges up again. Okay, we've got more people want it. It's sold out. Congratulations if we've got the postcard stamps gone, I'm afraid. Right, so then just adding these then to the top corner of here. So I'm just going to peel them up a little bit and they're just going to pop as little embellishments just over there. Makes it look more vintage, doesn't it? It does, yeah. So up the top there and then a little bit lower down. So then on the front of the card then we're going to add another layer. So it's going to be the exact same pale blue and then the roses from the blossoming blues. So we can just pop that over here and then a little bit of the blue papers as well mm -hmm. and then just in the middle then we're going to add our fairy door that we just built so that's just going to pop on the inside or the center there and we're only sticking the bit obviously that is on this gatefold part so it doesn't stick short like the last card so we can pop that in the middle there and then just before we finish off with our flowers i've just got one of the sentiments from the everyday sentiment stamp set mm -hmm. So just with love, and we're just going to pop that just as a little side note almost out of the side of there. And then we're just going to be using the suave swirls. So we're, just for a base for these suave swirls, we're just going to add some of the natural sisal. So just up this side. And the sizes we've got in the show in multiple bundles in different colourways as well. Which is again another signature dreamy look, isn't it? It is, yeah. It's something that's on all of our shows. <laughs> yeah. Now, Debbie sent a question in. Hi, Debbie. Um, now, ah. Debbie's in Hampshire and she says, Does Hayley make boxes? for her finished card. So how do you send your cards? Yeah, I do make boxes. Right. So if you get your hunky-dory scoreboard, it's really easy because you've got a box lid and a box base side, haven't you? Um, depends which you work in centimetres or inches, it's on both sides. And then, yeah, I tend to do it, it's usually about a half to three quarters of an inch in depth. Because your then, cards are quite dimensional. Yeah, that's it. Way. If I just show you this one, for instance, like it is a good half an inch or so 
of depth to that. So yeah, um, I just use 300 GSM cardstock and sometimes, depend if it's um, quite a delicate card, I'll sometimes reinforce it with like a, a second layer of 300 yeah. GSM. Good question, Debs. But yeah, very good question. That, that very much, but yeah. Yeah, that's it. I make them and then obviously I'm just showing them on the telly. It's yeah, never yeah. about sending them. Um, right, yeah, so we're using the Suave Swirls then this time. So this is a stamp set we've not seen today. So I'm just doing my favourite technique with these and just twisting those tweezers around them. Now the Suave ones, we've got those in the show. Now they're going to be a great price as well. Again, as with all of the stamp sets that Hayley brings us, we've got uh, the stamps and the dies together, okay? So there we are. And they look like they're dancing, don't they? So there's yeah. your stamps. And there's your dies. Even the dies to cut out the ferns as well. I mean, that's a lot of metal and a lot of stamp for your money. 19 99 for those. Yeah, that's it. And you do get really quite small flowers in that as well. So you've got a nice range of sizes. <laughs> like the um, flowers we had on earlier, the sensational flowers, they just then they don't go down as small. So they're really nice, mm -hmm. um, but it, they're really good for home decor. Whereas these ones, if you've got the smaller ones, they are nice then. If you think of the size, how small that is, it's like two centimeters. Yep. It's much better for your card making. So then just using my ball tool, just on the reverse of these, and then just flip them over and just press it in the middle there just to lift those petals back up. And just a little dab of glue in both, and then into the center there. So then just moving these to one side and then we can pop these onto our card up this edge. So again, starting with the largest, that's usually the way that I find it the easiest. Just go for the center and then work around. Mm -hmm. And we've got our slightly smaller one. So just arranging that so the petals sort of interlock with each other a little bit. Now the Sizzle Ultimate Bundle, we're going to pop on the screen for you. You've got nine packs of 20 grams. And that's a lot. That's a lot of sizzle because a little bit goes a long way. You've used the tiniest yeah. amount there, so. That's it. And I would say, to be fair, the amount that I've put on this card is probably more than... I just I put plenty in because I'm doing demos and it's just that like I don't want to run out. But yeah, it's probably less than a gram yeah. and it's also far more than you actually need. Like you can put so much less on than that and it still gives you the wispy sort of effect. OK, well, we're going to drop the price on the sizzle if you want the sizzle, sizzle, however you say it, 19 99 and you're going to get all of what you can see here, I believe. Is that right? It is, all yeah. It. Yeah. That's a, that's a lot. An awful lot. I'll show it to you when we've done the card. So we're just adding little tiny bits of moss in. So the moss that I'm using, it's either your mixed mosses, so your full collection, or it's the pastels that I'm using for this little blue. OK. So just adding in little bits to this arrangement and just popping that around the edges so it's really nice then for obviously framing your image and like you say it really just just lift the arrangement it's kind of instead of adding maybe die cut foliage it's just a nice little filler mm -hmm. so a, a great way for starting out especially if you've maybe not got a die cutting machine and in the earlier show i did show um, just some curled roses so again if you've still not got a die cutting machine you can still make flowers with that sort of technique okay. get your moss and then just um, fill it out that way and then just finally just got our little pearls to add on. So we'll go for three down there, three in the middle of our large one, one in each of them and one in each of the small. So I'm just gonna go for the navy blue again, just cause we've got that darker blue on the door handle and our pearl pickup tool as well. Yep. So just popping that just into the center of those pearls, picking them up. One of the best inventions ever, that pearl pickup. It is. It's literally the best product, I think, that I've ever bought. <laughs> and you've got a, a little metal post at the other end, which is like a, a, a mover, like an, a, mo a mover tool. So if you wanted to put something that you stuck down and move it slightly, uh, the metal end at the other end will do that for you. Yeah, to be fair, I needed that earlier because I dropped one of my pearls into my glue and it went dome side down. Oh. And then I was trying to fish it out with my tweezers and not even a part of my brain thought, let's take the lid off and use the actual pokey tool. <laughs> so that was what Dave was talking about. If you do want to use that as a little poker yep. and mover. And there we go. Perfect.
<laughs> beautiful card made from beautiful papers, which we've got, of course, the Blossoming Blooms paper pad. Uh, that's proving really popular. And of course, then we've used our dies and the stamps. Of course, the stamps and dies that we used is this one, which was, what was it called again? Uh, Swarf Swirls. Swarf Swirls. So Swarf Swirls, I can't get over the amount of dies you get, let alone the amount of stamps you get. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's 10 dies and 10 stamps. And you know, if you just want the outline of the stamp, you don't want necessarily the swirling detail in it. It's almost like it's been sand tangled a little bit. Yeah. It is, yeah. <laughs> Beautiful. 19.99 gets you both the stamps and the dies as well. Now, a couple of other things I just want to let you know about that we haven't even mentioned yet. The, the sizzle, um, we didn't show you the picture, I don't think so. Look at what you get. Each one of these packs is packed 20 grams full. Who thought pink sizzle, purple sizzle? Teal, you've got gold, you've got a kind of a rust color as well. Down there you've got black, you've got red, you've got ivory, you've got a gray. A tiny amount is all you need on a card or on a project and you get the whole lot, all of those packs, nine packs for 19 pounds and 99 pence. So that's basically about two pound a pack, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah that's it. Pack, which is amazing. And you just tease it and it will just go on forever. Well, it won't, but you know what I mean. It goes, <laughs> goes a long way. Um, one thing we've not touched on that I know we've got in stock um, the MDF. Now, I don't think we've got a demo with the MDF, have we? In uh, not in this show, no. but I can pop a bird out or a basket out if you wanted to see it put together. OK, uh, well, I'll tell you what, what, what caught my eye was obviously using the Blossoming Bloom papers yeah. on these little bird houses. Now, how cute are they? How sweet and adorable are these? Now, we have got this either available as a single sheet because it comes flat packed. So to make one bird house all lasered, by your other half. Yeah. <laughs> um, I keep him busy. <laughs> two pounds and 99 pence. He is the king of the laser after all, isn't he? <laughs> he is. There we are. To make one of those birdhouses, obviously it doesn't come papered. You've got to paper it or colour it or paint it, whatever you want to do with it. But it's absolutely beautiful. Having that, you know, hung in maybe the kitchen window or something would look really adorable. Yeah. I mean, Sherilyn was saying earlier on, you know, if you want to go to maybe um, make a wreath or a flower arranging class or something like that, mm -hmm. she was saying like the cost of that, it can be something like 70 pound upwards. Mm -hmm. If you want to get a few friends to Get. They get two packs of them, eight of you can do that for under £20, get a paper pad or use your stash and you can have a nice crafty afternoon for a lot less of a price. A lot less price. money, absolutely. Yeah. Well, have a look. If you want to go for four, four bird houses, four sheets exactly the same, but you can, of course, decorate them differently. You could even make them look like beach huts if you wanted to. Oh, you wanted that'd be cute. Four yeah. side by side. Oh, just do striped. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That'd be great. That'd be so cute. So we've got lots of you coming through for this for the multi-buy. So you'll get four little bird houses for not 11 99 You can have them for 9 99 All four sheets to make four of these. And you could sell one of those probably for 9 99 And you can make four for 9 99 We're limited stock on these now, are we? HO2761. They're really, really cute. Um, as an ornament or just just adorable and good fun to make as well. Yeah. So I just thought I'd let you show those. And I know we've also got, as well as that, we've got the watering can. So the watering can, it comes in, in pieces like this. But of course, uh, oh, hang on, what have I got here? Watering yeah, so can, you've got a, a gate. Set of four artboards, yeah, the back sheet, the big A4 one is a separate item. Ah, big fun, yeah. right. So you've got the gate, you've got the pot, and you've got the Wellington boots and you get the stands to put them in as well. So wellies, there's your ceramic pot or whatever. And the scorch marks, that's the laser. So you'll be covering that up with paper or paint or something like that. And then you've got your fence as well as the watering can too. Now all of those are 9 99 complete with stands as well. And just to give you an idea, if you're using any of the paper pads, what they could look like, there's the wellies, designer wellies, no less. Great, hey? $9.99 for all of those. And then the last one, which was, I wanted to get this in because I know um, Easter is very much on people's minds now for making for Easter fairs or that sort of thing. Um, you've got this really cute little basket, an Easter basket in MDF. Yeah, that's it. So it's up to you what sort of colour you want to do it in. Um, but it would look really nice in your spring yellows, whites, maybe put daffodils in it or something like that. Oh, it's like a little picnic box. It is, yeah, it actually opens. Oh, wow. And that's been decorated with the black and gold paper pad. Yeah. Which we've always run out of. Well, I'll, sh I'll show you that in a sec too. But it's been used, um, decorated with that. But you can make it bright and cheerful. You can make it dark. It's entirely up to you. But yeah, that sheet will basically make 
one of these. We're calling it an Easter Easter case, but it could also be, you know, for any any occasion and can store anything really that you fancy. So if you fancy that, that's on the screen for, for is it only four ninety nine? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, it's a cute little kit as well. And yeah. like I say, maybe if you put daffodils on there or something like that, yeah, it's, it's always going to be a nice little treat, isn't it, for anyone buying that on your stand? Absolutely. And bearing in mind, if you want the black and gold paper pad, here it is. Remember, all of the paper pads that Hayley brings us are loose leaf. They're also uncoated. So if you want to add other effects and that sort of thing, uh, get your inks out, all that sort of thing, you can do that. I love the script you've got on that. It's, yeah. it's almost like chalk on a board, isn't it? It is, yeah, definitely. It's really nice having like it's not a solid black that's in the background. It is more of a chalkboard, and it it's is. just it's not as harsh, is it? It is just a bit softened. Beautiful, absolutely gorgeous. It's been a bestseller. Uh, we can't keep it in stock for love and the money. Um, you've got your stripes there as well. I mean, that almost looks like suede or distressed leather. Yeah, it is like a crushed sort of gold look, isn't it? Beautiful, but still matte. So if you want to actually do your die cutting and stamping on that, you still can do. And you can fussy cut those flowers out if you want yeah. to as well, it's up to you. But it's already got that distressed effect and you're looking at uh, 48 loose papers for only £8.99. AW2705. AW2705 is your product code for that. And don't forget, we've got the water-based pens. We've got everything else on the website if you want to have a little look. Deal on stamens in a second, but I think Emily's uh, waiting in the wings to tell me what's coming up after us at 8 o'clock. It's the brilliant gem collector. Thank you so much. Yes, I am live in the world's largest gem store this evening and I've got some rather special pieces. Uh, starting off at eight o'clock with Savorite Garnet. It's the rarest garnet in the world. It's like a, it's like a million dollar emerald. It's got sparkle and a really intense green. Uh, beautiful stones in the sale as well. Fox's Rock's coming up at nine o'clock, which is a selection of some of my best picks, all brand new to be launched. And then at 10 o'clock, Last Chance Luxury. So there's some real special pieces, but only one left. So you might get an extra cheeky sale deal on those as well. I'll see you there, right here in about five minutes thank you emily Thanks i love guys. foxes rocks what a great show name <laughs> i love that Brilliant. emily's here in about uh, eight minutes now one thing i've not talked about and i must is this pollen heads now this is going to amaze you now when obviously an awful lot of what Haley does on demonstrations are making flowers with the fantastic stamps and dies when you've made them the icing on the cake if you don't put a pearl in the middle of it is to actually have very realistic looking stamens. Now, Hayley bought these to us for the first time, I think last time we worked together, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, it was um, brand new last time. Brand new last time. Now this is a bumper bundle of stamens. You only need one or two of these in a flower, but look at what you've got here. How many are there roughly? Approximately 1,600 in each bundle. So what? In each bundle? Yeah, so 6,400, did we say? No. Yeah, my producer can't believe it. Alex can't believe it. Yeah, oh, a 6,400 stamens. Each one of these is individual and they separate, but they're coming in bunches. So they come all nice and neat. You get black, you get purple, you get yellow and you get pink. The finishing touch to the center of any artificial flower is having stamens like this. And you just snip them because basically they're in little bunches. They do separate as well. Um, so just undo them when they actually come to you. That's not your price. 6,400 stamens. How many flowers can you make with that? An awful <laughs> lot of flowers. That's going to keep you going for months and months and months and months. Seven pounds 99 for all of that. I know, how crazy. Where do you buy things like this from? Where do you get them? Yeah, from? that's it, exactly. And uh, they're really nice as well. Obviously, like you say, poking through the middle of your flowers, but also if you chop them up and then just pop them in your arrangements, you can really make them extend and go even further. And because they're also, it's a one big bundle, but you've also got about 10 little ones in there. So if you think that is far too many for me, split them with your friends. Yeah, you can idea. just take three bundles out for you, three for them, three for someone else, well, that's, and then that's, split them up. That's two pound per 1,600. Yeah. That's ridiculous. Yeah. It's great. Right. That's it's ridiculous. It's not even a pe penny, is it? No, it's 200 pennies in two pounds. The calculator can't do it. It's a percentage of a penny. Nah, uh, nah, Linda stop. in West Sussex <laughs> in. Hello, Linda. Jane in the Channel Islands is in. Uh, hello, Linda. Hello, Trudy in Devon coming through for this as well. I mean, it could well be that you want to incorporate these in like um, can uh, canvases, maybe some mixed media projects, that sort of thing, where you want texture and you want vibrant colour as well. Um, it, it, put them into your ornaments that you're making. 
it's entirely up to you. But in the center of flowers, a stamen really does just kind of lift, elevate it to make it look so believable and realistic, as does the size, all that's in the show too. I mean, some of your kind of signature products are in, all in this show tonight, aren't they? Yeah, that's it. We've tried to bring a little bit of everything today. So you've had card making kits, MDF, and now we've got more of the stamping. Um, but yeah, I, I love working with all of it. I love that I get such a broad range as well. Mm. And also, quickly, the, 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 the set of stamps I had to get for Hayley because she mislaid hers. Yes, yeah, sorry, um, they're a bit inky now. Th this is going <laughs> to be all right. This is going to be one of those go to, must have. These are background snippets, I think we call them. Yeah. Um, and this is the brickwork. You've got a lovely kind of um, damask sort of uh, print and flourish there, which is rather lovely. Uh, I, there's something really joyous about musical notes, a musical score. I don't know what the song is, I don't know what the tune is, but it looks fantastic. And then you've got your script there as well. Is it, is it a fast one, Alex? Lots of quavers, because you're a musician. Alex is a musician. Yeah. Uh, yeah, he plays guitar, doesn't he? He does, yeah. Is that oh, good, do you? Is it a good song, Alex? Is it a song you'd recommend this one? Is it, does it look like a good tune? Bestseller. <laughs> yeah, number one. Try it, yeah, you never know. <laughs> Might make you a millionaire. <laughs> £9.99 for that then, ZN2735. Uh, ball tools, if you want ball tools from the Dreamies, one, two, three, four, four double ended ball tools for paper sculpting. Uh, you see Hayley using them all the time, you see Carla using them all the time, of course, shaping for carnation. Uh, they're great, they really are, and they're, they're good grip handles as well, but you get all four for £9.99. And, £9 and the rest of the Dreamies, uh, brilliant collections will be on our website if you go to hobbymaker.co.uk. All of our brilliant brands here have got brand shops on our website, so even if you've missed out on seeing maybe Hunky Dory earlier on with Anne-Marie, remember you can watch those shows back later on tonight if you want to, uh, watch back on the app, watch back on your TV, uh, or watch back on YouTube in future. Thank you, Hayley. Thank you. Safe journey home. And you. I'll see you in a couple of days. This is what's on next. <laughs>